lovely jewellery makers. <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing because we were just talking about our amazing camera crew who, you, you, you stay fairly stationary, don't you, for five hours. I said, I don't think I could do it because I'd get all dizzy. Time. And I was going, I would if I stood there that long. I reckon I'd faint or pass out as words I use. And Adam was like, don't be so dramatic. It's like, no, I would. I've actually fainted at five weddings. <laughs> five weddings. Just because you stood, aren't you, in the same spot. And they're normally in the summer, so it's hot. Yeah. See? I tell the truth. Tell the truth. No, and I was also crediting our camera team as well. Um, anyway, anyway, I digress. Because um, <laughs> we have got an absolutely super Saturday. Honestly, so much so I had to wear some of the jewellery, literally. So I know, I know. Take one for the team. <laughs> amazing, amazing goodies from start to finish. And I am joined by the very lovely, the uber talent that is beautiful, Yvonne. Good morning. You nice right, to my see darling? You. Yes, thank you. We, it's got, we've got some lovely things. We really we, do. Morning? We really yeah. do. And yeah. you as well. So that's oh, always well, that's wonderful kind. to have thank in the studio. Thank you. It's nice to be here. I love coming here. <sighs> oh, Yvonne. Oh, don't. It's... Your your kit today. I know. I know. Uh, I'm Projects. being completely spoiled. I re again. Um, I really have. I've so enjoyed working with both the, both the projects. Oh uh, well, we're looking at your nine o'clock projects right now, okay. and, I, and you mentioned there's there's been quite a reaction. Yes, to uh, these. Lots of interest in those. Yes. Wow. Because uh, we bring in the silver um, as well, and all the little solderable elements as all well. All the accents and mm. things. And this spinner ring. So the tool that you can see behind. Uh -huh is the spinner ring tool. It is. So they're a kind flare -a of- A flarer tool. A flare -a tool. A so it means that the, the rings in the center can actually oscillate. Yes, absolutely. <gasps> yes, they, the one, the little ones in the center, they, they spin. Yeah. And um, yeah, and the, the bigger ones, the out, the inner ones yeah. are flared top and bottom so they don't fall oh, They're off. so beautiful. They're so pretty, aren't they? So beautiful. Mm -hmm. And we've got everything that you need, uh -huh. plus the instructions, don't forget, yep. with the Vons project. So um, if you've never used a tool like this before, then you've got, well, yeah. walking and talking you through how to create such pieces. Plus you'll get the demonstration as well in the nine o'clock hour. And in the demonstration, I do have a special little tip Ooh. that um, I found out while using it. Oh. So I'll share that with everybody. A top tip. Yeah, top tip. Amazing. Well, yeah. we look forward to that. So that's at nine o'clock today. Your 12 o'clock kits. And I'm just going to put this one out there. They are some of the best pills I've ever seen. I know. Oh, yeah, unbelievable the reaction just yeah, from the they gallery are then. unbelievable absolutely oh, they're incredible oh my goodness now we've got two projects in the 12 o'clock hour um and you can see them displayed in that lovely silver box um you've got the white and then you've got the natural pink but they i don't know what the graphics say but they are some of the the brightest luster pearls the, the i've luster ever seen on them is incredible. they're mirror like yeah. aren't they i, I put yes. them ready to photograph and uh, even on the photograph on the pdf um, the luster just shines through look at this recording and that's the, the these are obviously the purple or colored pearls i should They're say because you've got pistachios in there yeah. too the white honestly these are insane but it's not only the pearls no no look at these oh my goodness me and what yvonne's alluding oh, yes, to there on the graphics there is that unbelievable class which is kind of like a broad bean shape it is exactly like a bean <sighs> and and it's a night ross was saying this morning it's a nice chunky one yeah. which goes with the the size of the pearls perfectly well also if you struggle with certain class you're yeah. not going to struggle like, you know you're not right. going to struggle with this you, you literally just just press squeeze them together it. yes Ugh. just squeeze it and it, they're just going you, you not that I've ever been in one, but you can imagine the door on a Rolls Royce closing. Yes. It's got that sort of yes. click. Yeah. No, I've not been in one no. either. <laughs> I've not been in one. Um, Adam's got a roller, so, you know, uh, is that what they call oh, them, rollers? You, do they call them rollers? I think they do. Yeah, Adam's is parked in the yeah. car park, yeah, so you can have a yeah. little go. 
talking of Rolls Royce, you know, I found this really lovely. It's so totally digressing. Um, you know, on Instagram, you see all these adverts. Yes. I found this really lovely company, and they make. I'm a fan of slippers. I love slippers. Yeah. It's a bit of a running joke in our house <laughs> how many pairs of slippers I own. Um, I probably it's not far off probably the same amount of pairs of shoes. No. I love slippers. I love them. You don't go outside in them though, do you? Sometimes. Mm. Sometimes. However, I found this company um, that makes slippers. Yes. With um, the offcuts of the leather that goes into Rolls Royces. Oh, my word. I know. So I, I, I and they're not as expensive as they sound. Were you tempted? Um, I, I bought two pairs. Oh, you did. One succumb. for me, one for my best friend. <laughs> right. And they weren't that expensive either because oh, obviously it's recycling, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, effectively, yeah. but they're so lovely. Oh, I bet they're gorgeous. So lovely. Yeah. And they, I, I imagine they do lovely colours too. Yeah, they're really, like proper. You know, like the proper old school yeah, slippers where lovely. they've got the stitching at the yeah. front. Yeah, really I nice. Them out. Um, so you can have. Slippers for best. Yeah, they're my bestie slippers. Yeah. They're my bestie slippers. Sunday best. See, I love them. I think I, if I could wear slippers all 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 day long, yeah. I would. Yeah. I totally would. Well, here, nobody would know. Would nobody they? would know. <laughs> nobody would know. Anyway, so that's your 12 o'clock. Stunning, stunning yeah. pearls. And another thing we've mentioned prior to today's show was that those pearls would look incredible alongside your deal of the day today now we have the wonderful dave stepping into the studio and you know what he brings you just the most unbelievable lineups time after time after time this is something that we've never done before i'm very very excited about um it's the giant clam shell for the very f you know the ones that the ariel comes out of like in the yeah. in the disney characters the beautifully sculptured kind beautiful. of frilled clam pearls it's those in jewellery well I say jewellery we've also got strands which I wasn't expecting no. to see um, so look at these across the t-bar the purest of white that I've ever seen um, I'm so excited Ross we've got them in the different sizes and they're full strand we also and you know I had to do this excuse the scratches on the back of my hand I'll try and cover those up um, but look at this ring that's circled with amazing natural spinel. Oh, it's spinel, is yeah. it? I was looking at it earlier. I wasn't sure what those stones were. How beautiful. Gorgeous. Unbelievable. So we have the matching ring and we've got drops. We've got additional clasps. Again, I think they would be absolutely perfect with the Vons project today at mm -hmm. 12 o'clock. So now, before we even mention the early bird, by the way, uh, oh, Ross is confessing that he's made an error. Okay. Oh, a fatal error. Error. If I look on my star by sheet, yes, yes. Gold plated, sterling silver spacer, elephant beads. 60 available at the lowest price of 19.99, which is amazing. If you go to the website, I think I know what's going on here. Oh, you've done that, Ross. Ah, so normally we like to crash the price, don't we? Well, that's your really bird price. You might as well shop ahead on these, everybody. Little elephant beads. Ah, oh, elephants are so popular in every aspect whenever we see them on our shows, be that in like a tassel. We've had little spaces. We've even had elephants on a strand yeah, before, have, yeah. and they always sell out. So I would encourage shopping ahead on those. Not massive quantities. We've got 52 of the gold and 31 of the rose. Um, so shop ahead on those. You've got your own little, and if you notice as well on that recording, they're all different. The elephants are all different. You've got, you've got different oh, yes. trunk angles. Look how lovely they are. Different trunks. You've got one upturned trunk, haven't you? You've got one kind of half. And then you've got the the matriarch mm, right, right at the bottom. At the bottom. There we go. Oh, there they are. Oh, amazing. Look how detailed they are. They're brand new and they are precious metal as well. Amazing. Absolutely loving those. So we've got them in all three colours. So I would encourage shopping ahead on those, everybody. Um, yeah. And I will talk about elephants as well, because any give every every opportunity there is to they're talk so about elephants. They're so beautiful, aren't they? And they're such nice natured creatures too, Amazing. Aren't they? They've so got to be up gentle. there. Got to be up there in terms of favourite animals on yeah, the planet, definitely, haven't they? Definitely. Elephants, orangutans, giraffes. giraffes dolphins oh. they've got to be up there as well i don't know texting that's a good so texting many. topic yes. isn't yeah, it what's your favorite lovely. animal 
Bruce, I reckon you'll be able to give us a good one on this. What's your favourite animal? Cat. A cat. A cat's your favourite. Yeah? They're very aloof. Is that why you like those? Well, like you. Like, like Bruce is aloof, he says. What's your favourite animal, Yvonne? Uh, well, I have two cats. So, yeah. But... Um, I like little meerkats. Meerkats they are great. They are so cute. They aren't are they? great, aren't they? They are funny, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I, meerkats are funny. Everyone wants to see the meerkats yeah, if you go to absolutely. the zoo. Yeah. I've got to say dogs are my favourite. Yeah, but I love if dogs we're talking too. about wildlife, I'm partial to a sloth. Oh, I like a sloth. God, so I think amazing. sloths are very relatable. Yeah. I can relate to a sloth. Um, have I got a story? <laughs> Has Adam got a story about animals? He was charged at by a sloth. You were charged. <laughs> Elephant and sloth, they're very different. <laughs> Adam was charged at by an elephant. When? In India? Oh no, what did you do? Ran away. <laughs> As you would. As you would. Oh, there you go. Oh, obviously. He hid, he hid in a bush. Were you on your own? You were some guys, right. What, a guide? Well, you were like in a group. Right, okay, they were in a group, don't worry, it was. So you didn't just go off, just just no, wandering no. into... It wasn't solo. <laughs> yeah, in that instance, you obviously, they obviously didn't take to you, Adam, for some reason. Because it is unusual for them to charge. It's, oh, it had a baby, so it's oh, being they get all very protective. protective. That's why. They? Yeah. And clearly, yeah. Adam, they saw you as a threat, clearly. Um, it was a wild elephant, not, not a... It was like Bruce, Bruce met a, a stag on the road, he was telling me this morning. Did you? Yeah. yeah it's a couple of weeks ago. That one. A couple of weeks ago, a stag. They're amazing, aren't they, stags? Yeah, yeah. Huge. Yeah. Absolutely yeah. huge. It was You drive into work and... Yeah, it was a surprise. Yeah. And they just stand there, don't they? I've had a similar encounter. So when I was driving back from my mum and dad's back here, um, and you drive past the Forest of Dean... Yes. Um, ...where there's lots of, obviously, stags and, uh, yeah. and deer, etc. Um, and I remember it's quite dark, and all of a sudden you just they see just this appear. giant yeah. stag just stood on the side of the road. Just yeah. They're terrifying, they but are... beautiful at the same time. Oh, well, we were saying they could do an awful lot of damage to your car. <laughs> they certainly they? could, certainly could. So, guys, what's your favourite? Favorite animals, Adam? Elephants, Elephants. are your favourite. Yeah, they've got to be up there. What about you, Roscoe? What's your favourite? An, an otter or a penguin? Aww. Yeah, otters are cute. The fact they hold hands when they're floating. Susan Kelman on her cruise last night, she was uh, with the elephants and uh, with the penguins and the seals and the, the orcas were swimming. It was a beautiful. I do it normally. Watch the, it, what, watching the orcas after the penguins and the seals? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, no, 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 they weren't after them. No, oh, that's they were just playing about in the sea. It was just gorgeous. That's, I mean, I know it happens, but yeah. you're just like, I, I, bet lots of, I bet lots of people were watching that. Last yeah. night. It was very They're good. beautiful animals too, very aren't they? Very beautiful. And, and very slow and yeah. elegant, which is not yeah. what you'd expect, really. No, not at all. Um, very smart as well. Now, text yeah. in. That can be yeah, our text yeah, in yeah. topic today, Roscoe. Favourite animals. Favourite animals. I think your sort of domestic pets are going to be up there, aren't yeah, they? Of course. But they maybe are, outside yeah. the box. That's if it was. We love them. We love our, <laughs> our furry friends, absolutely. Right then, shall we get cracking? Um, I'm going to start with. Uh, I, I was looking at this. What did you say? Yeah. I was looking at this earlier on. It's a lovely colour. Very paparazzi esque, actually. Yeah, very much so. Paparazzi coming at you. Sorry, Adam said that and I repeated it. I regret it deeply now. Um, do you remember them? Showing our age now, aren't we? Look at that beautiful, <laughs> a beautiful connect. You've got that wonderful that cyan lovely? red. It is lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Lots of ways that you can use this, obviously. You can connect multiple strands together. You could maybe use it in a ring or a bracelet or a lark said knot, macrame, all of the above. Um, get your messages in, everybody. We'd love to hear from you. The graphics say orange. I'm going to say this is more red myself. Um, it's a burns. It's a burns. Sorry, we do our... We do. <laughs> what was his name from EastEnders? <laughs> what was his name? Frank Butcher, oh, that's Frank, it. Frank, yes. Frank. Burns. Go on, Bruce, I feel like you could do this really well. a while ago. What, Yeah. <gasps> there you go. That was really good. Told you. Told you. Pet, 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 pet. Um, 
<laughs> it's a pound, everybody. Make sure you're checking out. Ah. Maker's got five. Neil and Linda, Linda and Rachel also getting four. Well done. Good morning, everybody. It's lovely to be with you this Saturday morning. It's the weekend. It's time to party. Well, no, it is, isn't it? Because we love working on the weekend. Yeah, we love it. Love it. Absolutely love it because there's no um, there's no bosses. It's just us. <laughs> it is just us. Well done, everybody. Stay where you are on those phone lines. Lots and lots and lots to sell. I just <coughs> realised there was a bit of fluff on that. Yours won't come with fluff. <coughs> um, shall we do some lapis lazuli and beautiful pyrite? Amazing. Lovely cut, this one. Amazing cut. You've kind of got that really delicate twist. Um, savvy shoppers... Oh, you know, it, it's you actually know. really quite heavy, isn't it? That I, I had, I picked yeah. it up earlier. It's really lovely. The pyrite's a nice dense yeah, stone, it's isn't it? It's um, really substantial. Yvonne, it's also a pen. No, it is. Wow. <laughs> One band. Burns. I can't do it. And I end up giving myself a croaky throat. <coughs> Hello, Rachel. My favourite are mice. They're very <coughs> cute and get a bad press. I agree. Oh. I agree. I don't buy mice. I like no. mice. They are very cute. I'm not sure how I'd feel about them being in my house. Exactly. Yeah, I think that's what we tend to think of, which mm. makes us squirm a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I don't it? like. Sloth is my spirit animal, says Lisa. Mine too, lovely. Mine too. I, I, I think. Have you seen my Have you seen my sloth impression, Lisa? Do oh you no, want to see it? I haven't. Do you want to see my sloth impression? You know, I've done this a few times, and I, I, I always, I always regret doing it. <laughs> Adam <laughs> says it's, it's the best thing you do. Right. Okay. Wait. Wait a minute. I love them. Spirit animal. I'm with you on that one, Lisa. Well done. Let's do what? Sorry. Uh, moonstone nuggets. <clears throat> I don't see any moonstone nuggets. I definitely don't. Look, I, I, it's not me on this occasion. No. No, okay. No, there's no nuggets. There's no nuggets. We've got a recorded. Don't worry. There you go. They've sold out anyway. Lots of you shot down on those ones. Beautiful adolescence, literally, that glides across the surface of them. Well done. Well done. Added to the rescue with the recording. Told you. I don't have them, though, you know. It's okay. We've got the photograph. Um, well done, everyone. If you keep an eye on the website, it is busy this Saturday morning. It's lovely to have your company, but lots and lots and lots of sellouts already. So um, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. There's still more one pound deals, by the way, so you can shop ahead on those also. Lots of sellout, 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 sold out. Sold out, sold out, sold out. All in a row, sold out. Look at all those. Are oh, we just going to chat for the rest of the hour? Because look, uh, <laughs> pretty much everything's sold out. What do you reckon about 50% of the deals have sold out, Ross? Whole row of pounds there, look. Yeah. Pounds. It's burned. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Every time I do that, it makes me cough. Um, there you go. Pounds. Loads of deals to bring you throughout the course of this Saturday morning. We're going to have a lot of fun as well. Keep those favourite animal text messages coming through. Don't forget that when you get to the top, you've got the elephants. And remember, that is their early bird price tag, so we've already crashed these. Ross, may, Ross, no, it's no we, Ross. I'm just saying, you know, I don't, Adam doesn't enter the products into the system. You know, Bruce doesn't do it. Yvonne doesn't do it. I don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we as a team. Uh, <laughs> Yvonne, she's such a team player. Amazing, <laughs> Yvonne. <laughs> it was all you, Ross. It was all, it was all you. But shop ahead on those, everybody, um, to guarantee your success. We love elephants, don't we? Absolutely love the elephants. Um, okay, moving on, moving on. What should we move on to? Should we do a close out deal on some beautiful white jadeite? Okay, is that the high goo that I can see? 
amazing. So this is Imperial White Jade. I once upon a time um, reserved solely for uh, um, royalty, of course. Um, <clears throat> ours is not dyed, is not bleached, is not polymer impregnated. Totally and utterly natural. I mean, for me, Yvonne, I would be setting a stone in the centre of that. Me too, definitely. How amazing a would that be? A sparkly red stone, I Ooh, think. Oh, very there. nice. Well, yeah. funny enough, actually, we've got some lovely rubies coming up ah. in this hour. So, yeah, just set one little stone in the yeah, centre. definitely. We shouldn't be saying the word close out alongside no. any jadeite. We all know that this is the top 10 rarest, one of the top 10 rarest gemstones in the world. We all know um, that it's one of the top 10 most expensive, particularly now, now more so than ever. So when we launch this, 149? No. Over 300 sold at this next price crash. We have 20 remaining, <clears throat> 300 already sold. Well, I'm not surprised oh, wow. 300 sold at 49.99. <clears throat> I was happy at the 149 previously. I mean, if you pop along somewhere, you know, your pillar and stone, your mason and K, you're not gonna see it at 50 pounds. If enough of you put this in your basket, we're gonna do a close out deal, jewelry makers. Ross is willing. Oh, oh my goodness. I've just heard the yeah. potential deal. If enough of you are there, it is worthwhile you joining us on the web and on the phone lines. So <clears throat> I'm not going to mention what Ross has just said because he says, I want to see how many of you trust him, but just take my reaction as a gauge. We have, did you say 20 or 30? 20. If there's enough of you joining us on the web, Lorna trusts you. Lorna completely trusts you, see Roscoe, as does County Antrim. You don't have to check out yet. You don't have to check out. Use this 60 seconds. Gigi in California trusts you, Ross. Hi, Gigi. Uh, that's it, that's it. Nobody else trusts you, Ross. <laughs> Nobody else trusts you, that's it. Uh, hang on, Ross's mum is watching this morning and even she doesn't trust him. <laughs> Melanie, you trust Ross. Is, you, is your fiance watching? Yeah? If she, if she is, she's not on... Rachel does, though. Rachel in Somerset trusts you. Yeah, you go. Ross's mum doesn't, and Ross's fiance doesn't. <laughs> they know something we don't know. <laughs> yeah. Tracy and Powers does. Tracy and Powers trusts you. We need 20 of you on the phone lines or on the app. Ten more people. Ten more people to join us, and then we will take it. Look, it made me gasp. Let's just put it that way. The price that Ross said is amazing if there's enough of you there bearing in mind not nearly enough we still need 10 people we still need 10 people Chantal and Christine have just joined us okay 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 now Julian Tracy <clears throat> how does half price sound yeah for imperial white natural jadeite if there's enough of you we will half that price remember over 300 of these have sold what at 49.99 which is unbelievable isn't it in 37 minutes se minutes it's gonna it's gonna disappear in 37 seconds isn't it let's be honest it's gonna be a sellout easily if you do what you're saying Ross half that price Gloria trusts you Ian trusts you Rachel trusts you Lynn trusts you and Cumbria as well <laughs> I, I trust you, Ross. I do trust you. 35 of you have it in your baskets. Are you ready? See how quickly these sell out. 300 natural type A Burmese genuine jadeites. £24.99. Over 300 sold at the original amazing deal that was 49 I mean, let's not lose sight of the fact we joke, you know, and all joking aside... This is one of the world's rarest gemstones. And also the Burmese mine, hundreds of years um, and history done in 2020. It's mined out. You know, if it's in the top five rarest gemstones in the world prior to that knowledge, what is it now? I don't know. I really should research it. I keep asking the question. I should. I should. I know it was in the top five before the closure. So what's it going to be yeah, now? Exactly. You know, but uh, it, jade I is one of the uh, gemological anomalies in, a, in effect it's so rare and it's only created because of the movement of tectonic plates um well done ian snapping up four of these at 
at that unbelievable price tag. Christine, you've got yours, County Antrim. I've got Maker, Karen, Denise, Gloria, Lynn, Rachel, Tracy, Julie, Chantal, another Tracy, uh, Rachel, G uh, Melanie, Gigi, Lorna, £24.99. Mm. But if I just flip it over, look, it's not a small high goo by any stretch of the imagination. You can also see that lovely translucency, that fine crystal structure. That, obviously, that colour will go with anything. Oh, it? Amazing. Yeah. Let me just for a second. I wonder, because you said a big pop of red. Yeah, I think didn't red in you? the centre. Maybe if I a kind sparkly, of... sparkly, yeah, something sparkly. Just imagine. Can you see it through there? Can you? If I position it right? No, you can't. i tell you what you will be able to see through. Imagine. Oh, look at that. Yeah, pop, pop a diamond yeah, in the centre. Or, wow, that would be very special. Or a, or a, you can even get your calibrated stones from Sierra Jewelry yeah, Maker. Can, yeah. So you give it the measure. And the little uh, the bezel cups yeah. to put them in. Yeah, yeah the mount. So how amazing would yeah. that be as a piece of jewellery, jewellery makers? I bet that makers? strand would go through the centre as well. Probably. So you could really just do a lark's head knot. Really Feed it through. It? Yeah. Perfect. Now, we've still got 12 available within our vault. There's 35 of you with it in your basket. Oh, I tell you what, I tell you what, just because we can't have 12 of them left. We've over 300 of these are sold previously. Look, let's just get them gone. You're about to see one of the most unbelievable deals on Imperial White Jade Eye in a high goo. You've got one minute at this price, though. That means everybody that's already confirmed and checked out, you also get this price reduction. That's ridiculous. It is actually ridiculous, isn't it? £30 off what was already an amazing price. We're making friends, absolutely. Um, make sure they do check out. You've got 51 seconds. I'll have to move on from this. Um, I mean, look at the quality. Again, you can see that smooth luster. That indicates a fine, a very fine, closely compact crystal structure rather than the coarse, um, where it becomes much more opaque and much more mottled. Still beautiful, don't get me wrong. Still very much valuable. But ideally, you want that melting ice cube-like luster. It's the purest of whites. And it'll, I'll never, ever be able to un uh, understand Stand, get my head around the fact that this is a gemstone that has been within the ground for millions mm -hmm. of years and yet look how pure that is and the polishing yeah. is absolutely beautiful on it isn't it unbelievable sorry Ross what was that Um, Ross is just saying I was hoping this, the, the clock would speed up because I've just looked at the screen and said it's type A white jadeite um, in pure white and it's under 20 pounds he said, you know, it's just that moment of realisation. It's just dawned on him how bad that price was. Well done, everybody. Great for you guys, though, yeah. of course. Um, let's do... Um, now, this comes with a strand, which is beautiful, by the way. Look at that. Oh, that's how lovely. lovely. Faceted jadeite. That alone. So what do we think? 149? I think 149, probably even more. Faceted eight millimetre rounds. You don't see faceted very often. No. Do you, do you? I, originally, Ross, I was going to say 199 at Jewelry Maker. And it's a long strand too, but you don't just get that. You also get some tassels with sterling silver. You also get the pegs, two peg bales. Yeah, do you see those there? Let me scooch them over a bit, that's better. But you also get a carved and drilled hands a hand. Oh, wow. And you also get <clears throat> an all seeing eye. You get everything. Wow. So this is like a mini project. Yeah, wow. Yeah. So I think we can work it out. Let me just double check. <clears throat> so you put your peg bales, of course, in the top of your mm -hmm. of your pendants obviously you can use your faceted type a jade eye apple blossom green type a jade eye as the necklace or the bracelet and beautiful. then you've got the additional tassels Absolutely there as well beautiful. here we go some examples now we are going to do a massive closeout deal this is a mini project kit effectively i have 10 available and yet yeah, 149 just for the strand on its own i think is amazing you want to look at it this way if oh. even if we sort of exclude the peg bales and the tassels and we just solely look at the jadeite findings here. Um, so a full strand, two carvings, that's 50 pounds yeah. each, yeah. which is amazing. Now the next price, we've got, how many do you say? 
10 available on the nose and nine of you already have this in your basket there's the all-seeing eye there's the hammers of hand so they're both very protective <laughs> that's incredible I'm, I'm actually lost for words on that Ross. there were three I, in the earlier graphic there were three beautiful pieces of jewelry yes. there as well that strand shouldn't be 39.99 the hamza hand shouldn't oh. be 39.99 the all-seeing eye shouldn't be 39.99 yeah. and don't forget you also get sterling silver elements with it too Apparently, though, the only reasoning behind this deal is because it's been within our, our uh, vault um, for two years. Two years. And Ross, he's not happy with that. I agree. No, do you know what I mean? It should be jewellery, though. It should be made into jewellery. We should be working for, uh, working with this. Obviously, when you see uh, opportunities of type AJ that like, moving forward, please know that this is not the correct price, even by our standards. Um, Ella, well done. Manchester, well done. <laughs> Multi buying. Lorna, Kathleen, Patricia, amazing. I think it's sold out. I'm not surprised. Yeah. What? Amazing. Um, now, the other day I brought you a big auction on at Guinea Mine. I've only got 20 of these left. Um, with the imminent imminent depletion of mogok ruby and it's on the horizon jewelry makers if you are a collector then mogok should definitely be um, <coughs> on your uh, on your radar um this is what it's all about let me just get a white piece of paper because you can see the true amazing color um when we're talking about ruby we're talking about that fusion really of that reds and pinks that's what equates to your pigeon blood um whilst it's not going to win awards on the most beautiful description no. um it is what uh the, the the best ruby in the world would actually look like um and this is totally natural now of the world's ruby from whatever location india thailand uh mogok wherever it might be guinea uh, um i'm trying to think mozambique all those different locations um, it's all about the colour, so it doesn't matter. Um, you can have the most amazing pigeon blood ruby from India um, that maybe surpasses that of Mogok. Um, so it's all about the quality. Now, of all those locations, less than 5% of the world's ruby is actually natural. Really most of it most of it will either be diffused or fissure filled or at least heat treated what you're looking at is part of that five percent wow it's totally natural um now we brought this to you on monday at the beginning of the week and we brought it to you for a massive closeout deal now prior to that show it had never been any lower than 79 pounds and 99 pence gorgeous shape too isn't stunning it? and they're big rubies yeah, they as well really you can are. really see that pigeon blood color it's not diffused it's not fisherville and i was t i told you a story didn't i i was saying look when my daughter's my my elder eldest daughter was born she's a july baby i said i'm going to treat myself to a ruby ring and i was of course thinking about here at gemporia but i fell in love with one that i saw it was actually a pre-owned piece of jewelry um in another jewelers i fell in love with it and i knew i'd have to pay a little bit more because obviously we'll uh -huh. get a staff discount um but i don't mind telling you this um they're little tiny marquise rubies tiny marquise rubies i think it's in 14 karat gold not a big ruby at all and it's diffused 100% diffused. I still paid £800. Mm. Treated ruby. These wow. are totally natural. And we were previously at 79 99 It's part of our coveted collection. So it's some of the best ruby we've ever purchased in our years. I <gasps> would be very tempted to put them with the white pearls oh. we have coming up at midday. Oh, can you imagine? Wouldn't they look pretty. They'd yeah. look amazing yeah. with the Vons pearls. Yeah. This is what we did on Monday. The final few that we have. Out of the 160 that we started with, we've actually halved the price. Can you imagine some of your guinea mine rubies in amongst them? Wow, talk about luxury. Luxury, luxury jewellery. Look at that price tag. Never closed previously, lower than 79.99, wow. which is absolutely amazing when we're talking about the natural quality. 
that pigeon blood color um, and the fact that it is totally natural it's not even fissure filled or diffused or even heat treated totally natural and um, to get carrot weights like this of ruby the king of all gemstones um arguably one of the most expensive for one of those at 39 mm. is amazing um and, and again i remember speaking um repeating the story i asked steve years ago i must have been feeling quite brave because it's quite a cheeky question <laughs> um but i asked steve bennett our founder um uh, years ago i was like what's the most expensive gemstone that you've ever bought and he was like ruby hands down ruby really? and it doesn't it didn't surprise me in the slightest ruby can command huge prices especially when they are of natural quality 39 pounds and 99 pence for the final few of these jewelry makers so make sure you do check them out again big solitaires as yvonne pointed out yeah. and they would be lovely alongside um yeah your white pearls that the are coming up at 12 o'clock amazing and we don't see ruby very no. often do we well it's very expensive very expensive to source now we also have and these were a big can i borrow um bruce can you pass me yvonne's amazing pearls the white ones just because they're a natural they just deserve to yeah they deserve to be together i think ahead of that thank you bruce um so again was this on the weekend it was wasn't it um it was on the weekend i launched them on sunday and over 150 went. They were a previous deal of the day. Now, um, I'm just going to show you Yvonne's amazing masterclass that's coming up. Some of the best pearls I've ever seen. These are incredible. Mirror light luster. But look at those. And the reason why I've brought those over, they're amazing, aren't they? They're absolutely insane. Look at that luster. But wait until you see the ruby. Natural. That's incredible. They did, yeah. Ross is just saying they went far too low in terms of their price point. There are only 20 left, though. Those. Natural red ruby, pigeon blood colour. I don't have the time to go into the big uh, sort of no. conversation, but we were talking about the quality of the colour. That's insane, isn't it? £14.99. Yeah. Um, yeah, Ross is like, that's far too low. These are the three mil, so the graphics on your screens right now for the three millimeter. Look at that color. But it's not even, I did, yeah. I know, I know. Um, they're just saying how low that price is um, in the gallery. But it's not just one, is it? It's the whole strand. It's a full 38 centimeter strand. Um, being three millimeter, there is loads on there yeah. they, that you can use them and use them and use them. It'll yeah. go on forever. They would also look amazing with your uh, giant clown. Oh, wouldn't they? Yeah. Amazing alongside that too. That's coming up with our lovely Dave today. Um, so yeah, if you want that combination, we are talking high-end jewellery here. Look at the back of my hand right now. Talking summer jewellery oh, there, Oh, my goodness. Na uh, giant clam, that's been launched for the first time today. You can see the ring as well, which, uh, you know, we actually accented as well with your red stones. Um, so you've got the giant clam and Yvonne's beautiful white pearls, the perfect combination. I agree, they did go far too low, Ross. Go. Phone lines have gone crazy. Are you disappointed? You're not cross, are you? You're just disappointed in me, aren't you? Are you ashamed of me? <laughs> oh. oh, they're really disappointed. Oh, dear. They're not angry, but they're really disappointed uh -huh. with that price tag. I'm not sorry. There you go. There you go. I'm gonna just I'm just gonna channel my inner Tiggy, by the way. I'm gonna be defiant with this. I'm not sorry. That price is really good. It was a deal of the day. It's a deal of the day. I'm not sorry. <laughs> That's a typical three year old yeah. saying is I'm not sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Um, <laughs> shall we do are we doing the two mil? Yes. They would be perfect with your projects, though, Yvonne. Yeah, I know. They're, they're incredible. Oh, if you miss Sunday's show, maybe you have places to be. Because I think, I think you've got... What I did in, in my project, I felt that they needed to be separated, yes. to be seen individually. Yes. And with those, you, can, you don't need to put just one in. You can, no. you can put several in. Well, the other thing I actually did, I'll show you this. Hang on. Bear with. I'm just going to pop that down. Hang on, the other thing I did, Yvonne, because I was saying we've had lots of tassel tops lately, haven't yes, we? Yes, we have. So I was like, can you imagine? Because you yeah. know that Ross is going to know what earrings I'm talking about right now, but can you imagine? Oh, look at those. Those in an earring. Yeah, look at that. Can you imagine? How beautiful is that? <laughs> do <laughs> Ross is just saying, do you know, what's in, do you know what is embarrassing, <laughs> Elle? You... 
<laughs> did those two strands for less than thirty pounds? He says the th the three mil on their own should be that price. Yeah, I I, I mean I I'm not. I'm not in disagreement, but I think I'm all about the deal, see, Ross? It is mad. It is mad. And that's why the, hundred of them flew. The tassels that Susie could make with those. Oh, yes. Be Wouldn't they be there lovely? Look go. from there. These are red carpet worthy. That's yeah, natural incredible. ruby. Not nearly enough of you on the phone. Look at the quality. I mean, I've literally just bunched them together, in effect. Not even, you know, positioning they them look out. They incredible. Amazing, aren't they? Yeah. And that's what I was doing because we've got that photograph, haven't we, with like the parrot? I think they're Cartier earrings. They're quarter of a million, by the way. Um, <laughs> they're like they're, they're yeah. There's a parrot, and then you've got a big tassel of faceted ruby underneath. Look absolutely wow. amazing. Now I don't know about you. I haven't got a spare quarter of a million pounds that I can justify by spending earrings, buying earrings. Um, <laughs> Ross is saying, uh, not Ross. Sorry, Adam was just saying he'd have to sell his rolls. Yeah, you're Rolls Royce. Um, hi, <laughs> Diane in, Chan in Channel Isle saying, I can't choose a favourite as all animals are my favourite. But I, ha I have been, what's that? A, a sponsor to a pangolin. I love pangolins. They're so funny, aren't they? Aren't pangolins, th they're endangered, aren't they, pangolins? They're the ones with a shell. They've got like this kind of shell. They're very cool, very, very cute. Hello, Jan and Austin just saying, hi, jewelry maker, I love a giraffe. Probably because I'm actually very short. Um, the views from up there must be amazing. <laughs> oh, bless you. Yeah, giraffes are very graceful, they aren't they? They're very elegant, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, very graceful. I was asked the other day by, it, oh, it wasn't the other day, it was a couple of months ago, actually. Tiggy was like, what did giraffes say, mummy? Um, I was like, uh... They don't really say anything. No, no, of course, they don't accept that answer, do they? No, no what did your heart say? <laughs> so all I could think of was doing this. Because that's all they do, isn't it, really? They don't make a noise. Do giraffes make a noise? I don't know. I don't know what noise. Oh, so no. I just did it. They lick a lot, don't they? <laughs> that was the only answer I did, could did come up with. Did she have an answer? No, no? She, she, she accepted the lick. Oh, thing, okay. Yeah. okay. She accepted that. She took that one. Um, now, yesterday, we had the most amazing, I'm keeping your pearls for a second, if that's all right, Yvonne. Yeah. Um, we had the most unbelievable two millimeter black spinels. Today, we've got the four and the three mil. Um, big quantities of these. Black spinel is, you know this, that's is one of my oh, all time oh, favorites. Oh, yeah, exactly. It's, it's just full of sparkle. So imagine those earrings. Yeah, with those rubies, they'd be absolutely amazing, wouldn't they? So let me just double it over. Imagine those earrings, but instead of, or as well as the ruby. Wow. Oh my goodness, they're so elegant. Beautiful, aren't they? Look at those, they're gorgeous. Oh, amazing. Now, do you know what else they'd look incredible with? The pearls. And the giant clam, wouldn't they? They'd be amazing with the giant clam. Chanel. Very Chanel. Now we've got these two, and these are rounds rather than the more rondelles that we had yesterday. Um, I'm going to start with the what, sorry? The four millimetre size. Let's put those pearls back there because they look amazing. So these are the four mil just here. So I'm going to start with the four mil and then we're going to bring you the three millimetre. But again, they'd be amazing alongside the giant clam as well. 19 pounds and 99 pence. Bearing in mind, this is a totally natural, genuine gemstone. Um, no enhancement to this whatsoever. Look at that light performance, performance as it hits the exterior of every single facet. Now we are at 20 pounds. But we're not stopping there. Did you say we've got a big quantity of these then, Roscoe? 68 available opportunities. And 68 of you, unless there's multi-buyers, are going to get the four millimetres for under £10 today. Bringing you a three mil in a few moments. But again, look how amazing it looks alongside the giant clam that's been launched today um, uh, with Dave at 10 o'clock. Unbelievable, Incredible. absolutely unbelievable. And we mentioned Chanel just then, Yvonne. Uh -huh. Chanel works with synthetic stones. You're working mm. with genuine gemstones. Mm. It's incredible. Look at that. They are, the sparkle is just unbelievable. Of all your black gemstones, of course you've got black diamonds, you've got onyx, yeah. you've got jadeite, yeah. just to name a few. Black spinel is the most performing of all of them. Yeah. 
I do have to say it is one of my favourites. Mine too. Yeah. Mine too. I love doing showcases of black spinel. Right now we're talking about the four millimetre strand, which is these, uh, and they are your rounds as opposed to your rondelles. So depending on what your preference is. In four seconds, we're taking it under £10. We've got 65. Do you know what, Russ? If these don't sell out, I'll be snapping up a few of these. You know, you amazing. Incredibly, we've still got some of those rubies still available. Let me just reach for them. Because I think... If your budget allows, imagine this as a combination. Imagine that. Say you were given that as a project. Just think of the jewellery that you're going to create oh out of those. Oh my word, look at that. I know, incredible. There's a clasp as well. How amazing is that jewellery going to be? Mm -hmm. We had 65, I think Ross said. We're talking about the four mils right now. You can still get hold of those natural rubies and they are natural also. And then we're gonna be bringing you the three mils. These amazing pearls are coming up at 12 o'clock with our lovely Yvonne. But I need to point out they are obviously with that quality much more limited, so be quick on those. Kathleen, Renfusha getting two. June, Lynn, Norman, hello to you. Amanda, hello to you. Kim, Janice, Susan, Manchester. Hamida in uh, Northamptonshire. Paula, hello to you. Maker, hello to you. Louise. Um, make sure you do check out your baskets everybody um, to guarantee your success nine pounds and 99 pence we're talking about this strand right now this is the one that you're going to be getting so I don't want to confuse anybody um, but look at how amazing they are and they're totally totally and utterly natural um, look at that stunning and we've again we've shown loads of I love doing showcases on black spinel because you, this, it's such a celebrity adorned gemstone you know, think about that Michelle Yeoh necklace that she wore to oh, the, I think it's the Cannes incredible. Film Festival. Yeah. And she's just got like literally drapes of black spinel across, yeah. the, across her shoulders. So effective. So beautiful. Yeah. Right, let's do the three millimetres now. I love mixing the sizes together, actually. But again, if I just rock my hand back and forth, look at that amazing surface luster. Or you could go for the tassel. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Now, first price crash. Talking about the three mil. 9.99. These are a, a natural, genuine gemstone, but we will go lower, jewelry makers. There's 18 and a half carats. Have we got quantity of the three mil? We were talking about the fact as well. I remember when strands like this were 14.95. Yeah. Black spinel. Um, and that again, we'll just go on and on and yeah. on. I mean, you, you dot them around, you, you, maybe you shouldn't use them as spacers, but it is so nice not, to just yeah. dot them in there and get that sparkle. Yeah. Get fourteen ninety five was a great price as well, it's an incredible. absolutely amazing price. It's yes, a I've genuine paid gem. Fourteen ninety five for them before. Yeah, me too. Yeah. When we first started bringing yeah. the more micro cut gemstones yeah. in Spinel, yeah. um, they were. I, I remember it clear as day because I remember Fleur and I buying them on air yeah, at fourteen ninety five yeah, when we, we first used launched to get the them. Gems of distinction, ones, yes. didn't we? Now we're bringing them to you at nine ninety nine, but yeah. actually going lower. These are your faceted three millimetres. Straight away, we've got confirmations being made. Congratulations, everyone. Again, the perfect, perfect uh, partner, I think, for your giant clam or for Yvonne's amazing pearls. And they are, they are something... You, you, can, you need to keep them in as stash. Yeah. They are not for, for make... You don't have to make immediately with no, them. No, it's no, no. It's just nice to have them there so that when you need them... Well, you that's what them. Susie said yesterday, oh. actually. She was saying these you'll use them yeah. repeatedly. Oh my £6.99 word, pence for a natural black spinel. Yeah. Faceted and polished to perfection. It's all about the Gorgeous. faceting and the polishing in black spinel. Um, because otherwise you wouldn't see that lovely, we always say it, paparazzi flash mm -hmm. um, from each of those wonderful uh, cuts. Absolutely beautiful. So wait, should we just do... with the? I'm just going to put the pearls to one side for one second. Everything that's on the back of my hand right now Roscoe so let's do it let's do a tally a tally up say you wanted to get all four strands you can get all four for 44 pounds and 96 pence with ruby with ruby and natural spinel wow. how amazing is that 
Leslie, Hamida, hello to you, Northamptonshire, Christine, Amanda. Um, I'm surprised that these haven't sold out already, if I'm honest. I guess it's Saturday morning. Six ninety yeah. nine. No. Crazy. Wow. Absolutely crazy. And um, we've also got, look, this little guy. Imagine one. Imagine putting that alongside. That'd be beautiful too. <coughs> Amazing. Now, 925 sterling silver. It's your lovely snake, snake connector. Um, measuring 45 millimetres. Add all of that and you can make this project, if you like, for less than £60. £14.99 pence only to get hold of this. Your early bird is coming up. Lots of you have shopped ahead on your lovely little family of elephants wow. or herd of elephants. Um, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So it's a lovely double connector. So you can imagine that sort of asymmetrically if you wish. Stay where you are on those phone lines now. Running out of time this hour, it's going so fast. Um, but up next, yeah, it's always a firm favorite. I think, what you know, whatever aspect, whatever, in jewelry and other inspirations, um, beautiful sterling silver elements in your elephants up next okay now we are going to show you the little herds of elephants I'll prop them upwards um, and I'll talk to you about very quickly, I hold them up with the tweezers, each and every single one of them. Um, what your elephants actually re uh, um, mean in jewellery? What, what do they actually represent? So elephants represent strength and good fortune. They also symbolise also symbolize health and happiness and are thought to promote spiritual well-being in our daily lives. Um, elephants are strong and nurturing. They are loyal to their families and determined and protective. Elephants remind us to always be true to ourselves and keep those that we love close to our hearts. They also teach us that with a little strength and determination that we can overcome any challenges that arise in life. In Hinduism, elephants hold a, a sacred symbolism. The Hindu god Ganesh, uh, Ganesha, sorry, Ganesha, Ganesha, uh, features the head of an elephant and is thought to bring good luck as well as representing wisdom. So, I mean, we could talk about this probably for hours if we had the time. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of meaning behind elephants, aren't they? I think lots family. Of, yeah, lots of people collect elephants. Yes, true. And I do have to say my preference would be uh, to do all three, to do one of each color. Yeah. They love well. We've got all three colours yeah, for you I, as well, I do, I and do each elephant like is different too. Every single one is is different. I mean, look how lovely he is. Um, you don't get that in a set very often, do you? Where all three are, are individual? No, absolutely not. So um, shop ahead on these. I would encourage it. Now let's have a little look at some elephant jewellery, shall we? Just so we can get a little bit of inspiration. Oh, um, you've got a lovely turquoise elephant bracelet stack. I don't know if that's nine two five sterling silver, if I'm honest. But there's one little elephant charm 164 pounds but so sweet aren't they and appealing because of the elephant and the turquoise don't get me wrong um, but 164 pounds like uh, there again these would be perfect to actually create um, any kind of design like this so you've got the herd of elephants just here the family bracelet um, 175 pounds really lovely that. you know just one elephant charm is kind of sending it might be a sort of a hidden message you might be wearing it because of your sort of the, uh, the family ties yeah, because it's got meaning to meaning you behind it yeah. absolutely uh clobo there you've got a simple stretchy bracelet um using some sterling silver spacer beads that we bring to you on a regular basis there uh 91 pounds just one little elephant charm but look how beautiful that is 91 pounds you can make that or even oh. something as simple as a macrame bracelet so um, that's a flat silver charm again i don't know if it's 925 and or then even just mark... the black spinel that we oh, just lovely. had on wouldn't that look lovely that would be beautiful um so that's a flat charm whereas yours is three-dimensional um and front and reverse as well your drill hole let me just double check yeah is is, is sort of um head to toe so it can he could be horizontal if you like or she i should say um they're amazing species now we've got 50 of the yellow gold and Ross did make a mistake it was all his mistake <laughs> <laughs> he priced it up at your final price he said you've got 2.75 grams of beautiful sterling silver with your gold plating look how lovely they are different designs as well different elephants 
£19.99. pence. These are brand new, but they're very, very, very limited, sadly. Look at that lovely detailing. I definitely think the one at the front is the matriarch of the herd. Yeah. He looks like the matriarch. And the one at the back looks like the baby, maybe. See the big ear on yeah. the first one. Can't lovely. You? Absolutely gorgeous. Now, nineteen ninety nine. so that's working out at what? £6.66 per elephant charm, which is incredible when you look at it like that. You know, if you go into somewhere like uh, Pandora for an elephant charm, they're not going to be six oh, six sixty six. No. Now, Ross is saying, Elle, I'll be honest, I thought these would have sold out by the time we got to this auction at £19.99. For that amount of silver, for that amount of detail, when you compare it to, say, that macrame bracelet at £24.99, it's an absolute deal, because you've got all three of them as well. Now, if and you... £24 isn't, that isn't expensive not for that at bracelet. All. No. Not at all. Um, let's be honest. Right, it's Saturday morning. You might be having a little lie-in. Yeah. Perhaps you've had a busy week. You might be walking the dog, I don't know. But it's a little bit quieter than we normally experience at an 8 o'clock hour. So I tell you what, we, are, we always say we are reactive. We have to be reactive. It's live TV. It's very different to uh, sort of like a, a shop. So I tell you what, it's Saturday morning. Quieter than usual. A minute clock, we are going to be reactive and take that clock even lower because what we don't want to do as a shopping channel, you've got to remember, it's not a case of, with shopping channel, you, time is, is, is a big factor for yeah. us. So it's pointless me talking about them for a length of time and then only selling maybe 10, time 20% of them. Time is expensive when you're broadcasting. Very, very it? much so. So we want them to sell out and we've only got 50 of them anyway. So I tell you what, we're going to drop that price tag for you, jewelry makers, and uh, reward those of you that are yeah. up nice and early this Saturday morning. And yellow gold is so <sighs> popular at the moment. My favorite always. Yeah. I would put them with those black spinels that we had earlier on. Yeah, I think that would look beautiful. Imagine. That is a, either a necklace or a bracelet. And then just one. Come on, little elephant. Have your little elephant charms sat inside. Look how pretty that is. Oh, that's gorgeous. Beautiful. Yeah. Even I could make that piece of jewellery. We're going to do it and accept the consequences. <laughs> <laughs> that's fine. That's all right. It's, 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 it's Saturday morning, I get it. Some of you might have had a lie in. Yeah. That's what it, five pounds for a gold plated sterling silver charm. Incredible. But it's not just a flat charm, is it? It's not, no. it's very detailed. Has oh. it got, have they got the same detail on the back as well? Yeah, they're three dimensional. Wow. It's gonna be upside down for a moment, but look. Yeah. Front and reverse. Oh yeah, look at that. Sorry, little elephant. And that's just one I've got. Ah, turn me back. Um, you get three of them. Look how sweet they are. At £14.99, pence. this is the gold plated. We've still got the rose gold to bring you as well, lovely jewellery makers, um, and the silver. So um, be ready for those. These are quite limited, though, in their quantity. Geraldine snapping up three. You've got a definite herd, haven't you there, Geraldine? I, I love those with the black spinel. They're yeah, beautiful. beautiful. Mm. So, so pretty. And again, I would be tempted by all the different colours. Um, because you could almost show different personalities that way. But look at them, lovely, absolutely beautiful. If I put them on the back of my hand. There you go. Calm down, you. There you go. Amazing. Oh, this one's got, look, this one here. It's like, no, I'm going in this direction, look. Oh, got a mind of its own, that oh. one. I love them, absolutely love them. We only had 50 of those. So Manchester, Valerie, Emma, London, Renfusia, Amanda, Geraldine, Leslie, uh, Laureen, Kathy, Denise, Genoefa, Anita, Brenda, Veronica, Neil and Linda. Um, lots of you are asking for the silver. We will bring them to the other side of the break, the silver yeah. um, in the elephant. So they're coming up as well. Um, we have 160, so they're actually quite limited as well for silver. Yeah, that's space not a lot for silver, is it? No, normally we. What I would have hoped for is something like oh, 300. Yeah. Um, but still, we've got 160. They're coming your way the other side of the break. Um, so make sure you're ready for Can't those. I believe you get three in a pack. I know. One of them at 14.99 yeah, would be exactly, amazing. Yes. You know, if you do pop into somewhere like uh, Pandora, I mean, how much would their elephant charms be? I, I, I generally I don't, don't know. I don't think they sell anything for 14.99 at all. I don't do think they? so either. <laughs> I don't think so. They are they are quite expensive, aren't they? Yeah. Very successful. Oh yeah. You know what and, they're doing? Um, very they're, successful. Very pretty though. though yes. Stuff. No, no, I wasn't knocking it. No. But, uh, it just shows what good value ours is. Absolutely. Compared to that. We're very different to them. Though we don't have yeah. the shop front, no, do no, we? No. And the models that we have to pay for and things like. 
like that um, because they do they spend a lot on their marketing actually they do um, places like Pandora still got time to get involved on the yellow gold let's bring you the rose there isn't many do you know I've really noticed a difference in how the popularity of rose mm. gold because um, there was a time when it was it was I don't want to say least that's the wrong word but it wasn't um, as popular was wasn't it? as popular no. as the silver it wasn't as popular as the yellow now rose gold often actually sells out faster than the other colors um again look at these um elephants in rose gold absolutely i think oh, they work so beautifully gosh, together look at those that coppery color gives that, it really compliments look how them. it matches the skin that color doesn't it yeah rose gold is such a pretty a precious metal isn't it yes. You know. Extremely, and when you think back, uh, um, well, certainly my my granny, the, the old granny, she used yeah. to wear rose, rose gold. Rose gold, didn't yeah, they? I remember. Yeah. I remember. It's just a small amount, a trace amount of yeah. copper added to the gold yeah. to give it that yeah. lovely it blush. It was always pink. very coppery. Yeah, the, stunning. The gold. Fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence. That gets you all three. Make sure you check out those because we had a more limited uh, quantity of them. Um, so yeah, you've got your different types of elephants there as well, haven't you? Very beautiful. Again, they would be amazing alongside that black spinel strand that I just <coughs> can't, haven't taken off the back of my hand there. Just simple, stretchy bracelets. So really easy construction. Amazing piece of jewellery. They make takes... nice earrings, you know, yes. those, wouldn't they? And you're right, elephants have got to be up there, haven't they, in terms of popularity? Definitely, definitely yeah. Got to be. Just the fact they mourn. They mourn their oh, young. they cry. They cry and they remember sort of where that elephant oh, died and so passed away. Yeah. They, um, the whole herd so nurtures sad. the babies. Yeah, they do, yeah. They're proper family animals, aren't lovely, they? Lovely, so lovely. Fourteen ninety nine, well done. And do you know they can feel vibrations through their feet? Can they really? Elephants, yeah. They communicate through their feet really? as well. Oh, I didn't know that. Uh, yeah, and if they stepped on a daisy, <coughs> they don't me. always damage it, which is con amazing considering that they are as heavy as wow. they are. They're very, very light-footed, in actual fact. Um, true story. True story. Yeah, no, if they stepped on a daisy, they wouldn't actually squash it. Well, I, I don't know how true it is, but I read that somewhere. And they can feel. They feel <coughs> with me. them. With their feet. Does they really? Yeah, they feel... They must be very sensitive. Though. Very sensitive mm. through the bottom of their, 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 their toes. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. Do stay where you are on those phone lines. The silver elephants are coming up the other side of the break alongside Yvonne's amazing project. You're going to love this. All about the wonderful technique that is the spinner ring if you've never done it before you get instructions with your project and you've got the tool for the job as well don't go anywhere we'll see you after this here at jewelry maker we only charge one pmp throughout the day you can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Hi Jewelry Makers, Yvonne here. I'm just popping in to let you know that I'll be back in the JM studio on Saturday the 17th of February. I'll be with Elle, Ross and the team. So looking forward to catching up with everybody then. At 9am I'll be bringing a, a tool that's new to me. Uh, it's the Ring Flare tool and I used it to make uh, beautiful spinner rings. Um, these are the ones that I made and um, I'm hoping you'll enjoy using it as much as I did. So I'll be, I'll be demoing that in the 9am hour. Uh, and then in the midday show, we will be bringing you the most beautiful, I've got them here, the most beautiful Baroque pearls. They are very, very, very special. I hope you like those. Look at the colours in those. I haven't started making with them yet, but I'm looking forward to, to using them and see what we can come up with for the demo at midday. So hope you can join us then. Look forward to seeing you. Bye. Are you new to Jewellery Maker? Well, we want to help you on your jewellery making journey. When you purchase with us for the first time, you'll receive the Jewellery Maker Handbook, 
which is filled with 35 different techniques, as well as lots of hints and tips to help you on your way. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Hi, I'm Natalie Patton and I'm a guest designer on Jewelry Maker TV. I'm going to be back on the show on Sunday the 18th of February with the return of the Gemstone Garden Collection, which I'm really, really excited about. So if you missed your first time round on the launch, please come and join me. Um, the collection features 12 unique, lovely little birth flowers that represent each month and they are adorned with a matching birthstone. So we've got black diamond, we've got opal, sapphire, ruby, emerald, they're absolutely gorgeous. And they are 925 sterling silver. They've also been designed so they're really versatile for you to use with any jewellery making technique. So whether you're a metal smith, a bead stitcher, a um, macrame maker, a wire worker, you can use these to create some lovely personal designs as well as this lovely little um, plantable wildflower seed card. This time round, it's also going to come with a PDF on how to create a lovely adjustable ring. So you can use this to create um, a piece of jewellery that can commemorate a loved one, celebrate a birthday or a special moment or occasion. If that's not enough, We've also got the launch of some really lovely um, carrier charm clasps with gorgeous coloured cord. And in the masterclass, I'm going to be showing you a variety of different macrame techniques that you can use to make some very lovely jewellery. So please come and join me on Sunday, the 18th of February on Jewellery Maker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Welcome back everybody. Oh, very, very excited about this project. Can I just show everybody your yeah. instructions, Yvonne? Of course. Um, so you get these with the pur purchase of um, Yvonne's project. So that's available upon dispatch of your order. Um, you can download it, print it, save, a, save it, whichever you wish. And this is all about spinner rings, which are very Piaget. Yes. Very, very Piaget, because they were the first, that was certainly the first spinner ring that I saw, um, where you had that central, central the, ring that the, went yeah, around, oscillates yes. around. Yvonne, these are absolutely, so I think we just moved that desk again, uh, these are absolutely beautiful. Thank you. Look at those. I tried to um, put different methods on the spinner rings, uh, so much, some are twisted, some are plain. Um, I've soldered little elements onto some Look of them. Look at those, and of course, uh, um, all your elements are going to be included as well within this uh, within this hour. So yes. these are coming your way, jewelry makers, but not before. And the tool, by the way, is on pre-order, so you can shop ahead on that one as well. Any questions that you have for Yvonne, um, do message us because we are live here in the studio. But not before we bring you silver. the silver elephants. Now, silver in whatever component is always the most popular of your precious metals. Um, it is going to be no different when we're talking about little elephant charms like this, because that's what they are. They could be charms, they could be pendants, um, they could be uh, um, 
little individual beads if you like just you could situate in between your gemstones already I'm just positioning these little elephants so you can see them all because and there's a big gram weight to these as well I noticed that when I picked them up you know there's quite a weight to each of these little elephants but again the detailing yeah. of all the elephant charms that we've brought you I hope you can see them okay there. yes because they're solid aren't they yeah they're not uh, hollow or no anything. not at all they're, they're substantial now of all yeah of all your elephants um this is the one that we have the biggest quantity that being said there is still only 160 which is not enough is it normally i think uh, producer roscoe would agree with me normally when we're talking about about early birds certainly or launches like this we'd hope for the silver to be about more around 300 quantity wouldn't we um because that's they, they will still sell out when we've got that many um available so all three of them big gram weight to these I wonder, Yvonne, if you could perhaps incorporate this into your spinning ring, maybe. Yes, they'd solder on, wouldn't they? Yeah. Yes. I wonder if you could actually have the little could. elephant. Of, yeah, of course you could easily. A, into the yeah. spinning ring. I'd be um, tempted to put it on the centre one and yeah. leave the two bands either side um, plain. Yeah. Yeah. Might work. That's a really good idea, actually. Here they all are, the little, little elephants. Auction is open. They are brand new today. Now, just historically, whenever I bring you anything elephant related, and they do tend to be the charms, be them flat sometimes, um, they always sell out. But I think, yeah, I think because lots of us appreciate elephants, not only for their beauty, but for their personalities. Um, but these aren't just any old elephant charms. There's lovely detailing to every single one of them. And the fact that they are all different as well is, is another reason why I love them. You are looking at not far off a gram of precious metal per elephant wow so it's a big investment of sterling silver the phone lines have gone crazy oh, quite clearly you were, waiting yeah for the you're silver. waiting for the silver color um geraldine's bought three hazel's bought two so geraldine you're actually going to be getting nine elephants uh, Hazel, you've got two. Conway, you've got three. Uh, Neil and Linda's got two. Well done. Norman, Cheryl, Vanessa. Well done to you, Sally. Uh, Linda in Surrey. Christine, Jane, Gloucestershire, Lorna, Sharon, Tracy, Denise. I can't keep up with you. Uh, we have 160. It might seem like loads. It's, it's not nearly enough, actually, especially not for a weekend show. Um, so first, price crash, jewelry makers. First, 19.99. That's six pound sixty six per sterling silver wow. elephant, which is amazing, isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely amazing. But something tells me I've just got this little feeling in my bones that Roscoe is not going to stop there. You know what to do. Oh eight hundred six triple four six double five. Join us on the web because it is busy. Gosh, it's very busy for this one, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not surprised. It may be something that you incorporate into Yvonne's amazing project coming up in a few moments' time. Yeah. I think that's a really good idea, actually. actually have a spinning elephant. Yeah. That'd be quite cute, wouldn't it? Yeah. It's beautiful, just rotating. And again, all the meanings behind elephants in your jewellery and your designs. Well, lots of walks of life. Um, we aren't stopping there, though, jewellery makers. There was 160. Jenny's just got three. Susan as in Perth and Kinross has just got two. All of a sudden, that quantity, if you think about it, if everyone gets two... You know, that all of a sudden there's only 80 opportunities, which can go in seconds. Renfusha's just got three. Linda and Bedfordshire's just got two. You get the general gist. 160 could can be gone. Um, I don't know. Can you still get the previous colours? No, have they disappeared? They've disappeared. I think Whoa. they sold out, to be honest. Um, well done, everybody. £14.99. Pounds pounds that's £5 per 3D elephant. They're not flat. <laughs> When we showed you earlier on um, a simple sort of stack of bracelets alongside turquoise, we can bring you that no problem, at £164. And that's just one little elephant on there. Lovely, though. It's a really lovely piece of, uh, well, it's pieces. It's so pretty, isn't it? Yeah, beautiful. But one little elephant charm on there. And that's what they focus on in that design, don't they? They talk about the elephant. Yeah. Uh, £5 per design. Nineteen pounds Anyone who's going silver. on a safari. Oh, yes. Yes, or again, the meanings of your family. Yeah. Determination, there was another one, strength, tenacity. 
We're going to go even lower. Oh my word! It's got no. a, we've got a big show this Saturday, a really big show. We've got amazing projects. We've got the launch of Giant Clam coming up at ten o'clock today. The most insane quality pills that I've ever seen at twelve o'clock. A big show. Um, so yeah, little incentives, little deals like this. We're already talking about a fiver, aren't we? Five pounds. I can't per... believe that. Can you? No, no. Because I mean, they'll they'll last forever. They will. I mean, it, it, they're not wear and throw away, are they? No, not disposable. It's, no, absolutely. It's uh, they, they will just go on and on and on. I love it. And like I said, I've got one little upside down elephant on the Wouldn't back of my Wouldn't they look hand. nice on a stretchy? Oh, same, beautiful. Same where the, the um, drill hole is, yeah. is placed. They'd look beautiful on a stretchy. Well, the drill hole's top to bottom. So again, yeah, he would, they, they, or she, they would be walking. Sorry, I've got one little upside down elephant there. Um, Come on, flip over. over. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. There you go. Look at the detailing of these. They're really hard for me to show you, sorry. We're going even lower. We had 160 available opportunities. Up you get. Come on. Come on. 12 pounds and 99 pence only to get hold of all three of them. That's not for one, I'm gonna choose your elephant. You do get all three. You get all three. So what's that? Four pounds. Four pound thirty-three. That's just oh, oh, per oh, sterling silver flipping, elephant charm. Yeah. Again, <laughs> I'm, I'm not making comparisons. I don't even know what designs they've got in their in their establishment at the moment. But if you were to go into somewhere like. I don't know, Links of London oh, um, or really? Pandora and see, they're, they're bound to have an elephant charm, Pandora, bound to. Do you know, at that price, you can't not get them, can you? No, £4.33. She wears. £4.33 <laughs> per charm. Um, needless to say, the phone lines, the web yes. and the app have gone completely Somebody's crazy. They will be an on-screen sellout. Uh, yeah, clearly you've been waiting for the silver. Amanda, if you want those six, I would check out. Um, Pauline's got three. Well done, Sue. Claire, you've got yours. Jenny's got three. Well done, Cheryl, Vanessa. Sue's got two. Uh, Claire and Essex has got three. London's multi-bought. Yeah. Judith's multi-bought. Pauline's multi-bought. Fife's multi-bought. Essex's multi-bought. Denise's multi-bought. Angela's multi-bought. So all of a sudden, that 160 yeah. does not last very long. Uh, to be honest, at that price, you you could afford to make um, a stretchy bracelet with them all the way around, couldn't yeah. you? Well, at that price, Yvonne, we showed that family bracelet, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, we did. With, yes. the, with, the, with the whole there bird it, Oh, yeah, there, there it is, yes. You could recreate you that, could, couldn't you? could, absolutely, no problem at all. Amazing, and that, how much is that, £175 for that yeah. bracelet? Yeah. There's nine elephants on there. Yeah. Ten with the drop at the end, okay. Yeah, but you could yeah. recreate that, couldn't you? I'd or make be that inspired into a stretchy, by. definitely. I agree, I agree, yeah, I think it'd be fine be good. and elastic. It'd be beautiful. Probably com more comfortable to wear. Mm. Um, 12 99 well done everybody. Helen, London's got three, Kent, Catherine, well done two, Angela's got three, Elaine, Denise has got two, Marion, Maker in Manchester. Um, Heather, Gloucestershire, well done to you. Sandra in Dorset saying I love two, thank you very much. Uh, Susan, Renfusha, Sharon, Tracy, Julie, Brenda, Tina, Christine, I can't keep up with you. Um, but that quantity is absolutely flying out the door. Clearly we are a channel of elephant <laughs> lovers. <laughs> and sterling silver lovers. And sterling silver lovers, yeah, absolutely. What's not to love about elephants? They're beautiful, aren't they? They really are. Absolutely yeah, beautiful. I'm so glad they've been popular because they're so yeah. gorgeous. Adorable. Um, have we got any more animals? favorite animal messages coming through because I think a pangolin was quite was was, was a good one mm, some they're, unusual good, one yeah they're, they're they're cute aren't they what's the um um what's the ones with the massive eyes are they called slow slow loris or something like that I don't know they're cute. I can't think what they're called though. Um, hello to Catherine in North Yorkshire saying, I love red pandas. Yeah, they are. Aren't they meant to be the most, the cutest animal? Mm. Aren't they voted the cutest animal? They're quite small as well, yeah, aren't they? Very sweet. Um, they have beautiful faces. Love squirrels too. Yeah, I like squirrels. Because they're cheeky, aren't they? I think yeah, squirrels get bad press. About, don't they? Like the mice. Yeah, mice get bad too. press. Yeah. Squirrels get bad press. I think I think I, li I like how determined squirrels are. I like squirrels. Yeah, it's nice beautiful. to see them about. I remember them. I remember the red squirrels. I've never seen a red squirrel. Have you not? No. Never. I remember them when I was no. young. Do you? To, there used to be lots where I where I grew In up. In Wales. Yeah. Oh really? There used to be lots. We used to have that. We used to have um, um, a hazelnut tree. 
in our garden oh, they and they were always the... in our hazelnut yeah. trees I, I wonder if there are any still there I don't maybe I'm not sure they're very rare now aren't they're they very very rare I think very they've got them in Scotland I think have they? I think yeah. so um, Twelve ninety nine. well done everybody red pandas is a good call I'm sure they were yeah, voted definitely. the cutest animal on the planet yeah they are beautiful pandas. pandas is another one because they're so ridiculous aren't they I can again I like pandas are ridiculous they're all all the ones we're mentioning are all quite slow aren't they the elephants I think, the slows I think I think I think we could just relate to them I think that's maybe yeah. why um, <laughs> Helen Miss Janet saying hi gorgeous girls and team JM um, looks like another super Saturday show or oh, it certainly is favorite animal has to be uh, the amur leopard Huge, Huge woolly, woolly paws. paws. Oh, I don't. I've got to Google that now. Is yeah, that a snow leopard? Yeah, have a look at those. So that, the snow leopards are beautiful as well, aren't yes. they? I'm going to have to Google what an amur leopard is. Um, amazing. Now, just before we carry on, um, sticking with the animal theme. By the way, the tool, big quantity already gone on pre-order. I'm not surprised by that. And you will get, um, of course, the instructions. Um, also, we've put the textured 925 uh, sheet. The swirly pattern, which is on this one here, um, has almost sold out. So I would encourage shopping ahead on that one there. So with that swirly pattern, that's almost sold out. You've got the other texture sheets there as well. We had a big quantity of that too. It wasn't a small amount. Um, yeah, so stick into your animal theme. Now we don't have it physically here in the studio, um, but we do have a black jade eye kit. Yes, with Oh, with a tiger and an elephant. Oh, wow. Oh. They are very, very, very limited. Look at the elephant. Oh, they are incredible. So that, how long is that strand? How long is that strand, Ross? Do you know what you could do? You could do your stretcher bracelet uh, with mostly the silver elephants around and put the one black one in the middle beautiful that look nice that's a work of art isn't it well yeah. i say that there's two you get the you get the leopard is it a leopard or a tiger tiger you can see the tiger there it's snarling can you just about make it out in that recording because i don't physically actually have it here in the studio so it's a, it's beautiful that carving so you've got the courageous aspect of the of the tiger yeah. also again very family even uh -huh. though they're solitary animals they're they're considered protectors yes they are um and then you've got the family uh, connection of the elephant he's a happy elephant look at his swinging tail and again that's 3d <laughs> Uh, plus you've got a strand of natural <coughs> black type A Burmese jadeite. The length of the strand is well, it's six hundred carats accumulatively. What we're talking about. Um, the size of the uh, I'm trying to find out because it's limited on a, on the specs. So they look about six mil, eight mil, a oh. one meter strand. Ross, what are you going to do with this? I love meter strands of anything. You can do so much <laughs> yes, with them, you can't can. you? Now, total carrot weight, or in fact, let's break it down. The carving's 32 by 30 millimetres. And then I think the elephant's 27 by 24 millimetres. Um, you've got 600 carats across all three components. We're going to do a closeout deal on this. I don't physically have it here in the studio. I've got 10 available. Imagine, look, two long line necklaces. Two oh, beautiful yes. long line necklaces. And easily out of a strand of that yeah. length, yes. Um, <coughs> and you get cord. You get a black nylon cord, 10 meters, 0.5 millimeter. All of those for £199. You don't need to add anything no, to it. it's this. a project on its own, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. I mean, if you, were hand, if you were sent that as a project, I bet you'd be, I'd be delighted. Like, yeah, me too. <laughs> me too. I just literally probably knot it or maybe put a few precious metal spacer beads in between, create a nice long line necklace, maybe with a tassel of the black spinel that we had earlier on. Incredible. What about the black spinel and the ruby that we had earlier on? Maybe putting those yeah. in there too. $19.99. I've only got 10 though. Hazel, you've done it. Well done. I've got Julie, Morag, Swansea and Lynn. Close out deal opportunities. 600 carats. You know, and two master carvings. 
Also, says producer Ross, we've got the green version, which is exactly the same. Um, you know, the elephant and the tiger, we have brought you something similar, haven't we? Master carvings at £199, mm -hmm. haven't we? Here at Jewelry Maker. We and have you get done. a metre meter length. But you get the metre long length strand of black yeah. jadeite as well. Amazing that we're doing it at that price tag. It is ridiculous. The metre long strand alone should be more than 199 Now, in the green, I've got 12 If your budget allows, can you imagine mixing the two up? Oh... That'd be amazing, That'd be wouldn't nice, it? Wouldn't it? Yes. There he is. Look. Oh, the, that's oh, not just green. That's lavender. Now you can see his face. He is snarling, isn't he? He's got that yeah. wrinkly nose. He's, he's got as many wrinkles as me. And me. <laughs> Sorry, I was just doing my. He's got that snarl. You know when? Yeah. You know when they don't make a great deal of noise, but they're like doing that. It's like your three-year-old. She like can three snarl. Can't she, she? she certainly can <laughs> snarl. Oh my goodness me. There's lavender in that tiger though. Have you seen it? I know it's listed a green. The lavender's beautiful. Look at look at this round. As it comes round the back of the elephant. Sorry, elephant, but we're gonna just look at your derriere a second. But look how green, not yet, not yet. Look at that. That's imperial. Oh wow, look at that. Look at the look the bead behind yeah. him. That's an imperial. Yes, do you is. see what I'm do you see what I'm seeing? Sorry, elephant. Just gonna look at your derriere. And then as you look there. There it is. Look at the quality yeah. of that. Oh my goodness me. How is this 149? How many do we have of these 12? I think I might join you on this. That's amazing. The days of us doing projects like this are so far away mm -hmm. from the current day. Do you see where I'm coming yeah, from? Absolutely. You know, we can't source off the, the, the Burmese jadeite, <laughs> let alone bring you meter long strands of Burmese so jadeite. So clever, isn't it, that carving? I but love his face. That's it's 50 quid per it's piece. Incredible. Madness. Absolute madness. Did we have, um, I think it was Lorraine who messaged into the studio not so long ago, a couple of weeks ago, saying that. Um, her, I, think, I don't know if it was her or one of her friends had gone to Tucson last, just gone. Yeah. And they were wearing jewellery maker jade eye. Yes. Um, in a necklace and was approached repeatedly to buy really? that piece of jewellery. And she was offered like thousands. Really? Thousands of pounds, yeah. So when we tarp on about, we're not just, yeah, we're not right. just saying it. We're, it. It's absolute fact that something like this, what's on your screens, no reflection That's of true value. That's incredible, isn't it? I didn't hear that story. Yeah, yeah. yeah. approached Excellent. countless times. Um, 37.25. I'll leave that with you. Everybody stay where you are because it is time for Yvonne's amazing amazing project now we are so busy with this hour the textured sheet in the swirl has already sold out is that this one some of them I put I did patinaed and some of them I just polished and left as they were okay so put the graphics in that's this amazing oh, if I, can I take it off absolutely Look at this. That's twisted wire. Look at how beautiful. I, I, so this sheet, if I just move, has sold out. I think we've got the wire coming up too. It's this yeah. One. The wire's on pre-order and the elements, they're all available for you can shop ahead. Shall yeah. we, as we're here, shall we do the other sheet? And um, this one is the leaf. Yvonne, these are stunning, Thank absolutely you. stunning. I, I had such great fun making oh, them, I really, really did. This might be my favourite. I think that, is that the one I didn't patina? Look at how gorgeous that yeah. is. The stars and the moon. That's amazing, and then you've mixed the colours yeah, as well. I've put some brass and some copper in oh. there. So here's the leaf. Look at how amazing. It's and it is solid sterling silver as well. Oh, it's all sterling silver. And the uh, the wire that we, we've got on the website is one millimetre wire, which for that, oh, the, oh, sorry, the one you had before, I twisted it and, yeah. uh, and did made the three rings out of the twisted wire. Wow. And you've got a 0 0.4 millimetre thickness. So again, when it is actually sort of, this is a solid ring, isn't it? It really is. Um, and you don't, well, obviously, I didn't use it all because um i didn't want to make rings any bigger than that mm. but if you want you know if you if you need a bigger size there's plenty of uh, of length there to make them wow i don't think people are just going to be getting the one of these i love this pattern i think it's really beautiful can you see 
the leaves oh, it's seven, just there. They're seven centimetres long. So it's quite, you know, it's, yeah, it's, it's a, a good lot. size. Yeah, it's a lot. Seven centimetres, 0.4 millimetres thick um, and 1.5 millimetres in terms of its Wide, width. Yeah. Um, you've got five grams just under, haven't you? A whisper under five grams of sterling silver. Yeah. Have we got quantity of this one then, Ross? Just under 100, but again, they will be absolutely flying out the door. It's stunning, isn't it? Look how beautiful that ring is. Amazing, and if you think, oh, I'd love to make something like that, then you're in the right place. Yvonne's got the tool, um, which have. is on pre-order. We've got all the elements. You get the instructions as well with your um, with your uh, project purchase as well. And you get the additional demonstration. Or Everything is on the website, available for you to shop ahead and pre-order, and everybody pays that final low. So do shop ahead. $12.99, I mean, if you were to see this, Yvonne, in any boutique, <laughs> There's no way it's no, going to be anywhere near not. that price. No, absolutely not. Because uh, at the end of the day, you've got four rings there. Yeah, true. Uh, you've had to make four rings to make, make that item. Wow. Now, I tell you what, so many of you getting involved for this piece of, sh uh, uh, of silver. We've got the tool as well, um, but we'll start the demonstration. And then as and when there's a natural break, then you can obviously um, cue me to bring the other components. But do look at the website because there's lots of items on the website as well for you to add. Like the elements, for example, little finishing touches like that that make all the difference. Absolutely. Um, so right now you're going to show us the tool. So I'll show you the tool. Right. OK. So um, you need to put it into, into a vice ideally um, this is the little vice that uh well i think jewelry makers still yeah. till sell this don't they so, but yeah. i've had this for many many years so um the the um the knot at the bottom uh, yeah. the knot at the bottom that's what goes into the um into the vice into the vice so let's uh, get that ready Oop. sorry is that right Quite still right. in the right place yeah there we go so I'll put that in there. There we go. Tighten that up. So uh, as I said, what I did um, to start with, you've got to make your rings. So uh, I'm presuming that people making these uh, would know how to make a ring, but the instructions are in the PDF as well. Okay. Uh, so um, what I did was cut uh, the silver to the length I wanted. Um, and, and and made a sort if I can find there there's the solder mark on that one yeah so it's all written for there you. we go so I've got the solder mark down there you can see it very clearly on this one uh, because it's it's the pattern but some of them you can't see it at all um, uh, so I've made four four rings as I say um, we also have some little elements coming up or are on the website, I think, uh, which I've soldered on to, to my rings. On this one, I've got um, copper, brass and, and copper, uh, which I've put on my sterling silver band. Now, um, with, the, um, with the one with the... There's, there's one on there. I think it's the one with the copper bands. Yeah. yeah. Uh, anybody who who bought the mini rolling mill of, that we had on uh, a couple of months ago, I've actually uh, used that, made that patterned wire oh, in, yes. in the rolling mill. And the middle one, I actually made twisted wire and flattened it through the rolling mill. Yes. So anybody who's got a rolling mill or who bought the mini rolling mill, then that's what I used to make those. Beautiful. Right. So what we need to do, if I can explain this little gadget to you, to make the spinner ring, originally I thought, oh, we, we, we've got to have um, a little bit of the thread showing in order to be able to tighten it up to flare the ring. Um, but then uh, I found a, a different way of doing it, which I'll show you afterwards. So for this one, you need to take that off make your however many rings you want put them all together put these back on here there we go so you can see me let's put these back on there so then what we want to do is pop the whole lot so you put your spinner rings on and you pop the whole lot on there 
put it all back together put your little nut back on it also comes with a spanner mm -hmm. so basically because this is because you've soldered your join down the side you've basically annealed it at the same time so what you need to do now is get your spanner and gently start to tighten it up and as you tighten it up it will start to flare and hold those those up There we go. Now, now it's going to go because I can I can feel it. Uh, I can feel the pressure against me. So oh, you yeah. need to be very careful. Um, don't do it too much because you don't want your solder. I did use hard solder on the on the big ring because we don't want it to to right. pop. So right, what I'm going to do now is take take that off. I'm going to turn it over just to make sure it's even. Now, if I can show yes. you that, they will stay on there now. So they they are on there. So I'm going to turn it over. Put the back, put that back on, and do the same again. Right there we go. And we're going to just do the same. And as you can see, I am demoing this, but it's extremely simple. Very satisfying. It's very satisfying. And you can be as all, this is the thing, you can be as ornate as you like. Yeah. I mean, I've gone to town on some of the spinners that I've put on there. Oh, they're beautiful, aren't they? There we go. Uh, I do push my look a little bit. Uh, <laughs> uh, don't we all yeah and uh, but if you're very careful and if, you know if there's no harm take your time you can take, keep taking it off and checking there you go and there it's we go. so clever and there we go there we are hold it down for Bruce oh sorry there sorry you Bruce go. look at that and they're not going anywhere now is it okay to get, show you my tip? Yes, please okay. do. With my first strip of wire, uh, <laughs> uh, with, with my first strip of wire, I'm always looking to get more for my money. Yeah. So I actually cut it in half. And once I cut it in half and popped it on there, I realized it wasn't going to flare because there's nowhere for the flare to go because there's no thread left ah, and it's just going to keep spinning so, and not tightening right. so, so don't so. pop the strip down the middle no as in no, don't, sorry do, so you meant don't cut it this way no 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 well, that's what i did and that's what i've got here and i'm going to show you how i resolved oh, the problem the yeah so this is the tip uh, because a lot of people think that you can't make narrow bands and make them um, flare, make them flared. So I was struggling with this, and I'm going to tell the truth now. I said I thought of it. I didn't actually. My husband came in, and I said, "Oh no, this is not going to work." And he said, "Just, just turn it over, and put the flat side against that." That is very smart, very and I, smart. I can't take the credit for it. I really. I can't really take the credit for it. So, uh, <laughs> look at that. So, so, which part is going to flare? The bottom bit. The bottom will flare because this one's it flat. Down. Yeah. Right. So the bottom will flare. Very smart. Is uh, that your husband outside, by the way? No, no, no. that's not I my wondered, husband. No, I wondered no. no his daughter's <laughs> on, his daughter's on hobby maker. Apparently, oh, I was chatting I to him early, earlier. So let's. Uh, and it's flaring. Take, take that off. Flaring. Did you see it flare? Yeah. So we're going to take that off. And so we've still got a flat side, and now we've got a flared side. And I'm going to turn that over. No, other way. Other way. <laughs> other way. There we go. <laughs> it is smart. I would never think of this. 
No, I would never have thought. I thought, oh, I'm not going to be able to take that to jewellery maker now because I've cut it in half and it's not going to work. Uh, but there we go. It does. It does work. It really, really does. See if we can see it flare now. Can you see it flare? Is your husband clever? Uh, well, he would say so. <laughs> <laughs> so if you can show on the one that I've done over there, that because that's actually got all the little elements and things on. And uh, so I was able to bring it to Jewelry Maker and I am able to share the little tip. And I hope you find that useful because not everybody wants great big wide rings, no, do they? No, that's true. I'll, I'll be honest, I love the look of wide rings, yeah. but I don't think I'd they're be able to not wear them always, regularly. They're not always very practical. Yeah. Um, but that's such a pretty one. That's and gorgeous. that's got beaded wire on, also done in the little mini rolling mill that we sold yeah. a little while ago. Don't know if we've still got any of those. Uh, but yeah, that's the way it works. Amazing. $12.99 for the leaf sheet, leaf sheet, um, and they are absolutely flying, which is so pretty. This is so beautiful. I'd like wallpaper. It is pattern. so lovely. And in the um, in the demonstration, I have shown you how I've um, soldered the elements on, etc. As well. So Perfect. all that's there if you want it. So you have that instruction there as well. Um, the leaf sheet has flown. Um, how are we doing in terms of stock levels, Roscoe? Only 10. There's only 10 left. You see, it made me look, all this made Oops. me look a lot cleverer because lots of people were saying to me, oh, how did you get the texture on the silver? Well, of course, it comes already yeah, done. I could if you needed to. <laughs> yeah, you'd know how to yeah, do it. I could it. if I needed to, yeah. but I didn't need to. No. Uh, because it's all, it's all done for you and it's beautiful. But you would know how to, because you are, you are clever, Yvonne. That's, you, you just look at the jewellery that you've made. That, there you go. That I, 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 love, I love the spinner rings. They're, Stunning. They're, they're gorgeous. Um, well done, everybody. So um, only a couple of those left now, so I would encourage checking out your basket. We've still got the tool to bring you as well, the spinner tool. So really, the only thing that you actually need is a vice. What yeah. you recommend? Yeah, about, which we we used to do very inexpensively. Oh, do you know as these? Well. I, when I bought this, they were about four ninety nine. Yeah, I think they chips. were really, really. And and it's been sitting in my uh, in my workshop, and it's on my bench, and it's so useful just to have there. It's amazing yeah. the thing. I used it for my twisted wire as well. Yeah, great just put for that. My, my wire in there, twisted it up. Yeah. yeah, and away you go. Great for that very, too. Very, very useful. Um, Ross, do we have any vices in the vault? In the vault. I think we're out of stock, but if you keep an eye on the website, it's something that we do actually have quite frequently. Right, let's bring you the tools. So you've literally seen it live in action, yeah. but you also get the written instructions here as well when your order is ready to be dispatched. Um, and in effect, yeah, advice, which you can get from most hardware shops anyway. Yeah, they're you? very they're very reasonably yeah, priced. Yeah, reasonably and priced. And most people have got one in their garage or somewhere. True. I mean, it doesn't have to be a little no. jeweler's one. No, no, you could use a general vice as well. Yeah, of course you can. Um, yeah. So this is basically everything that you get. There's your, <laughs> there's your you need. screwdriver, you get the two why, why is there two different Be sizes? Yeah, the uh, wider and bigger rings on the bigger one. I've only I've only used for these demonstrations the smaller one, okay. uh, but they're for wider rings. Okay, so if you wanted to do a bigger, yeah. a wider flare, yeah. I suppose. Yeah. Um, there you go. So you get the two different sizes also. Um, in terms of stock levels, right? Okay. Well, goodness me! I've just seen the price of these. So oh, good. Oh, I don't when know you the consider price. Consider the end result. They're so clever. So clever. Sorry, I was really shocked then. I've just seen the price tag of them. Oh, I can't wait to see the price. First price crash. Not when you're closing. I mean, these will last forever, won't they? Yeah. I mean, they're substantial. You're never going to need to replace these no. unless, you know, unless you do something drastic. No, no. And, the, you know, it does the work for you, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, to do that with the hand, I guess it's going to well, create that consistency. What I used to do was was, was put a big um, dapping punch on, yeah. you know, from your doming block. Yeah. Put one and hit it with the hammer. Yeah. Then you've got to turn it over and do it again. Yeah. And it's all very hit and miss. Often the flares aren't the same size. Whereas this, this is, 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 is consistent. Yeah, it's precision. Yeah. First price crash. You get the two different sized flares. You also get the... Have I gone blank? Spanner. Spanner. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> As you can tell, I am not very good with tools. Um, what did you call it? I was like, the... No. <laughs> <laughs> 39 
<laughs> What's that? Oh, wow. 39 and... 20 pounds each. And? And. We're going again. It's not your price. It's amazing for a bit of, a bit of kit that you're never going to need to replace. As long as you look after it, obviously, yeah. you know, keep it keep it out of moisture. Make sure you don't lose any of well, the Well, to be fair, you know, just it, it's just like all your your solid tools that you've got. Yeah. It, it should last forever. Yeah. It really should. Unless You're, you lose a piece or something. Unless you lose should, a part, yeah, absolutely. It should last forever. Well, you won't believe this price. Oh, I can't wait. Because we don't... <laughs> it shocked me when I looked at my star by sheet. We're going even lower, everybody. These are flying, though absolutely flying but look at the end result i mean you imagine any artisanal market if they've got spinner rings they're going to be super busy aren't they spinner rings are so popular yeah. and you know we've got um we've got teenagers now coming up to their exams yeah and they're getting stressed and yeah. just to have one of these like a fidget ring just to uh, relieve it's your great stress idea. And just, yeah great idea £24.99. Yeah, that's, right. that's just wrong, isn't it? It is. <laughs> amazing. <laughs> that's incredible. Oh, my chair's just gone down. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Uh, uh, that's incredible. The only downside, though, is we've got 77. Oh. That's it. That's the uh, only downside. So I would encourage not leaving it in your basket, as so many of you aren't, actually. Um, yeah. As I say, it shows you in here, I've shown how I've uh, soldered the soldered the rings yeah, in yeah okay. here we go we can put it on the overhead then okay there we go sorry adam so you can see it's just like step by step there we go. instructions yeah. so all i've the shown way how i've uh, made oh yeah so if i can just add to make the spinner to get the size of the spinner rings i mean you you've obviously got you know the size you need for the main one just literally wrap wrap that wrap that wire round mark it with a marker pen mm -hmm. and cut it that's that's the best way to do it and, and then you, then you get the perfect size for the spinner and you'd obviously add those rings before you flare it yeah, absolutely before yes. you flare it absolutely. out otherwise they won't fit on no um so before you put it in the vice add the yeah. actual rings absolutely. itself absolutely absolutely um amazing i can't believe we're at 24 pounds and neither can pence. i it's just incredible wow all the instructions there as well um again as long as providing you look after it and you don't lose any of the components there's no reason why you'll need to replace such a tool unbelievable designs and i think that's a really good point you know stress life is stressful sometimes yeah, isn't it uh, you know? lots of people yeah they put them on the thorn mm -hmm. and they they can they can just keep twirling them around and it helps relieve their tension absolutely mm -hmm. like palm stones and things yeah, like absolutely. that you know? so it all works in the same way absolutely um 24 pounds and 99 pence we only had 77 but i can see how many it's crazy busy Crazy, crazy busy, and I can't wait to see all of your creations. Oh on the no, Wall of send Fame them in. Well. Yeah, please yeah, send them in. I'd to love see to those. see them. We do have lots of elements and sterling silver wire as well for you to create the internal spinner ring. So you can shop ahead on those also. Like we've got stars and moons. I think you can see them in Avon's design just here. They've got little stones in. They too. do. So you've got stone encrusted stars and moons. You've got um, uh, like an ace of spades. You've got leaves and you've got diamond components that you could stamp onto, couldn't you? You Absolutely could actually. Absolutely, you could. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you could put all of those plus we've actually got the silver wire itself one millimeter wire to create the internal spinner rings or texture twist whatever yeah the twisted wire i did with that one millimeter yeah amazing and look how it goes nice and substantial when you twist it together but yes it makes a really substantial well, they spinner could be rings on their own they could they? yeah they um in fact i i did think i i worked i i worked till i ran out but you could just make um Stacker rings, yeah, as with the little elements yeah, and the wire. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. Right, let's do the wire because oh, do you know we rarely see sterling silver wire on our screens at the moment. I don't know why. I, w I was so lucky with these kits. You, you have had lovely kits yes, today, I have. haven't you? Yeah. Um, so the wire is. I beg your pardon. This is 0 0.6 millimeter, but obviously if you spit, if you twist it, hammer it, texture yeah. it, yeah. and you don't really need it to be that thick, I guess, for the internal. No, you don't. No, you don't. Um, because obviously that's not necessarily no, what's no, going no, no, to no, no it looks it looks really pretty just on its own stunning absolutely stunning and you can use that rolling mill that you were talking yeah, about yeah the as mini well. rolling mill that we had i made some um pattern on the narrow band we've got there 
uh, I put it through the rolling mill and uh, made beaded wire with it. I wonder, Ross, have you got the rolling mill? Ah, uh, did they sell out? That's why, yeah, popular. So yeah. hopefully you've got the well, rolling mill. Well, lots of mill. people will already have them, though. Yeah, that's true. But yeah. you get that lovely texture. Um, Twelve ninety nine for a full meter of precious metal. It's so easy to look at this and go, oh, "That's wire." Yeah. Yeah, it's precious metal. It's nine two five. Well, the effects metal. you can make with it is yeah. just, are just incredible. Nine ninety nine. Twist it, roll it, hit it with a hammer. You can make any. Do you know what really unusual. Do you, know what you reminded me of then? <laughs> Boil them, mash them, stick them in the stew. <laughs> Totally reminded me of that then. Boil them, mash them, stick them in stew. <laughs> Twist it, roll it. <laughs> Amazing. Nine ninety nine. Potatoes. Uh, nine what? ninety nine, but not your price tag. Sorry. Also, flashback to uh, um, something that Bruce was reminiscing about this morning. What were they called? Pot, pot mash. Pot mash. What's a pot mash? <laughs> and one pound fish. Did you remember the one pound? I fish? do remember the one pound. One pound fish. Um, Five ninety nine. <laughs> 5 99 for your sterling silver. Wow. And really, if you want to create the internal spinning rings, you're going to need your wire, aren't, wire, aren't you? Yes, absolutely. You will yeah. need it. So. Oh, yeah, you need wire to do that. Yeah. And, and it's big enough, it's a thick enough gauge for you to put yeah. your elements onto. Yeah, it is. I, I only had the clubs, but it looks as though we've got diamonds coming we up. We have as got well. diamonds. <laughs> we've got little leaves. We've got hearts I've and got moons the leaves, as well. Yeah. There's the little leaf, actually. The, li the little elements on there, they just, it just takes it's it to sweet. another level. So, so sweet. Sorry, I've just realised I've spun this round. Um, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. 5 99 again, it is solid 925 sterling silver as well. Jewelry makers, we're not talking about base metal, um, which you might be able to get on our website. But personally, if you're working with silver sheet, then I would want to put silver I spinners. So. I think so, yes. Keep it yeah. all uh, precious metal. Mega deal. Mega, mega deal. We've still got your elements to bring you as well. So again, shop ahead on those, they are on our website. Uh, Samantha in Coventry snapped up five metres of, sil of silver wire. Uh, Helen in Manchester, Kim in West Midlands. Five, Jacqueline, Christine, Warwickshire, Maker, Buckinghamshire, Sue, hello to you, Teresa, uh, Manchester, Sharon, well done. It's very popular. I can't wait to see your spinner rings. Oh, make sure you send yeah. them into the wall you, of fame. You will have great fun if you're making the spinner rings. And they're they, going to be the, they're so they're, fabulous. Well, they're immediate conversation starter, they aren't are, they? They are, yeah, they are. You know? Um, amazing. Well done, well done, well done. Um, Okie dokie. And the patterned wire, it just obviously, it, it helps so much. Yeah. Stunning. Now, should we bring the accents? Which one first? The leaves. They are so dainty and so pretty. So beautiful. Yeah. And to actually make something this is obviously going to be quite labour intensive. Oh, no, I don't think I could even be bothered. <laughs> I really don't. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is the thing. If you can buy them, why would exactly. you bother? Exactly. They are so lovely in their own. And it says it's got 925 stamped on the back it as has. well. If I flip that over, you can see. There's a 925 stamp. But there's a big amount of precious metal in that one little leaf, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, there is. Yeah, look at the detail in that. Yeah. I mean, you have to put a lot of work in to get that. I think Claire said something similar yeah. as well. I think she was saying, look, look I, I, I'd struggle to make those. Yeah, because you, you wouldn't even bother. Have work. they sold out? Well done. Because the, the time involved it alone making them, you wouldn't yeah. get your money back for that. No, I agree. Okay, moving on. Love those. The spades. Are they spades or are they clubs? Clubs. Well, I don't know. Oh, no, no, they're spades. They're, sorry, they're spades. Yeah, ace of spades. Ace of spades. Oh, no, you could, you, could, you could also stamp on these, couldn't you? Yeah, you could put an initial beautifully on there, couldn't you? Yeah. Um, <laughs> you could put an A for ace of spades. Or absolutely. an S for spades, so we know what it is. <laughs> absolutely. You, um, ah, they could also be little fish. Yeah. Can you turn it into a little fish? One pound fish. Are they? <laughs> Six ninety nine. Now you're getting a pack of ten of these, and and I guess it actually, if you soldered them in an arrangement, there's nothing stopping these from being petals. 
No, no. Well, I mean, there's nothing to stop you um, cutting little bits off and making yeah. your own shape if you want to. Absolutely. I mean, you could make a heart out of that very you easily, could. couldn't you? Yeah, absolutely. Just nip this yeah, thing yeah, away. Yeah. Um, but again, all the little soldable accidents, you can texture them, you can yeah. hammer them. Um, Mark had that amazing stamping tool not long oh, ago. Did, yes, he did. Yeah, this would be perfect for that, wouldn't yeah. they? Six ninety nine. I love stamping. Yeah, and you get 10 of them as well in there. So, um, well done. Let's yeah, move they... on. Now, I, I didn't get these, but these are lovely. Little diamonds. A diamond shape can be anything. I'm not just thinking about, uh, you know, a pack of pack cards. Of cards it's, you know, a diamond shape or even a rhombus, whichever way you want to word it. Um, it could be a rhombus, couldn't it? Yeah, could be a wonky square. Yeah, wonky square. Um, <laughs> again, 925 sterling silver, nothing stopping you putting your own little personalization on these as well. Um, again, you get a pack of 10, they are precious metal, 699. Oh my word. 699. What would you have done with your diamonds I if you'd would, have been sent them? I, yeah, you'd I would. Ah. I actually, I would have put a, a diamond on one and a, on the same ring, a diamond on one ring and a spade on Very the ring. Very nice, yeah. like that. Yeah. Like that. Perhaps you go into Vegas or something like that. And that they, they would be both be loved. They they are so substantial. <laughs> you could uh, stamp on both of those. Yeah. So you could put two initials on there, couldn't you? Lovely, absolutely beautiful. Um, have we got quantity of these then, Roscoe? Forty available, but they're absolutely flying. And I think the Ten. most popular. I'm just going to bring the ring over. Actually, where is it? There. Look, what Avon's made there. Oh, this is stunning, Avon. This is my favourite. Is it? And I love yeah. this. It's the crescent and the star. Of which you get two moons and you get two stars. Now, if you notice there, I have soldered those on and it hasn't affected the CZs that are in there. No, not at all. No. No, they've, um, they've been soldered, they've been pickled uh, and, and the they've polished up beautifully. Stone. It hasn't affected them at all. Not at all. So if I turn this round, bear with me. So you get the two crescents, you get the two stars. So four components in total. I think I've put brass and copper in between those as well. They're beautiful, they? aren't they? Yeah. And they are kind of three dimensional. Can you see that? They've got a great depth to them. And you've got a long, um, a long, uh, what are they call those things of the stars? Um, you've got a long pointy star yeah like that like a um like the north star yes that's it yeah, yeah. beautiful Perfect description. and then yes. here we go here's your crescent moon so you get two of those as well 6.99 the work i was expecting to these to be know. more incredible sold out well done everybody well done well done okay shall we bring you because you're going to obviously be soldering with these um let's bring you some um additional components it goes right through me so i'm so glad that you put this on it goes right through me i can't touch cut charcoal oh can't you no it's, so, it's, uh, uh, it's such a useful piece of equipment yeah. it really is so it might look boring to you <laughs> But what's a charcoal block for then? A charcoal block, it reflects the heat. I use a charcoal block most of the time. So that's what you yeah. put your components on to yeah. solder. And you can you can make marks into it. You can make holes in it to put make your little granulation oh, balls. it's actually not too bad. Um, I would always put a piece of wire around the outside because they will crack and yeah. it holds them together. Uh, we have actually sold the people that we will have viewers who've got the little swirly, um, yeah. little lazy Susan that we had originally originally to sell with them uh, but you are uh, you always need one of those in stock yeah so if you are um yeah you get dirty fingers yeah you do get very um, dirty but fingers, if you yeah. if, if if you are soldering for so initially say your sheet I yes. swiped it on my skirt, yeah. Um, when you're actually soldering this, you'll need to sort of solder it on on the block, won't yeah, you? Yeah, you solder it on the block. And to, to make your, to solder your elements on, you would put, oh, and I've showed it in the in the PDF, you put your, ele uh, your element down and then you prop your ring up with like a third hand or a pair of tweezers yeah. and solder it there on. There you go. And yeah. um, we rarely see them, to be honest. It's rarely rare that them. we actually have no, them on there. So them make sure, often. and I would recommend a backup Charcoal definitely, as well. definitely. You okay. can't have enough of those. No, um, the other thing which is like gold dust, uh, and it's such a simple component, but one that's invaluable to anybody that does silversmithing, and that is your emery sheets. 
Now we've got 230 of these available and you've got the different grains. They are, can I say, they're not actually emery sheets. They're oh, aren't they? emery polishing papers. Right, so what's the difference? I don't know. Um, they are very much finer. I've put mine, I don't know if you can see that, but I've put mine on uh, little pieces of so dowling. Oh, so they're to polish up your silver? They polish up your silver. Um, I'll, I'll show you uh, on one of these. Um, they've got numbers on the back. Yeah. Uh, grade one, grade two. And that's the order you use them in. And on the end of my little pieces of dowel, I've put, I've put the numbers on. Very clever. So that I know which order to use them in. Now, so yep. you use it to polish up your silver yep. um, and you can cut strips off. You like. can cut strips off, you can use it as normal emery paper, but if you put it, uh, put it on a piece of doweling, um, you can literally just put it inside the ring and work, work through your grits and polish up the inside of your ring. Perfect. And uh, without the doweling on, you can use it to polish up the outside as well. Now, we're uh, going to do a closeout deal. I have actually brought oh, look, with me these. Yours. This is what I cut it out of. Uh, I did this yesterday to show you. Uh, one part of that copper is left as it was, and the other half, I've gone through the grits. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm waffling on, showing you what you can do with it. A, a pound? It's a close-out <laughs> deal. No! There's 230 of these available. Just get them. Just get them. Sorry, what oh, were you ser saying? Yes, yeah, seriously. Uh, <laughs> seriously. Um, half of that uh, I've left as it was. Yeah. And the other half I just went through the grits. You can see the and, polish. And polished it up. And it literally takes you from your uh, gritty emery paper and it takes you right through to a final pit. Wow. Final so it's the polish. finishing, isn't it? It's, it's the, the finishing. finishing. Yeah. Finish. Yeah. Which makes all the Absolutely difference. Absolutely, you get the professional finish there. One pound? No, it's wrong. One pound? Oh, well, he is, he is wrong, isn't he, as our Roscoe? No. He's right. He... <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> and they're what? Pretty much A4 sheets, aren't they? In I their would size. say so. I didn't measure off. them, but they're, they're, they're not far You've got anyway. loads in there. And as I say, you have got the numbers on the back, so you know which order to use them. Yeah. In. Amazing. I can't believe we're at a pound. Close out deal, everybody. So do make sure you check them. Uh, check it took them me longer than a pound to put them on my dowel. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure, and it's uh, yes. Yeah, how would you how would you polish say the inside of your <laughs> ring without uh, so, this? Uh, without that, then you start needing your polishing equipment. Yes. You need your mops and yeah. your, your Dremel and etc. Okay, so you need but you know, if other you, tools. If you like to do things by hand, this is Literally, the way you can do it. Just polish there, like yeah. like so, yeah, yeah, and work yeah. down the grid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. Well, needless to say, these are absolutely flying out the door. Close out surprise, deal. Surprise. Yeah, and a pound. <laughs> <laughs> and a pound absolutely incredible um, and again let me just show you on the reverse there's the numbers etc so you know which one you're actually using yes so you can go work uh, down the grits and you work down don't you so start with the coarsest work and down to the yeah finest. well you start with number one in this instance okay. number one is the coarsest yep. which is the black one yeah and then you work your way through so you can see the number there yeah Okay, um, I know that's upside down. Um, but yeah, work down, the, oh gosh, there's loads of you multi-buying on this one. I've only actually got 17 left from the original over 200 available. You're joking. Yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> no, I'm we, not surprised. That's amazing, and you'll need those. Not long to wait until we bring, um, or rather Dave, steps into the studio with, oh, I'm so excited about this next showcase, um, your giant clam. And you know when you kind of, Obviously, I can imagine what it's like in its in its habitat, but what's it like in a gemstone? I can't even visualise it because I've never actually seen them in my uh, years of working in jewellery. I tell you what, it absolutely exceeds my expectations. These are breathtakingly beautiful. The purest of white that you can possibly imagine. I've been wearing the ring all morning, as some of you might have noticed. Now, you've got it in strands. 
in different sizes. You've also got it in lovely La Peregrina like drop shapes. We've got it in a ring, which is absolutely mind blowing. In fact, let me show you that ring. Um, this is haloed beautifully um, with your spinel. So this is just one, you can see that beautiful, stunning, pure white color. Um, so yes, these are coming not too long to wait after a very, very short break. Do not go anywhere jewelry makers because um, yeah, Dave is on his way to bring you this amazing uh, um, parcel. Incredible. I'm so excited. Never had it before. It's very also, exciting. Also, you were saying how amazing would it be alongside um, your pearls at 12 uh -huh. o'clock to today too. Yeah. We actually Just complement each other beautifully. Yeah, it's because of the brightness of them, I think. Uh -huh. In total for this launch, we have, and it is a launch, it's never been on air before, three strands that you're looking at right now. The ring that I'm wearing, one class, and then we've got the pair of drops. So if you wanted to create like a lariat or a pair of mm -hmm. earrings, that would be absolutely amazing. So um, it's limited, six lines. But then that is the rarity of the actual material itself. But my goodness me, so beautiful. Every single item of that six is less than 100 in terms of quantity. <gasps> Oh, wow. Um, coming up after the break with Dave. So I don't want you to miss out on this. It's a launch. Um, uh, it's a launch for the very first time. Very, very special moment. Very don't go anywhere, lovely jewelry makers. Join Yvonne and I after this. <laughs> Hi, I'm Natalie Patton and I'm a guest designer on Jewelry Maker TV. I'm going to be back on the show on Sunday the 18th of February with the return of the Gemstone Garden Collection, which I'm really, really excited about. So if you missed it first time round on the launch, please come and join me. Um, the collection features 12 unique, lovely little birth flowers that represent each month and they are adorned with a matching birthstone so we've got black diamond we've got opal sapphire ruby emerald they're absolutely gorgeous and they are 925 sterling silver they've also been designed so they're really versatile for you to use with any jewelry making technique so whether you're a metal smith a bead stitcher a um, macrame maker, a wire worker, you can use these to create some lovely personal designs. As well as this lovely little um, plantable wildflower seed card, this time round it's also going to come with a PDF on how to create a lovely adjustable ring. So you can use this to create um, a piece of jewellery that can commemorate a loved one, celebrate a birthday or a special moment or occasion. If that's not enough, we've also got the launch of some really lovely um, carrier charm clasps with gorgeous coloured cord. And in the masterclass, I'm going to be showing you a variety of different macrame techniques that you can use to make some very lovely jewellery. So please come and join me on Sunday, the 18th of February on Jewellery Maker. Did you know that instructions come included with every designer project? Dive right into your Jewellery Maker project with confidence and clarity. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a first time creator, our step-by-step -step guides ensure success every time. Just download them from your Jewelry Maker account on our website. Get started today and experience the joy of hassle-free crafting. Instructions included, creativity unleashed. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewelry room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewelry Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewelry Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewelry Maker.
Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard PMP is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Monday the 19th of February with the most beautiful projects. In the 9am, I have these incredible Malachite projects with matching connectors and there's also an amazing pearl one, absolutely stunning. I'm going to be showing you how to make this bubble style pearl necklace and in the masterclass I have the most amazing Larimar earring kit. So all of the findings are sterling silver and there's lots of really interesting earring findings and the Larimar is just beautiful. So I hope you can join me on Monday the 19th at JM. Just the most beautiful collection that you're about to see. I'm so excited to hear this wonderful story because the end result, wow, Dave, these well, are yeah, stunning. I'm, I'm over the moon with this. This is something, um, good morning, by the way, good morning to all of you and, and to the team. But this is something we've been working on for as long as we've been working with the, the Queen Conk team in Hong Kong. In fact, when we first sat down and we started talking about the idea of doing something like this, um, the, the, the giant clam, was the first thing that sprung to mind because it has those those beautiful colors you know the the pure white that we associate with your world-class pearls you know the most famous pearls in the world but it proved extraordinarily difficult to find this material and so we actually began with the queen Kong. and you know with the with the queen Kong, we had to get the fully mature uh, uh shells to be able to create the material that looks like pearls and you know this is the material again that is indistinguishable from the pearl you know mm. this is not when you talk about the giant clam the queen conch the mellow yeah they are fixtures of high jewelry they are created by um they create non-nacrous pearls so not pearls formed of nacre when they do create pearls it's calcareous concretion so gemologically the properties of both the pearl and the mother of pearl or the shell are identical you can't exactly actually the tell them apart yeah and obviously i always thought well if we could get the giant clam it'd be hopefully much easier to do because they're so large because they're so dense and thick would be able to create jewelry like this which is true the problem is finding them they're ridiculously rare it's the fairy tale clam that everyone it talks is. about um only comes from the the, the coast of uh, indonesia finding this material is extremely extremely difficult the the store that cartier now has on, in their fifth avenue boutique was bought with a strand of giant clam pearls. Really? Yeah, so, you know, when, when it was once a mansion, when it was the most prime real estate in the world, uh, the Cartier family traded a pearl strand, which I used to think was uh, pearls from the Gulf of Persia, actually turned out to be giant clam pearls. Wow. And not even a full strand, it was like spaced out right. for that uh, location. Now, even in Tucson, I saw, you know, misshapen pearls from the giant clam. And I was surprised to see that they're more expensive than your mellows. They're more expensive than your queen conch. And I didn't see one round pearl. They don't exist. They, they are, because obviously the body that it forms in is so much larger, over the years that it takes to form that pearl, and it is a calcareous concretion, it moves around within the huge body of that, so mm -hmm. it becomes misshapen. And they can be, you know, I mean, the most expensive pearl in the world is a giant clam pearl. It's a hundred million dollars, wow. but it's also this big. It's like a okay. 26 pound pearl. Okay. So, you know, th these pearls are extraordinarily difficult to find and even more difficult to find in, in, in wearable sizes. This is a, a, a polished version of the giant clam. This is what we always see. This is, you know, when you see, like I said, the fairy tales on the movies, this is what they talk about. Yeah. The, the legendary giant clam. Uh, sorry, Ross, if I could just borrow the clicker. Thank you so much. This is the $100 million pearl. Wow. Yeah. 26 pounds in weight. Gentleman discovered this, found it, and slept with it under his bed for 10 years for prosperity. And then a house fire forced him to remove it from the, 
the house and then took it to be valued and it was valued at a hundred million dollars but you can see the orient that you're getting you can see well it's yeah. not an orient it's a flame that yeah. you get from this material it's so dense in nacre uh, in in the calcareous concretion because it's creating such a large pearl or you know shell as bonhams would call these that we have for you pearls just like they call the queen conch when it's carved from yeah. the body of the shell a pearl these a are pearl. considered pearls because you can't tell the difference which have been very upfront and honest with you today we have sourced a giant clam and we've carved this collection for you maybe the rarest collection we have ever brought to your screens it is at the moment unless there is another one found impossible to do wow. we have worked this whole collection is born of one giant clam and when we talk about size day yeah like the giant clam itself it's like this it's just yeah, astonishing it's, it's, it's huge but they're as i said they i mean they they can live for literally over 100 years wow and they are very difficult to find they they live at the depths you know with with queen conch when i was searching for the queen conch although they're um very difficult to to spot because of the way that they yeah you know, it's only the underneath that is pink the rest of it is that sand color yeah you know the shelf where it is is, is living in uh, in the Turks and Caicos or in the Caribbean, it's only about this deep. Yeah, shallow waters and the, crystal clear. Yeah, crystal clear, clear. Mm. In Indonesia, these are found at huge, huge depths. I mean, you've got to scuba down, and then you've got to find it, and you don't find them. This no. is why they've always been notoriously rare. There isn't, other than that one that sold for the Cartier flagship store, there hasn't been a strand put together. And are history. they a natural food source as well to predators? To predators, of course, but unlike the the queen conch. Um, they're not a natural no, food source to people us, because they're so difficult to find. Of course, you can't. You know, there, there isn't as easy in the Caribbean where they're out. Uh, you know, fishing for the, for the queen yeah. conch. Yeah, you know, it's what eight feet, twelve feet deep, yeah. and it's like we said, crystal clear waters. So it is a staple part of the diet, as is the abalone to the Maoris mm -hmm. in in New Zealand. When we're talking about this, they, I'm sure they are natural food sources to predators, but they live at the most astonishing depths. Mm. And because they've been alive for sometimes 50, 60 years, they, they look like coral because they're just covered in barnacles. They're wow. covered in, you know, all, all manner of different uh, uh, fauna or flora, you know, that, that cover yeah. this because it's, it's living there. It's part yeah. of the ocean. And, and that's why any picture, if you just type in giant clam, you'll see them. And they're in the tropics and they look blue because they've got phosphorescent coral growing on them. But when you boil it down, when you, when you polish it down, it is that pure, incredible white huge structure you have got as i said the, the rarest we started with this vision thinking it'd be perfect you know everyone wants white pearls you want the rarest white pearls we can do it but in that time in that three four year window we've brought you four different collections of queen conch yeah we've brought you the mellow but we have never been able to bring you the giant clam again as i said you just saw the 26 pound one that huge hundred million dollar pearl the most expensive pearl ever valued which is now in a museum but more often than not, as I said, they're misshapen. You, you never get rounds. You never get even near rounds of this mm. material. They come in all manner of different shapes, different colors. And you know, you see, you've got that golden moment there. We have a drop pair here that have With those. that golden moment, yeah, I noticed that earlier on. You're talking thousands. And this is, as I said, other than this showcase today, even the shell itself is a feature of high jewelry. You know, when you go to the jewelry editor, for instance, this is the bracket they put it in conch pearls alongside mellow and giant clam pearls they, they are created naturally making them exceptionally rare you know they all every single one of them is formed in the same way essentially the creature that creates every pearl on that page is creating a miniature version of itself they're not created with nacre and as such they're measured by the carrot weight you've got the the conch is the pink variety yeah the mellow is your orange or your papaya color and then obviously that white which is Pure. even the rarest in that image is is larger sure but it's also the only pure white natural pearl in existence yeah, stunningly beautiful. and mickey moto are the only jewelers that i know that even work with it right you've got it here this is the new natural high jewelry necklace from japanese pearl master mickey moto and you've got the conch you've got the mellow but you've also got that glorious drop shape giant clam wow. pearl at the bottom and they call them these extremely rare non-nacrous natural pearls I am about to offer you something that I can guarantee we'll never offer to you again. We've got strands, we've got drops, and we've got a ring, that's it. And it is, you know, with Queen Conch, we have to source a lot of the, the, the Queen Conch, mm -hmm. uh, Mother of Pearl, the shell, to create that jewelry, as with the mellow, because it's very, very thin. This is one giant clam. Yep. So everything here is, is born of the same giant clam. That's it. Just and, and, amazing. And it was, it was, you know, exciting to hear that we found one, that we'd sourced one. 
It was unbelievable. Something that we've been chasing for three years and they said we finally source one. Uh, we're going to polish it up and see if we can produce this. And this is everything. The whole idea, as you know, if any of you tune in and many of you do migrate between the two channels, we do Queen Conk here, we do Queen Conk on our sister channel, we do mm -hmm. Mellow here, we do Mellow on our sister channel. This is everything we have, right? the most limited collection, and it will only be here on Jewelry Maker because we don't okay. have another giant clown. Okay. I don't, you don't hear about them being found, you don't hear about them getting fish from the depths. They are literally almost like fairy tales. I guess because of their stature, their size, mm. they're not. It's not like they're going to be washed up to the shore either, That's because it. of the sheer volume. And also, they're not. They're not. They're not even caught as a byproduct. You know, yeah. sometimes the queen conch is dredged up when they're fishing for for uh, all manner of different things. With this, because of the depths they exist at, yeah. You just unless you're searching for them and you don't know where to look, they are just accidentally found. Wow. That's why these, what we're offering you is the rarest pearl on earth, bar none. Wow. So and people might say, oh, the pearls from the Gulf of Persia. I would have said before I started this journey, mellow pearl is the most expensive. Well, in Tucson, I saw a 42 carat, per, I put it on my Instagram, my Facebook, perfectly round, probably the best in the Western world right now, um, mellow pearl, mm. right? And it was exquisite. And there, there were lots of vendors that had mellow pearls, but that was the, the most incredible. Yeah. I didn't see any round giant clamper. Wow. You know, I saw some misshapen ones and they're very expensive and they have that flame patterning because this is cut from from the, the mother of pearl and it is, you know, if you were sending this to a lamb, they wouldn't be able to tell you if it's a pearl or a pearl because it's not a traditional pearl or even cut from the body of the, the material. Same material. We are just being open with you right now because otherwise a strand would be millions, actually millions. Yeah, of Not course. like high jewelry price and application, I'm telling you a strand would be millions. Yes. There isn't a strand. Yeah. You know, when we talk about Mickey Moto, they have one piece. Yeah. You know, and, and when we talk about that one time in history that I'm even aware that a strand was put together, and it was probably put together over generations, it traded for one of the most expensive real estates in the world. Yeah. And God knows where that piece is now. You have the opportunity to work with the giant clam right now, and you have that flame patterning that exists on all of this, and you have to just look beneath the surface and you'll see. You'll probably see it in the 12 mil ring. In a time when pearls have never been more expensive, ever, like I told you about what happened in Tucson with like even just culture oh. pearls. You can't culture these, but you know, I held a million dollar necklace and it was cultured South Sea. You know, that is the reality for pearls right now. They're very difficult. We are very fortunate to have this collection for you, but I am gonna warn every single one, this is limited. Nothing here with 100, nothing no. here with 150, or even close to 100. I don't wanna mislead anyone. It is now or never, and you'll never hear of the giant clam again. Wow. The, the ring, for instance, for me, is as good as it gets. Oh when you God, look at that, amazing. If that was at Basel World, Munich World, if it was in the Mickey Moto yeah. glass case, and they said this is carved from, you know, the the giant clam, and you see it, and you start to see that flame, and you see the size and that porcelain-like structure, I, I would it would be price and application. That piece right there would be price and application. This is purely through tenacity and drive that we even have this collection. The fact that we just didn't give up, and we we just made it very clear. We want to do this. We want to bring this to people. Now, remember, even uh, you know pieces that are carved from um, the the Queen Kong, from the mother of pull of the Queen Kong, from the shell, um, sell for sixty thousand mm. dollars. You know, we've seen them. Mm, yeah. This is far rarer. Wow. The, there is no byproduct of this. You know, when you go to the Turks of Caicos, you'll see Queen Kong pieces just sold as ornaments because yeah. once they've got the pearl out, they put them to one side. That never happens with this material. Many of us have never even seen a giant clam. No. Right? We, we just know that they exist. Yeah. It's, I can't even put uh, it into perspective how rare this is. I can't give you an accurate comparison. All I will say to, to all of you is, as far as I'm concerned, as far as everything that I know, and I'm by no means an expert, this is the rarest uh, collection I've ever been involved in. Mm. You know, I'm very fortunate to work with Jewelry Maker and Gemporia, and we have um, you know, these incredible budgets. We have great relationships. If, if money was no option, I could go and get Imperial Jade out for you. Yeah. Money was no option, I could go and get you pink diamonds. I could get you cashmere sapphires. I could get you Burmese yeah. rubies. This, even if money was no option, they do not exist. So it's, it's like, you know, and, and the thing is, there isn't a mine, you don't know where to look. You can't just go, well. It's a vast ocean. It's a vast ocean and it's extraordinary depths. Yeah. You know, you're, you're talking, I, I, could, I don't know how deep, I know it's meters and meters down, pretty much where there is no light that enters. Oh gosh, And you, know, you see the scuba divers down there, and whenever you see images of this material, you'll see it with a, with a huge beam of light where they've gone down and they've found it, and they just don't disturb it, and it's just lying there in the water. 
you know, it's just huge, it's vast, and it's been there for decades, generations in some cases. Do you know, I remember talking to uh, um, a mineral collector that used to, used to dive for Megalodon teeth. Oh, wow. Which would, must be the same depths oh, as sure. what you're yeah, talking I'm about. Sure. And I remember him mm. saying that, you know, the risk of doing this, mm -hmm. because it's usually in complete darkness. Yeah. Um, and you might feel something go past you, oh but you don't God. know what it is. And you are literally feeling around for oh them my God. to find these megalodon yeah. teeth. It's those kind of environments, yeah. if yes. they exist, Absolutely. Where, they, where they would be. Yeah, and, and like I said, when when these are discovered, when they are recovered, mm. it is once in every five, ten years wow. that a giant clam is recovered. You know, and they're excited that there may be a pearl in them because of the, the length of time they've been in the waters. More often than not, they're actually is. The, the giant clam is actually the one that has the highest success rate, success rate of producing a pearl. Wow. Because if you think it's at those depths, it's there for decades. Yeah, there understood. is going to have been an irritant that has got in there at some point. Yeah, of course. And, and you know, there has been many instances um, throughout history where they've opened up a giant clam and there's dozens of pearls in there. Wow. Yeah, dozens. And you've but got you have to find it. You have to find it. And, and you know, we're talking about something that, you know, we, as I said, with the Queen Conk, you know, we, we, we hope we need them to be at least 12, 14 years old to create the Queen Conk collection because you need that thick, thick uh, mother of pearl. These are decades old, 80, 90, 100 it's years. amazing, isn't it? That have just been there in, in you know, the depths of the ocean. Wow. Um, and we have managed to put together this very small collection. You won't have seen pearls like this. You won't have seen strands like this. It is the purity of, of that ivory color and it is that flame patterning. There is something magical about these. And I'm gonna say to anyone, this has been a labor of love. We have tried to put together as much as we can, but we've, it's all from one giant clam. You've got three different sizes in the strands. That's been done deliberately so you can create that graduated look if you so wish. We've got the, the Barbara Hutton type clasp, which I've always asked for. I think it's fitting that we do it with this. Mm. And then we have the drop pair and the, and the ring as well. I am gonna start, I think, with the largest strand, aren't we, Ross? Okay, so this, for all of us now, this will be the first time you've ever seen a, a strand of giant clam. Yeah. Right, for me it is too, yeah. like in person. I've been talking about this for four years and uh, it's always been impossible. The whole reason, by the way, just so you're all aware, the whole reason that we set up uh, a, a shell carving team in Hong Kong was just in the hope that we one day find one. Right, so they, they work with Queen Kong. So this they were is all the blueprints to yeah. this. That, that was us, you know, working with that material. As rare as it is, as beautiful as it is, the whole idea was to get a giant clam wonder. Wow. And I was, I was okay with the fact that it might be 10 years, it might be 15 years, but yeah. if we had it, we've got the team to be able to produce something like this. And it's just so happened to work out that you guys get access to it. I would love know? to bring this to Gem Porter. Genuinely, I would. I would love to have had finished jewelry yeah. ready to go, but we, we don't have the quantities at all. So do you remember mm. the diamond cutting companies that were trying to mastermind faceting pearls? Yeah, it took Kamatsu. them two decades. Yeah, the Kamatsu co company in Japan. Yeah. That's basically what you've achieved, not faceting, yeah. but you've achieved that yes. goal. Yeah. That so goal. It's, and each time we've learned something new with the Queen Kong, it was about understanding how we get that sashimi pink, you know, yeah. how much yield we get out of a fully mature mother yeah. of, of pearl out of a, a Queen Kong. With the mellow, it was a completely different challenge because that, uh, the volute um, shell is much thinner. Even yeah. if it's you know, fully mature, it's very thin. Right. And it had never been attempted for, never. We were the first team to do it, and we produced that. This is the hope that we always had that we would find a giant clam, and if we did, we'd be able to create with all parts of it. This is that this collection. It's all precious. Yeah, it's, it's the rarest collection I have been a part of, and in, in turn, it's the rarest collection that Gemporia in 20 years and Jewelry Maker in 12 years, 13 years? How long have we been going? We've been four, uh, 13 years, 13 almost years 14. That we've ever bought to you. Yeah. Something so rare you've never heard of. This is the collection. I'm gonna give you a 30 second clock. Remember, this is ridiculously limited. There is wow. no frame of reference for this, by the way. Um, These don't exist. For, for the Queen Kong, I could say to you, look at this in Bonhams, for the carved shell. Um, it, I could also take you to First Dibs, I could take you to Alessandro Sabatini and say, oh, look at these chandelier earring drops. They're $60,000. Do you the first people ever to own this material? That's incredible. That is amazing. They're, they're so rarely found <coughs> that they're never carved. Museums would just want to have one in an exhibit because they're so large and impressive. Yeah, they're So beautiful. they'll just buy it as is. And uh, museums will often just bid on it, you know, outbid each other to have one. Dave, update from the call center. Yeah. They've said they've, they've phoned the gallery 
because they've had 70 phone calls. Well, then these are sold out. In much. the conversation. Can, can I just say, there's another little known fact that I found out when we, when we secured this giant clam. We didn't want it to hit the open market. When you go to museums, natural history museums around the world, they talk about mineralogy, gemology, fossils. Did you know that there's more plaster casts, I think that's the right terminology, of a giant clam than there is giant clams in museums? Really? Yeah, so th th there'll be one uh, specimen in a museum, maybe in New York, and they will loan it out just so someone can create a mold of it. And then they can create something that looks identical so they can show the size and how impressive it is. That's how rarely they're found. So most museums, if you've ever seen one in a museum, the odds are that it's, it's not even a giant clam. It's just a mold, a mold of a giant clam that exists. This wow. is the real one. Yeah. There's, there's not anything else. I mean, you think about how rare fossils are, like you said. Yeah. Every museum's going to have a megalodon tooth. Yeah. Yeah. Every fossil museum, anyway. Yeah. They're also going to have different versions of dinosaurs. Of course. Right? I'm not, I'm not uh, au fait with the terminology with dinosaurs, but <laughs> you know, we see those impressive structures that are put yeah. together. Um, everyone's got one. They bid on them. They buy them from different places. I know uh, my, my friends in Australia find them in the opal fields. Yeah. Know, these fossils that, that turn up in the ancient sea of Scaramanga and the museums come and buy them. That's how rare this is. Wow. They're so rare that there is more molds of a giant clam Created. in museums than actual giant clams. Wow. And this is a giant clam that hit the open market and our team were there to take advantage. Look how beautiful it is. Yeah. I've but never you, seen, uh, this is a strange sentence, but I've never seen a white like it. No, no, it's, that's, why we, that's why I started like this. When you think of pearls, when you think of Audrey Hepburn, Marilyn Monroe, Sirens of the Silver Screen, you know, the, the timeless pearls, you always yeah. think white. I know it's amazing to have all the different colors, but originally you always think yeah. of that, that pure white. And that's why we said we want to do the giant clam. Little did I know how naive I was back then that it's ridiculously rare. It's a stupid statement to but make. But you didn't let go of that goal. Well, no, I just thought, yeah, if we never get to do it, we never get to do it. But, you know, you might as well try. And so, you know, what a great stopgap to have Queen Kong. Amazing. What a great stopgap to have the mellow pearl. <gasps> can the you imagine the shirt. Queen Kong with it? Yeah, I can. How, how amazing. beautiful would yeah. that be? Oh my goodness, and you might have but that. But by the way, it. this is, I don't know how many times, but if Sarah is 10,000 times rarer than a diamond, I can't express to you how many thousand times rarer this is than, than, than any cultured pearls. Yeah. Like South Sea, South Sea strand like that. Yeah. This is many thousands of times rarer. Well, they are cultured, rarer. aren't they? Exactly. So they're farmed. Yeah. Every season, there's a new batch yeah. that are ready. Yeah. This, like I said, even if, obviously, we've had 70 calls to the contacts and we know it's going to sell out. You know, and if our board of directors come to me and say, Dave, we need to get some more of that, please. We'll double <laughs> your budget, we'll triple your budget, just go and get more. It's impossible. Yeah. Like, you know, they're always looking for them. They just course. cannot find them. And you've got the opportunity to own it. And we've got such a high grade here. You know, like I said, what you will notice once you inspect it on, a, on, on, on closer inspection is there is a flame that exists yeah. Beautiful in the giant markings, plant. yeah. Absolutely. Remember, we talk about La Pellegrina Pearl, right? Yeah. You know, uh, from the, the esteemed uh, annals of history that was once owned by Elizabeth Taylor, but it goes far further back than that. Mm -hmm. uh, Marie Antoinette, I think. It goes all the way back. A pearl from this giant clam is the most expensive pearl ever. Hundred million dollars. Wow. Million. By, by Forbes. I wonder how And it's long not even like, you know, and it, it, everything goes out the window. It's not usually when you think about the most expensive pearl in the world. It's gonna, it's got to be perfect round. It's got to be, you know, uh, the best orient. It's got to be, or when it comes to flame, it's got to have full coverage. Now, you know, so let's be honest. That hundred million dollar pearl is so ugly. It's yeah, misshapen. I don't, I don't know what you do with it. Yeah, well, you can't do anything. But it's just so rare to have. Yeah. This giant clam rounds, which are carved from the mother of pearl which is in many respects far rarer than the pearls that it produces. Because as I said, there are many instances documented throughout history where you know, sailors have pulled in a giant clam and they've opened it up and there's dozens and dozens of pearls in there. But there's only one clam. There's only one clam. Yeah. That's, yeah, wow. It's the only, it's the only one you can say that about. Yeah. The only kind of bivalve mollusk that you can say that about that is rarer Where than the its pearl. Where the actual... It's rarer than its pearl. Wow. And uh, visually, they're absolutely incredible, aren't but they're, they? They're, it's hard to say this, but they are. They're flawless. They're actually flawless. Symmetrical, wow. perfectly round, 
flame patterning on some of these that would just shimmer beneath the surface ever so delicately. Yeah, you've achieved that grade. You're right, Ross. Yep. You know, you, these are the most, this is Mickey Moto, for goodness sake. They, they know pearls. Of course. So yeah. they have sourced the best conch pearl. Not the largest, but the best. Look at that sashimi pink. Yeah. They've also got one of the best mellow pearls. It's course. a drop shape, yep. but it's orange. Now, the mellow pearls can be brown more often than not. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to the giant clam, what they want is that, that linen white. Yeah, so I mean, just to get to some perspective, Dave, they're all mm. leading towards that, the, you know, the, the giant clam. Yeah. Uh, you know, how much would that uh, queen conch be? How much would the mellow pill be? That, that, you're not queen talking... conch, that queen conch, just to put it into perspective, I can show you some, if, if, I think I've got it. And those are the ones really, no disrespect to them, whilst beautiful, yeah. are not as rare as the giant clam. N so, not in any respect. Um, trying to find if I've still got, I might have had a different farm when I was in the Caribbean, but... Um, I was offered a, a queen conch, it was 15 carats, I'm guessing it was around that size, and it was $15,000, just loose. That's just the pink. When I was, like, straight out of the waters. Wow. And you've got... A mellow. So you put that in 15 grand, mellows are always more expensive, so, you know, let's be really conservative and say that's, that's twenty, twenty-five thousand dollars $25,000. Just on those two. Maybe it's more, I'm not a pearl expert, but that is a very intense colour, so it's probably more. So you're talking almost 50,000 just in those top two, and then you lead to that huge giant clam pearl at the base. Which is rarer. Yeah. Wow. I'm going to start. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not qualified to even give you a price on this. We're just going to give you the odd deals. But even if we said, oh, this full strand, this huge strand, 10 mil, we're going to do it for, you know, three and a half thousand pounds. It would be incredible. Mm-hmm. But we're just, there's just nowhere start. else there in the world no, doing what you're doing right now no one can like literally no one can we used yeah. everything everything from that giant clam is on this table yeah a lot of waste but we wanted to create something that was wearable that was divine that was beautiful well not even our very own sister channel can do this no ah uh, hello caroline caroline in greater manchester has been as we've always mentioned collecting gems for over 50 years and says what a stunning gem this is beautiful i'm putting a strand with my queen conch yeah, carving beautiful. that's stunning that would be amazing Okay, 30 second clock, we're nowhere near done. We have been inundated with messages and yeah. calls to the contact center, and we understand why. We've been waiting for this, we've been talking about this for some four years, it's finally here. And it's only gonna be here for a fleeting moment. Yeah, well, uh, in terms of quantity, I'm, this is, I'm almost re reluctant to ask this question because it's a, a joy to even have one opportunity, yeah. but is there availability mm -hmm. on these? There was, there is. There's about 60, I believe. Okay. So existence. urgency is definitely needed. Yeah. And they're huge as well. 10, Ten mil, mil rounds, yeah. Okay, this is where it's going to get crazy for anyone who wants to get involved. Um, because of the amount of interest, usually I'd stagger this. So I would say to Ross, you know, take a thousand pounds off, maybe take two thousand pounds off. Ross, we're going to take three thousand pounds wow. off the price right now, just because we've seen the multi buyers, we've seen so many of you on the phone lines. I know you're itching to get involved on the other ones as well, so you can create that graduated look. I'm going to not mess around today. We're going to offer you the m and look at it on the skin tone. Yeah, it's <clears throat> gorgeous. Any it skin lights tone. up, yeah. doesn't it? Absolutely. Absolutely stunning. Swansea, Valerie, Pamela, Jeanette, Hazel, Beverly, Maker in Greater London, Maker in Greater Manchester, Maker, Tina, uh, another Maker, Nottingham, you're there. Guys, we're, we're actually nowhere near done. I was not expecting this to be three figures, to be truthful. Nope. I don't think, well done to every single one of you that is scrolling along the bottom of the screen. The absolute rarest strand that we've put on your screens. Something ever. that has been, yeah, ever. Uh, Hazel, you've got two of these, congratulations. Wow. Um, there, th once this is gone, this is gone. This is one opportunity, one time. Mm -hmm. And you've got the biggest look here, the biggest rounds. If any of our Gemporia audience are watching they right now, they are. and they will well, be, Hazel is. You know, it's, it, it, it's so simple to get this stranded. Yes. You could just walk it into a, into a, you know, a good quality jewelers, get, it, get them to knot it with a silk and add a gold clasp. Yeah. You know, and, so and simple know, to do that. I don't know that. if this shows. I hope it does. This is one of the smaller ones. But you'll see this flame that shimmers just beneath the surface as, I, as I'm moving it right now. Thank you, Bruce. And I just wanna show you, it probably won't come across because of the lights, but it's far from just an opaque color. You can see these moments. This is what we call the flame that exists in only non-nacrous pearls. And you get it in you know, a host of these. I'm nowhere near done. We're taking hundreds of pounds off, but I'm gonna ask you to be um, quick. 10 mil rounds. Good luck, everybody. 
Good luck to each and every single one of you. Yeah, again, it's our lighting, our studio lighting. Yeah, that's not fine. That's fine. It, we under promise, we over deliver. We understand. We understand it's going to look much better when you get it home. Okay, we'll do a thirty-second clock. I did say it, hundreds of pounds are coming off, which is going to give you, I hope, the confidence when the other pieces come up to just get involved, get them into your collection. A third of the stock has gone well done, already. Congratulations. I, I, again, Dave, I was not expecting these to go anywhere near triple figures. No. Nope. You know, it's it's for us. It's just been a labour of love, and now we're supremely proud to to be the first jewellery house in the world to bring these to the market. Years in the waiting. Yeah. Years in the waiting. Look at it. And these are the biggest that we have yes. in a strand, obviously. The biggest we could do. Yeah. Okay, five hundred pounds is uh, amazing. I think we'll all agree. Mm. But we are going lower for our collectors. We've been working on this for a long time. This goes down to one nine nine. Good luck. A sensational opportunity be as fast as you can this affects everything in the show of course. remember almost half the stock has now been allocated we have had a lot of calls from uh, our contact center from you guys yeah. who wanted to get involved who wanted to be part of this this is a supreme opportunity maker in gloucestershire linda in hertfordshire we've got janice in north yorkshire we've got hazel in hampshire's multi board tina maker swansea somerset devon nottingham wow unbelievable don't wait is the key you if you know this is the rarest opportunity, not just here at Jewelry Maker, across the entire partnership. Uh, just an amazing, I almost, do you know when you actually, and I'd never really thought about it up until, uh, up until hearing about this amazing showcase, but you know, we've all seen it in like say, Disney cartoons, pictures, depictions of the, um, of the giant clam. Actually, yes, didn't actually know it existed. You know, and yet here we are bringing you a collection of this absolutely exquisite treasure. Um, again, that bit, that necklace on Mickey Moto speaks volumes to me. Speaks volumes. Half the stock has gone. Yeah, and just before it sells out, just before this sells out, because I'm, I'm, I'm very aware of how limited this is, and I can see the phone lines. Ross, this isn't our price, by the way. And what? Al, this isn't our price. It was never intended to be the price. What did I say at the very start? I said, it's been a labor of love. You know, you, sometimes, I'll let you in behind the, the, the curtain right now. Sometimes we have to protect something from going too low because we, we're, gonna, we're gonna bring it four times a year, three times a year. Okay. We have no intention to bring this back. No this intention. It was just to be able to say, we have done it. Okay. You know, if it was easier, we'd do it. This is, I know it's about to sell out. None of you are paying this price. You, even if it sells out, we're going lower. We're not going a little bit. Um, just to give you an idea of how low this is going to be. You said we've had 70 or 80 calls to the contact center yeah. before we opened up. The, you wait, this collection, I know it's not even up for pre-order, it will disappear when you see how low we're going. Remember, this is the 10 mil. This is the biggest carat weight. These are the biggest sizes anywhere in the world. It's a full strand. This is not just a piece. Can I have a 30 second clock, please, Adam? This is going to be the busiest show that I've ever been a part of. I also do really, really sympathize with our financial director right now. Oh, yeah. Who will be saying- Don't ever sympathize with them, LG. <laughs> the, he's joining the dark side. Sorry. Yeah, come but on. No, I do, I'm not saying that I don't want to do it, yeah. but she would be like, well, if you can't replace it, why are you doing these prices? Yeah, that uh, is what we're about though, Dave. Exactly. That's what you're That's what about. I remind her. I always say to, to our financial director, um, obviously, she's, she's quite new to the business yeah. and um, she hasn't had too many interactions with Steve Bennett. And I said, have you met Steve? <laughs> and she's like, yeah, I was like, he's a maniac. This is, this is, he is, isn't he? You've met him, you know him. Yeah. He's a maniac, yeah, right? And, but that's what we love. And I know Steve, he kind of is a part of this in the background, but like the whole ethos, the whole mantra stems from that. Yeah. 199, and it's about to sell out. Tell me another jeweler anywhere in the world. Yeah, Mickey Moto launched this. I know it's a one of a kind, but said they had 60 He's of them. Said they had 60 of them. He is, and they're, they're in Munich world, they're in Basel world, where they like, like to, you know, in the glitz and glamour, luxury Monte Carlo, they like to launch their new collections. Imagine if they had, Every, because they're selling business to business as other jewelers going, we'll take five of those for our boutiques, we'll take six. They're all gone, they're all allocated at the price that, that has been attributed to that. Imagine if they go, but you're not paying that, we're gonna go lower. It's insane, <laughs> it's, not a great, it's not a great business model, but, but that is why, That's that is why about. we don't advertise, we don't have uh, banners and billboards, we're not in glossy magazines, no. we don't have TV adverts going out, um, and yet, and we're, we're buried away on TV and on the app, but it's still why between Jewelry Maker and Gemporia, 
this is an insane fact. We have a million unique customers around the world. Absolutely. Isn't that crazy? That's what amazing. A cult. What a cool. You know, it yeah. really is. It's like this this secret members club. Yeah. You know, we're, we're, and it's even more evident here because we have the trade tuned in so much. <laughs> this is about to sell out. If our finance director was, was watching right now, I should rip her hair out. And I'm going to go, do you know what? We're not going to do 199. We're not doing 179. We're not doing 149. We're going to go 99 quid. We're going to take a hundred pounds oh off. And I know you're probably going to miss me. out on this one, but there's other strands coming up. They're all just as limited, even though we, we're fully aware that so many of you have multi and are happy at this price. Uh, you know, we're not bringing this oh, wait, back. Wait, wait, you it's meant that with this? Yeah, this one's going 99 pounds. It's got 99 pounds. We've got split payments Never mind on it. Steve. No, People in glass houses and all mm. that, Dave. I know. Um, you're a maniac. Oh, I'm happy. <laughs> I, I would rather uh, associate with Steve Bennett than our finance team, <laughs> unlike you, Al, who, who puts yourself in the finance team's shoes. Forget that. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I know which side of the road I want to be on. No, it's the I'm one with having you. the crazy party. No, believe me, I'm with you. 99.99. That's absolutely yep. incredible. But it does have a bit of a knock-on effect. Yes, it does. In, it does in, indeed. Look, you know, the there, there, there is a reality, right? You know, when when you have something like this that you can know you can never repeat, and I'll be honest, it's just been a nightmare from day one. Yeah, but I'm in sure. the best way, it's been like a this this ridiculous Dream. journey. Yeah, to to get to this point. We're not looking to get back into the market. No. We're not looking to, to make our money back so we can go and replace this. It's irreplaceable. I said at the start, any money, you just can't find them. Hmm. So I'm not going to lose sleep about the fact that we're just losing money. It, it's what we do. It's fun. Steve, Steve and, and the rest of the, the management, senior management team, every now and again when they do training sessions, they're like, do you know what? Sometimes the best thing to do is to lose money. Like yeah. There's 365 days in the year. Yeah. If you lose money one day, it's think true. about the message you're sending out. Think about how people are going, I've got an incredible deal. I'm yeah, definitely going back there. You know, and, and there'll be people at home that have never shopped and they go, well, I can't miss that. Sometimes, I, I, I think supermarkets call it a lost leader, don't they? Yeah. There are some supermarkets that get like a TV in um, and they put it at the back of the store and they're 100 pounds cheaper than any other retailer. And they know they're not making any money on it, but they know you've got to walk past the bread and the eggs and you're there anyway, so you're going to add all that. Of course. And, and th th that is you know, the, the aim of business. Now, of I'm not a businessman at all by any stretch but I know right now by doing something and losing a bit of money it makes us you know you're going to remember it you're going to get this home you're going to you're going to get your valuations you're going to create the most astonishing jewelry with it and you're going to go I don't think anyone else in the world well, would do that it's also publicity for us yeah. without actually publicizing if that makes sense yeah, it's the to best be able kind, to say it? that look look at what jewelry maker brought their audience yes yeah, 100% um, absolutely amazing now we need to mention jewelry makers um, these are super over allocated there's 14 left. Uh, apologies. But there's loads of you with it in your basket. Right, should um, we do a minute clock to close this one out? Yeah. There are two further strands coming up. But you know what? I know it's not on pre-order. I'm fully aware of that. I know how the mechanics work. If, if, Jen, if I'm in your position, I know you've already called the call center already. Um, 70 of you had already done that. I'd call them up now and just say, oh, I want the eight mil and the six mil. Yeah, I was I'd just call them up and say, please, I just want them. I know it's going to be great. Again, I, I'm, I'm amazed this was in triple figures. Yeah. I was expecting this because of the rarity of it. Mm -hmm. I was expecting it to be four figures. Yeah, uh, just let put it, put yourself in um, in the real world for a second. Yeah. Now, imagine you and me. We had a boutique jewelers on Bond Street or yeah. in a jewelry quarter in Birmingham or you know any any of those you know kind of prime real estate areas for jewelry, and someone walks in and we've got a 19 mil South Sea pole necklace, cultured in a in a floating glass case here, and it's uh, five hundred thousand mm. dollars. And then next to it, you've got the equal, uh, equally beautiful and stunning golden South Sea culture pearls, yeah. right? And, and that, again, is about five to $600,000 at 19 mil right now. You've got Tahitian, you've got everything. Then you've got this and a glass cabinet in the back, and, you, and then you have a cast, a model of the giant clam, right? Because you can't get the real one. And then you talk to them, you go, oh, yeah, these are farmed, these are farmed, these are farmed. They're half a million, half a million, half a million. But if you just come to the back here, this is uh, rarer than everything combined. And you're going to get it for a thousand pounds, two thousand yeah. pounds, five thousand pounds. It will be sold out. Of course. But we've just done it for ninety-nine pounds. Yeah, crazy. Well done, congratulations. Well um, done, everybody. Amazing, Dave. I was not expecting that at all, but a little reminder: it does have a little bit of a knock-on effect. A hundred percent. And I want you to know that as well. Um, We've got, is it the 8 mil we have? Yes. Yeah, we've got the 8 mil rounds. Those are the ones that I was showing a moment ago on camera when I was saying you can actually see the flame yeah. beneath the surface. Uh, just as limited though, 
but you already now are aware that we want you to get all three. We want you to create that strand, oh, that graduated imagine? strand, that look. You can do it. You can break these up, create three or four necklaces probably with the lengths that we're offering you. This is, this is going to be open. We'll give you a 30 second clock. I wouldn't wait. No. I'd be on the calls now. Some of you might even just prefer this look. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, eight and six millimeter in, in, in sort of no, no disrespect, sort of a generic gemstone wood is, is, is usually what some of our most popular. Yeah. But in something like this. Mm -hmm. I know it says 18 seconds. Genuinely, I'd call now. Yeah. Because there is Get never, there, there's not the a chance of bringing these back. Sure. Um, and again, no cues on the phone lines, no cue, uh, sorry, on the website, no cues on the app. Yeah. Um, I know there's less than 100 of these, obviously. Yeah, yeah far less. There's about 60, isn't there, Ross? 65. Okay, 65, amazing. Giant clam rounds, eight mil. That's the phone lines now. Yeah. Okay, so there's not the 65 now, is there, Ross? No. There's gotta be what? I'd say 35 now. Yeah. Will these go with Jada or the Ruby we have got over the last couple of days? Oh. And that's from Sally. Sally, you are the designer. I don't think when you're talking about those colors, the monochromes, the black and the whites, I don't know what they don't go with. Yeah. They go with everything. That's the beauty of them. But you, you create, you, you, you dream what you want to create. Yes, it's going to go with Jade. Yes, it's going to go with Rubies. Look at that. You know, Dave, I am in shock that we can get these rare items at this price. Can we get the shells like we got the pearl shells? No, Sally, I can't get you the shells. I cannot, get, the whole shell is this shell. Okay. Yeah, museums can't difference. get you the giant clam shell. Just want to stress how rare they are. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, that's a really good. That's a really good point, though, isn't it? You know, you go to somewhere like the the, the golden lip pearl. Um, you can get that oyster, can't you? Oh yeah. The South Sea pearl yeah, yeah, oyster. Yeah. You can get Dis that. Disregarded because obviously it's a byproduct of yeah. being in the pearls. This uh, is the, the this highest is grade. Will go to the gem. Uh, the jewelry houses. Now the message from Sue in Edinburgh that says, <laughs> "You are mad, Dave. I am. I am mad. Uh, 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 that's an extraordinary price for something so rare, almost uh, unique to to such as us." Uh, well, it is. Yeah. It is unique. It is unique to you guys at home. It's this unique isn't offered to... anywhere else. No. It's absolutely beautiful as well. It literally glows, mm -hmm. doesn't it? Yeah, it has this, it, the way that it glows, yeah, it has a life to it, these, these incredible moments. Half the um, stock's gone. Half the stock's gone. So I'm going to go to 99 pounds. We should stop there. We should actually stop north of there. Yeah. Okay, like that first strand probably, even even by jewelry maker standards, should probably be 299. This one should be 199, 179 at the push. I'm gonna start at 99 pounds because as L quite rightfully said, it has a knock-on effect. I'm not it stopping does. there. I'm gonna give you a 30 second clock. Half oh the stock has gone, there's 30 opportunities that are remaining now. So wait and you a already minute. know I'm going lower than this. Wait a minute, what I've got over the back of my hand right now, excluding yeah. the ring, I'm talking the strands, but that's 200 pounds. Mm -hmm. And, not, and we're and about to give you change. It's not 200 pounds, yeah. Oh my goodness me. Look at, I mean, they are so bright and pure. Yeah, it's like linen white. Yes. It has a life, it has a flame underneath the surface of these. That they, they, they are very different to traditional pearls in the fact that traditional pearls have an orient. Yeah. These have a flame. 69.99 is what I'm gonna do on this. Could we have gone 89, yeah, 79, yeah. We're gonna do 69. There's still six miles to do. Yep, we might not do them. <laughs> we might not do them because it's crazy, but we will obviously, because I know some of you have managed to bypass oh the contact my center goodness and me. have already ordered them. Make sure you're getting the ring. Please make oh, sure you're getting the ring. Oh, the ring is beautiful. I'm loving that. I've been wearing it all morning. Um, Dave, the other thing which I find absolutely fascinating when we're talking about a clam, a, a giant clam that yeah. exists in the greatest depth of the ocean, when yeah. we we know what less than two percent about the ocean. Yeah, I think we haven't. We, we know more about space. More, yeah, yeah, yeah. But to have that brightness when there's no light. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I find it's, that amazing. I do too. I, I'm, I'm amazing. completely with you. I think you know this is one of the secrets of of the, of, of the depths of the ocean. You know, it's it is a fairy tale gem that you're getting right now. I love that. And do you know that's how it should be described, the ultimate fairy tale gem? It is, it is. You know, when you yeah. think of the little mermaid and you think of yeah. those moments, and you think of, you know, the, those giant clams, even as a child, the idea of a giant clam was yeah. something that was present in my mind. I don't know where from. No. You used to see like um, ornaments for bathrooms that yeah. were like small replicas of the giant clam. Yeah. You no, know, like soap holders and things. It's just a, it's a shape that we always see, but we've never, never actually, actually seen. Never actually seen. You know, this and it's just ever present in your mind. You're like, oh yeah. And then you start thinking to yourself, well, it's, it's just a, it's just it's, a myth. It's, it's just like myth. what we pretend is in the ocean. No, it's not. It exists. It's beguiled human history for millennia. 
You know, we've always known of its existence and it's had such an impression on, on, on humans. Yeah. But very few have actually seen it. Yes. Yeah, and you've, you're wearing it right now on the back of your hand. Let, al yeah, let alone being able to work it into jewellery. And, and again, the fact that museums don't actually have the clamshell. Well, some do, some do. A um, few. A few do. And what they do is because they all work together, it's all about education. They loan them out. They move them around. So people around. can, can uh, make moulds of them. I'm going to do a minute clock to close Amazing. on this. We do have the other rounds coming up, which are going to oh, be sensational. Look at that. Unbelievable. And, and, and again, I, did, I had no knowledge of what this was going to. I was just super excited about the opportunity to be part of this amazing, uh, amazing one-time show. And it is one-time show. Yep. But never in my wildest dreams, Dave, was I expecting it to be anywhere near what no. the price points that you're doing. Mm -mm. Unbelievable opportunity. Do you know what and I want to do at some point, if it's okay? Uh, say it to Ross, I'll say it to Adam and the team. Yeah. I want to, when we do showcases of this absolute rarity, yeah. it's only three or four times a year, yeah. I want to change the whole set. Yeah. Yeah, I want to have the glass cabinet here. Yeah, 100%. You know, a, a, a proper glass cabinet that you that, that it should be in. I want you to see it in all its glory. Because it's totally one thing agree. to have it in the studio, it's one thing to have it you know, on, on these screens, but I want you to understand what we're dealing with. And Sometimes 100%. we need to take you into the real world so you can see how, how impressive this is. Yeah, because let's be honest, you've got sand dunes behind you. I have. What you <laughs> yeah, it's true. What you should have. We shouldn't even have this desk. We should just be completely out. We should Red be carpet, stood either side spotlights. of this black case. Yeah, with I agree. The, with this incredible gemstone within it. Totally Only a agree. few times a year, but that, that's, I believe, what we should do. Congratulations, we believe wow. that sold out. Stay holding. Six mils coming up, and I know these are your favorite. I'm gonna give you a 30 second clock oh before we come in on these. Me. We still have quantity of these, Ross. Yeah. A hundred. A hundred, right. Well, this is going to be even greater oh. than you're, you're imagining right Call now. that 70, actually, because already 30 have gone well somehow. Well done. So you, you already know the deal that you're not paying. This is going to be a sublime, impressive, incredible deal for anyone hoping to get involved today. Here's a question that I didn't think I expect myself having to ask. Um, and I know your, your price point hasn't appeared on your screens, but just give me an approximate amount for all three, Roscoe. I can't even An approximate that. amount for all three, or is it Dave? Oh, it's down to you, Dave. I'm terrible at maths, as is the, as as is quite apparent with the numbers that I'm calling out. <laughs> okay. Right? Yeah, I didn't I didn't pass maths, uh, <laughs> which is obvious. For you okay. can see that, right? You're talking about. Well, we did 100 here, didn't we? 99, 99. Yeah, we did. We did 69. So 170 for the, those two. Yeah. And you've got your six mils, which is the most popular size. Yeah. And and I think you're going to want to create that, as I said, that graduated strand. Oh, that would be beautiful. Right, Just don't I'm going to start at 69.99. Oh. Nowhere near. Got 100. That's 50 people buying two. Sorry. That's okay. 50 people buying two. Valerie, you've got two. Maker in Greater Manchester's got two. This is the, the maybe you're going to be able to gift this. Maybe you're going to work with it. We're at 69.99 right now. I'll give you a 30 second clock. This is going to be the fastest to sell out, even though it's the biggest quantity, because I'm about to do something really, really. Can you imagine yeah, that? Yeah, look at that. A sartoir of giant yeah. clam pearls. Incredible. Can you imagine? Oh my goodness me. Mm -hmm. It would be beautiful. The first thing someone's going to say is, you know, I, I, love you, I love those pearls. I love those pearls you got. And you can say, they're not actual traditional pearls. These are carved from a giant clam. Significantly rare. Significantly rare. Significantly. Oh, good luck, everyone. Right. 49.99. You knew it was coming. It's going to be no one no one even like l when you saw this collection yesterday no way no way i would never even entertain heather's got two devon's got two lynn's got two valerie's got two shropshire's got two that's the way we should be doing it when you're getting a deal this good yeah absolutely it's a, it's a once in a lifetime opportunity and yeah. i know we've said we've said rare you know we we casually throw that world word around don't we actually yeah, don't I mean, well, by definition this... gemstones are rare but that, that, this, that, I wish there was another this word. This is on another yeah, scale, I wish there was another it? word just that differentiated absolute rarity, like unparalleled rarity that we're dealing with here, and rarity. There you go. That's far better, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Look at that. Wow. I mean, that's a museum piece, yes, isn't it? I love that. That look there doesn't look like it should be in jewellery maker. No. No offence. No, 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 I look at that and I just think if I saw that in jewellery make, uh, in the jewellery editor, yeah. if I saw that in Forbes, if I saw that in, a, you know, a glossy magazine and they talked about, you know, the rarity of the hundred million dollar a pearl and you saw that strand, I think it would be, the one thing that would be there is POA. POA, absolutely. Yeah. Well, how about if we told you you could make this necklace? Mm -hmm. 
for less than two hundred and twenty pounds. Uh, okay, Ross, uh, this is a. Uh, how much just for the split pays? If you, the first split pay on each of them, how much is oh. people parting with today just to get that look? Okay, so one. one so I think some of them might have four split pays or whatever. You'll know, but I don't. Oh my goodness, we'll just think, work that out. And the ring is coming up as well. The oh ring's my, my favourite piece. Oh my goodness me, utterly exquisite, Dave. Mm. And do you know what? I'm, on behalf of everybody who's managed to be successful today, and we've got jewellers getting involved as well, well we know that. Yeah. You know, for having that vision, we're very grateful. For actually having that bit vision, that dream, because it is one of those dreams that some people get, well, it's just not going to happen. It's, you know? I'll be honest, it's just naive. It's just being naive. That, no. That's what it is. It's like, oh, that would be cool. I wonder if we could do it. You know, and it's just frustrating for the teams that I work with, the guys in Hong Kong. <laughs> it's like, why, why are you coming in why here and just ruining our day? Why, <laughs> why, why can't you just have something we have here ready for you? Yeah. Why do you have to say something stupid where we have to fly around the world and, and look for these things and, and just because Get I think... Get out to the greatest like, depths of the ocean. Because they will love it. They will yeah. love it. And yeah. they're like, yeah, but they will love everything here that we've got. <laughs> Yeah, but I want to be the first to do this. It's so um, true. So I do the easy part. I am just the dreamer thinking of I this. I like that. Things. That's not a bad thing, Dave. Um, now, we've worked out the split payments. If you've got all three on split payment, the first split payment would £73.31 pence yeah so to today get to get that whole look if you're utilizing split pay you've only had to part with 73 pounds that's today. amazing absolutely amazing well they've absolutely flown well out we had 100 available lots of twos and threes stay holding Just see incredible. if there's anything available um also something that we haven't mentioned that probably is a good idea certificate of authenticity yes absolutely um because obviously it will say that it is Bomb giant, giant clam. Clam, yeah. wow right um wow. ring or earrings next or, or ring Wait. and the the ring yeah you're wearing it aren't you i love it, it. um do you want me to pass it over yeah i've been wearing no, it all I was, morning i took i took this to um to tucson Did right? you? so i was given this i didn't bring it in today because i want to keep it <laughs> and i know it's going to sell out it's absolutely beautiful my daughter loves it because i've explained to my daughter you know what this is you know where it's from look at this it's so beautiful dave yeah it's huge as well guarantee your opportunity your size but remember it's not about that How many you can do we get have? it resized 66 okay let's give you a 30 second clock to bring this live it's just stunning isn't what it what are our accent stones here um Is it sapphires or tourmalines pink spinel pink spinel yeah I mean, this is just and white to and white topaz wow pink spinel yeah, yeah. Per, it's wow. the perfect addition, isn't it? Yeah. Where's the pink spinel from Mozambique? Or it might not say. At uh, Burmese. Oh my God. So Burmese <laughs> pink spinel. Yeah. It's just ticking every box. I know. I'm trying to be conservative. I'm like, maybe they're from Mozambique. No, no, this is Burma no. pink spinel. Which I was talking about the other day, Dave. That must be on the verge of depletion as well. Oh, because the pink. Burmese yeah, that, ruby you is. You can't find it. Yeah. Okay. It's a 12 mil giant clam. Look at that! If, you, if you're, you know, if uh, you know, we have the fortune, fortunate to be speaking to jewelry makers, so you guys will have a, a, a great idea of how easy it is to resize, resize this. But if you are conscious of your size, make sure you're coming in early. Hazel's got two, Linda's got it, Katie's got it, Pamela's got it, Rosemary's got it, Linda's got it, Jeanette's got it, Catherine's got it, Valerie's got it, Maker in Devon's got it. It's like a huge kind of mar bay, isn't it? It's stunning. The largest one of the whole show. Remember, the strand was only ten mil. <laughs> this is 12 mil with, that with the halo, halo. Of, of spinel and then an outer perimeter of the marambaya topaz oh my goodness me i just love it i absolutely love it and it's one of those pieces that you notice mm -hmm. from meters away because of the purity and the brightness of that yeah. white and i love that juxtaposition between the the, the colored halo as well yeah amazing these <coughs> will sell out there's so many people getting involved just stunning okay 99.99 Pardon? Yeah, and I'm not actually going to stop there. We're going to do we, we're going to do something special for you today. But had this been had we commissioned this for Gemporia, it would be stopping north of here. Yeah, 100. percent And there's only 66. Yep. Is that down to the size of it, the 12 mil? Yeah, 12 mil, and and the design. I mean, it's a stunning piece of jewelry. Yeah, it is. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. 99.99. Okay, sizes are on the verge of okay, selling 30 out. Okay, 30 second clock, and I will just take this down to the final price for you. Please be quick. 
resize it. Sold out. It's yeah. not about that, is it? It's about owning no, this piece. No, it's about getting this piece. And as I said, we're, I'm very fortunate to be offering this to you guys here at Drawmaker because you do understand you know, how easy it is to resize this if yeah. you need to. Easily done. Art S has sold out, but yeah, it's about owning the piece itself. And it is absolutely beautiful. Rosemary's got three, Hazel's got two amazing look at that profile mm. it's just the elevation off the back of the hand okay straight down half the price if we can half the price to 49 half. yeah 49.99 this is for you the only ring of the whole show the biggest giant clam carved pearl of the whole show <laughs> with the halo of spinel with the halo of topaz and you've got it for 49.99 okay. uh, that maker in uh, greater manchester's got two rosemary's got three another collector's got two we've got janice and agnes and rachel and beryl and leslie and patricia and mary and isabel and and somerset and linda and margaret in sussex again i mean there's no way on earth i would have ever even entertained that mm -mm, no no way on earth no this Valerie's is irreplaceable got yeah and it's beautiful all that aside you know even if this was a plentiful gemstone which it quite clearly isn't but yeah it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. You know, if it was abundant, which it obviously isn't, 49 99 For any piece of jewellery, it's sensational, right? Yeah. But for uh, the only giant clam you've ever seen set into a ring. Look at how stunning this is. The elevation there. Look at that mm -hmm. craftsmanship. Yeah, it's a re it was a really beautiful piece of jewellery. Amazing. Alison in the Highlands has got two. Valerie's got two. Grady Manchester's got two. Surrey's got three. Well done, guys. There is one left in the J to K. Um, but again, resize it. it. It really doesn't matter. No. Come the end of uh, um, this showcase, I will be all over. Do this. not worry about sizes. Yeah. Just when you speak to the contact center, just say just any one that I can get my hands yeah, on. Yeah, which is available. That'll be fantastic. Patricia, you've got two. Well done. Amazing. It's absolutely amazing. Stunning. And the biggest piece that we've actually had all morning, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. Um, and will have, full mm -hmm. stop. So uh, we're up to, what, is it the penultimate piece the coming penultimate up next? Penultimate piece, yeah, the match pair. The drop earrings, uh, or, or, you know, you actually, could have them as pendants. Go on. It's the last of the giant yeah, clan. Yeah, the giant clan. Then we have a, a clasp coming up, which we've been asking for forever, um, which you'll know exactly what we're talking about. Wait a minute. So 240 something to get everything wow isn't isn't that when you, when you look at that whole collection this morning that that shouldn't be possible but it is well done stay holding on the ring do not worry about sizes now the is. earrings wow. that, that are going to come your way or the match pair those drops those incredible the mickey moto beautiful, yeah twice as rare yeah the mickey moto drop shape and here you've got those goldens as well which you can see coming through which the gia showcased when they were talking about the giant clam pearl look at those all you need is your bale, which yeah. we we bring to air frequently, frequently, and you get that perfect pair. I mean, imagine those, like you said, in earrings, or maybe as like a long line drop pendant, inspired maybe by mm -hmm. the Mickey Moto piece. I think so. Yeah, if you've got some conch, yeah, and you want to create your own version of the mellow, the conch, and the giant clam. Wow, that flame is so prominent mm -hmm. on these days. Yeah, it, it is. You can see it. Yeah, shows full coverage as well all the way there you go see look at that flame oh my god okay we're going to bring this live how many of these do we have ross 70 available oh my gosh i thought we'd have half the quantity these well, are 14 mil so these are, yeah so these are the largest yeah you we could have turned the that flame. into 140 couldn't we yes very easily and they'd sell out today you've seen how yeah. busy it is uh lynn you've got two swansea you've got two devon you've got two um i think the the fact that the, the flame is so prominent yeah so on bright. these pieces I wonder. With that, that golden moment as well. Get an idea of perspective. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Just amazing. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, I'm just going to tell everyone something because we've got 70. Um, Elle, on the match pair, on the biggest giant clam card pearls in this unique shape and the biggest quantity, um, biggest size, and the only time we've matched two together, I'm gonna to do the lowest price of the whole show. Uh, it's the last of the giant clam. So I am gonna do the lowest price of the entire showcase. So I think maybe half the stock's gone already. 
I know you get two anyway, but I think I'd follow in the footsteps of Maker in Devon and Swansea and Kent and Lorna and uh, the Highlands and Greater Manchester and I'd be multi buying. Yeah, I don't blame you. Because also, I mean, Dave, our audience will go crazy for these. Yes. Because we bring you little pendant bales. Yeah. All it takes is a little Perfect. bit of, uh, of hypo cement, leave it overnight. You've made high end jewellery. It's that simple. Yeah, I'll give you a 30 second clock. Oh my goodness me. It's about to happen. It's about to be the lowest price. I've said it. I'm not matching the lowest price. We're going to a new low. And maybe many of us thought, no, not for the not for the match pair, not for the 14 mil. But we're going to do it. So, With the most prominent flame. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. I, mean, I couldn't believe that myself. And, you know, especially in the lighting we have here, yeah. when we say how difficult it is to showcase those minute moments within gemstones, you can see it here. Well done to Beverly, who's got two. Someone's got three, four, three, two, uh, wow. two. All right, thirty-nine ninety-nine. This will be the fastest to sell out. Well done. The biggest quantity. We always say bigger the quantity, bigger the deal. But these are the biggest pieces. Yes, fourteen flame. mil in their mm -hmm. size. Because I assume, Dave. I mean, I don't know obviously how the, how how this is actually carved. Um, I assume you'd have to start with a larger piece of the giant clam to yeah. create the fourteen mil drop. Yeah, of course. I mean, and then yeah, taper it away. Yeah, absolutely, it's very wasteful. You know what you're looking at here, and and you've got that golden moment as well. This is actually from the lip of the giant okay, clam. Okay, so the exterior. only the lip, ha well, the the entrance to it oh, as it opens up. Yeah. You know where it rolls. The frill. Yeah, the frill. That is the the moment where you get those golden colours, and so only very little amount of this can produce that golden thread and you've got it in both of these drops wow. and the flame. Wow, they are like a frill though, aren't they? Yeah, that's exactly what they're like, yeah. Yeah, they have this beautiful, again, you don't, it, it's something we've all, we've all visually seen, but never actually knew existed. Yeah. yeah, you'd feel silly to bring it up because you think, oh, maybe I've only seen it. In, in stories. In, in, yeah, in storybooks, yeah. in cartoons or something, because yeah. it just, uh, it is something we kind is of have no frame Is it the giant clam that, the, 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 are they the ones that the mermaids used to use as well for yeah. the bras? Yes, they did, yeah. Wow. Um, which puts things into perspective because those <laughs> clams are huge. <laughs> Amazing. Oh my goodness me. Look at the quantities though, uh, yeah. Dave. We, we are um, obviously every single one of you is multi buying. Why wouldn't we when the deal's this good? Beautiful. Valerie, you've got two. Maker, you've got two. Greater Manchester, you've got five. Beverly, you've got two. Lynn's got three. Maker in Devon's got three. Allison, you've got two. Still got availability if you want to jump on in and get involved. Mm. Thirty nine ninety nine is the final deal on these. Again, Dave, just for having that vision, that dream, mm. you know, of actually of being brave enough to say actually the giant clam. But yeah, you know, well, let's I, try I, and it's not even brave enough. It's just I don't mind people laughing at me. So <laughs> I just say it. Um, most people keep that to them themselves because they think it's probably a silly thing to say. I don't mind. No. Because some of the best things that have happened have just come by saying the silliest things. You know. Yeah, absolutely. And that, especially when that dream becomes a well reality. Done. Congratulations. Absolutely. Um, like today, that's they're utterly beautiful, and I can't wait for it to see the pieces that you create. But there's one more. There is. It's not a giant clam though. No. It is the, the, the Barbara Hutton um, clasp that I always reference, always talk about, this is it. Uh, so if any of you have your jade and you've always wanted this clasp, if any of you want to put it on the giant wow. clam or you have your Kotan, this is the kind of identical clasp in many respects to the Cartier piece. That was that commissioned. broke the world record three times over for an imperial jade necklace. Yeah, you yeah. got it there. <clears throat> they designed that class for the Strand, didn't yes, they? Yes, they bought the Strand and then they just made this in Paris and just attached it to the Strand. Wow. How beautiful. Mm -hmm. Fully gem encrusted. So I think many of us have always wanted to get hold of this piece. Yeah, definitely. Well, oh, because we've referenced it so yeah, many so times, So many times, and I've, I've been talking about it for so long now. But also like the design. Do we have many of these, Ross? Uh, 80. It's nowhere near enough. It's not. It's amazing. I'm, I'm thrilled to have that. Don't get me wrong. Well, how, but how long have you been bringing pearls? Yeah. Uh, how long have you been bringing jade? Yeah. You know, how many times have people said like, oh, if you want to, like Barbara Hutton inspired. Well, mm -hmm. you've, got, you've got the inspired clasp, haven't you? Yeah, we have. So we're going to give you a 30 second clock and make this available. The fastest 80 of you are going to get this. And I guarantee with the collectors that I know that have you know, many, many strands of jade. Yeah. I know that this is the, uh, this is going to be multi-bought more than anything else. Absolutely. 
100% beautiful. It's a simple fold over clasp. Um, AG available. Good luck, everyone. Yeah, we, we, we I, I, you know, I know Dave, you reference it all the time, don't you? And it yeah. was you that's obviously championed this idea. You know, <coughs> and we can teach you the knotting process. I had so a collector that reached out to me on social media and said, oh, Dave, you know, I bought this jade from you and uh, you wanted to know what I created with it. And they, sh they shared this with me and uh, they'd got the clasp that was quite similar. Yeah. Wow. And I was blown away. And I think that's, that's an amazing piece of jewelry. It takes it to that next level. But now we have the real deal. Now, now that, you know, we don't have to compromise. We're going to do something special and significant. I told you, how many people are going to multi-buy? It's going to be wild. Rosemary's got three. Swansea's got two. Kent's got five. London's got four. Someone else has got two. Another collector's got five. All right, one deal straight down, twenty nine ninety nine. Wow. 80 is nowhere near enough. I apologize for that. Oh, it's almost been working out. to do this for you. That pink spinel, it is uh, the Hutton Midmani uh, uh, clasp. Beautiful. Burmese as well. Mm -hmm. Again. Burmese, a circle of Burmese spinel. I believe the, the original was Burmese ruby. Yeah. So you're not a million miles away. No. Well, they'd have, they'd have formed alongside one another, yeah. wouldn't they? Yeah. Unbelievable. The phone lines, the web have gone crazy. And there's, as you can see, Dave, a lot of multi-buyers on this I, I one. I can't see someone who's just bought one yet. No. Just everyone is multi-buying, which I completely understand. Yeah. We've got Alison getting six, Amanda getting six. I don't blame you. Fives. I think, oh, they've sold out. Well done. Well done. Congratulations. Well done. I'm not surprised. Um, as always, Dave, it is such a delight to have you. Always in the wonderful studio. to be here. Thank you for having me. And, and once again, thank you on behalf no of everybody for the, for the dream. No problem. Thank you for, for you know choosing to spend your morning with me. And with our no, there is an amazing masterclass uh, still to come. It's going to yes. be a very very special Saturday. You're not going to want to go anywhere. But thank you uh, oh. for letting me join you as well. Unbelievable. Um, thank you so Nothing. much. Wonderful Dave, everybody. And he's right, there is so, so much more. We've got a beautiful collection of Sleeping Beauty turquoise coming your way with pearls. That will be perfect as well, ahead of your masterclass. Yvonne has got the most incredible pearls coming up in your masterclass and um, if you've ever wondered how to complete them we've got the lovely clasp as well almost like a broad bean shape absolutely gorgeous box beautifully so yes join Yvonne for her, her midday masterclass don't go anywhere stunning sleeping beauty turquoise after this <laughs>
You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewelry room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals, and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewelry Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewelry Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call center 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewelry Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard PMP is 395. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of 595. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Monday the 19th of February with the most beautiful projects. In the 9am, I have these incredible Malachite projects with matching connectors and there's also an amazing pearl one, absolutely stunning. I'm going to be showing you how to make this bubble style pearl necklace and in the masterclass I have the most amazing Laramar earring kit. So all of the findings are sterling silver and there's lots of really interesting earring findings and the Laramar is just beautiful. So I hope you can join me on Monday the 19th at JM. Uh, just take a moment just to, just to breathe and just appreciate how amazing that was. I so enjoyed that. It was so interesting. I knew none of that. So no, no, it was but it, fabulous. Do you know the biggest thing? Like when he said, like the giant clam, and you think. Is that is is well, that the thought. one? <laughs> yeah. And then you think, oh gosh, yes, the only time I have ever actually seen it depicted is actually in storybooks. It's a, a cartoon yeah. type, yeah. And you now own it in your jewellery collection. Yeah. How amazing is that? When we talk about collectors, you know, had to some have, very lucky people this morning. Oh, truly have, truly, yeah. truly have. And I tell you what, lovely jewelry makers, we've got some perfect components to go maybe alongside your giant clam, or maybe to go alongside Yvonne's amazing pearls that are coming up. Um, but what is always one of our absolute favorites um, here at Jewelry Maker. Now, just before I get into it, I want to show you Yvonne's pearls at 12, because, I, and I don't say this lightly, I've seen many pearls in my, in my, in my mm. jewelry career, not just here at Jewelry Maker, not just across the Gemporia Partnership, um, when I worked in the jewellers, and I don't hesitate saying these, they're some of the finest pearls I think I've ever seen. Yes, they are, they're lovely. The, the, the brightness beautiful. of the luster yeah. is off the chart. You know, and, and I know you've heard me say this countless times, five virtues, size, shape, yeah. yeah? Then we talk about uh, um, size, shape, nake, why am I missing one? L size, shape lust is the fifth oh color goodness me color nacre luster lust is the most important of the five virtues and that's i, I actually almost stole that statement from charlie baron himself oh, did you? i have but he's right because you can have a massive pearl perfectly spherical uh -huh. a lovely color thick nacre but if it doesn't have luster then it's oh it's useless chalky almost yeah, it's, it's, um luster's the most important these are mirror-like luster they are and they're they're like a rainbow i've just opened for the first time opened the white ones oh. to use for the demo and it's like a rainbow in there yeah they're exceptional it's beautiful so these are coming up at 
12 o'clock today you've actually got two opportunities both in the colored naturally colored pearls are on your screens right now but also in the purest of whites uh -huh. um so those are at 12 o'clock in your master class and they come with um yeah look at oh my goodness me oh my goodness me do you see where i'm coming from everybody can you see how mirror like that luster is why i say that statement that they're the best pearls you know i've never seen anything like it they are limited obviously in one of the most popular shapes of course your fireball stroke yeah. baroque um they're coming up at 12 o'clock but there's only 40 of each oh, is that all there so is? yeah but the quality is an indication mm -hmm, of that mm -hmm. um so don't go anywhere you need to be with us at midday now they're at 12 o'clock now at tucson which i was very privileged to go to tucson a couple of years ago and do you know you don't really i didn't know what to expect to be honest i've never been to no. a gem fair previously before um so i went alongside dave i went alongside jake and angeline uh, on gem and a few of the team um and i didn't fully understand just the the, the size of, of just tucson gonna say that i bet it's huge isn't it's it? vast mm. it, it, the best way i can describe it is you imagine somewhere like one of our big cities in the uk whatever whether it's london whether it's birmingham manchester liverpool whichever imagine a big city and the whole city for that one time frame is completely taken over mm -hmm. by gemstone traders wow. completely every nook every side street every massive venue so for i can are you close to home nec the nec would be one big event probably the agta then you'd have um, another, say, a, a theatre that would be another ge gem event. Then you'd have, sorry, I'm getting really excited, aren't I? Um, then you'd have, say, a field, I don't know, local farmer's field, taken over by a big, vast wow. marquee. I stood at the entrance of one marquee, looked down, and I couldn't see the end. Wow. It's vast. It is literally vast. Um, and, 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 and I know I've joked about this before, but you know, when the team were like, Elle, go and find some jet. That's like finding a needle in a haystack. <laughs> you know, it's, I could very easily say, uh, go and find things like diamonds, rubies, cashmere, sapphires, because you know where to go with those. Yeah. But when you're looking for something like uh, it's more, the more niche, yeah. that's much more difficult. Anyway, one gemstone, which is probably one of the headliners at Tucson would be Sleeping Beauty because of course you've got to remember it's in the state of Arizona very dry area they've got lots of uh, turquoise mines in that location and um, not just Sleeping Beauty they've got the Cochise mine they've got the Kingman mine as well there, there's lots of, I've got a, a map of that haven't we somewhere Roscoe um, that shows you the state of Arizona so the Sleeping Beauty mine we know closed in 2012 so mm -hmm. it was literally it, 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 it's a very shallow forming gemstone so it's not like tan's night where you can dig to meters and meters thousands of meters almost below the earth's surface when it comes to turquoise it's on the surface basically um and it often ironically i think forms in very dry arid areas so i think your mexican turquoise very dry arid tibetan turquoise uh, very dry arid areas but here is the um this is the southwest turquoise mine so if you imagine it actually extends you can see the state of arizona you can see new mexico colorado uh, um, california there's lots of different places in that in that part of the usa so turquoise is a headliner in um in tucson without shadow of a doubt however and there's a video somewhere i know you've seen it in the past and it was actually the first day i arrived and the first person that i actually spoke to was a turquoise trader um and i actually asked him i was talking to him about different varieties of turquoise didn't necessarily single out sleeping beauty and his words were he was, he was lovely very passionate very excited as you can imagine it's his business but talking about this gemstone but he was like there is one mine that everybody wants and i knew which one he was about to reference one location that everybody wants that really is like the uh, um the headline of all turquoise and that's sleeping beauty turquoise and that's because you have the finest robin egg blue you have <coughs> the minimal matrix less matrix is is what's most desirable um if you think about the harry winston turquoise ring with that uh, amazing you've got turquoise haloing um 
an orange garnet which is absolutely incredible um, but the actual halo of it uh, um, is all Sleeping Beauty turquoise but it's the intensity of that robin egg blue colour um, that you see <coughs> so let's show that photograph of Steve because again we're going back some uh, some some years with this photograph um, Steve is photographed here outside the gates of the Sleeping Beauty mine and I, I can almost tell you what he's saying in that VT it's closed look you can see the padlocks there it's closed you can't just walk in by the way it's um it's it, it, it's it's an area which is very heavily guarded even though there is no sleeping beauty turquoise mine remaining so at one point we were when we were over there for that week period we we're like should we go to the sleeping beauty mine and everyone's like yes let's go there that's amazing and then this is the year 2020 2021 and we we're like what's the point there actually is no point in us going there because we can't get any what we're going to do is basically instead of steve being stood in the, in front of those gates it would be me or Ange or dave you know um th it would be a pointless exercise and it would have taken us all day to get there but sleeping beauty again in every single turquoise vendor that i spoke to is the pinnacle it's the oracle of your of your turquoises and there was one individual, and I know that uh, presenter Hattie was talking to them and Dave was talking to them when we were, when the team were over, just gone. Um, and I remembered him clearly. This guy was very charismatic. He had the most beautiful Sleeping Beauty turquoise display. He was in the AGTA, so one of the glamorous ones. Um, and he had a security guard on every single point of his display. And you almost think, and incorrectly but I almost thought oh, that's a bit that's a bit much isn't it don't need it that's a bit over the top isn't it <laughs> I've been looking at cashmere sapphires that didn't have that many security guards but it's really not because I held one in my hand a sleeping beauty turquoise orb that was about 20 mil so it was big mm. but it was six thousand dollars wholesale so it probably wasn't overkill mm. now still to this day some over 10 years on sleeping beauty is still the regard as the oracle the best in the world and it's absolutely incredible that we can still bring it to you we're about to bring you a collection that is all about sleeping all oh, encrusted with sleeping beautiful. beauty we managed to get opportunities like this through extreme exchanging of purchases so for example you had toby here yesterday who was talking about the fact that steve will buy big he's one of the biggest gem buyers in the world um and he won't go in and just say okay i'll have i don't know fifty thousand uh, um, pounds worth of this gemstone he'll buy millions of pounds worth of certain gemstones in actual fact and we can exchange so that's how you we make purchases like this take a moment just to look at each and every single one of these pieces they're all sleeping beauty turquoise you've got a ring you've got a pendant you've got two rings actually um, and you have two connector opportunities which are stunning ads ah, are we able to show the collection is that are we able or are we going to do it as as and when each auction opportunity arises or do you want to see them on the board shall i show them on the board would that be easier so take a moment i'll just prop this up ever so slightly we have uh, also sorry the most amazing earrings to go alongside this collection too <coughs> now the only thing bear with what have i done here the only thing there we are is that they are limited there's the earrings but also there's these there's <coughs> this which is what we're going to start the showcase one size fits all adjustable oh that's amazing isn't it gorgeous yeah i love it absolutely beautiful um all i'm going to say is be quick if you are a lover of sleeping beauty turquoise then 
don't hesitate on this because it will always be one of those uh, gemstones that um, that sells out. Again, just to highlight how we make opportunities like this possible, it's not an easy gemstone to get hold of considering it deplete over a decade ago. Um, again, Gemporia, the partnership itself, owns mines, well, Steve Bennett does, um, owns mines, so we can exchange gemstones yeah. that he might own. So, for example, your Moroccan amethyst would have been, has been exchanged in the past for Sleeping Beauty turquoise parcels. Um, it might be that I don't know we uh, uh, we have some sapphires or diamonds or whatever <laughs> zarite is another gemstone that we can actually physically exchange sometimes it's not actually just you know monetary it's an exchange of carat weight that makes uh, uh, collections like this actually possible one size fits all you get this lovely vine effect of that wonderful robin egg blue if you think about the Tiffany's blue you think about uh, uh, Tiffany's branding, their blue, exactly. that's exactly that, the color. Yes. That is exactly the color that you get from Sleeping Beauty Turquoise. And that is also why um, it is a location that they favor quite frequently. We're at 99 pounds and 99 pence. And that's for starters. Now, how many do we have exactly of these then, Roscoe? 67 available within the vault. It is brand new, first time to air, and already a reaction on the phone lines. 49.99. Again, uh, like two years ago when I went to Tucson, I was not seeing prices like this. You know, that first individual that I spoke to, that wonderful gentleman who's so passionate about, about turquoise, not just Sleeping Beauty, but he did say, you know, that is like the oracle, the best of the best of the best. You know, he was talking talking about uh, like triple figure prices per carat of this gemstone we operate very differently it's not just a case of we want to go and buy it monetary here we go cash over um, it's actually an exchange that's how we make opportunities like this possible now the next price crash already we're rapidly approaching half the stock <gasps> next just to clarify, we don't need to take Sleeping Beauty Turquoise no, this low. We don't. I'm not saying we won't get it again, but it's not coming from the mine. It's closed. And it's not going to reopen. It's mined out. Completely depleted mine. Sleeping Beauty, again, the location, you've got that wonderful fairy tale story of, yeah. the, uh, of the, the landscape, literally is the landscape of Sleeping Beauty, uh, beautiful, the profile. That picture, isn't it? We have another price crash. All that solid sterling silver, one size fits all. This is ridiculous that we're under, th under 30 pounds and we're still not done. I've got 67 or rather we had Oh, there's multi buyers getting involved on this. What a perfect gift because it, you don't have to worry about the size. Eight individual, beautifully color matched, um, beautifully color matched. Uh, um, Sleeping Beauty turquoise again with that robin egg blue. Um, you can see the lack of the matrix. That this is the thing. Matrix isn't a bad thing if you prefer that as long as it doesn't hinder the colour. But Sleeping Beauty is famed and celebrated for that pure, vibrant robin egg blue. Again, it wraps this wonderful floral vine around the finger. One size fits all. I can't believe we're doing this. It's going to be an on-screen sellout, everybody. We've got the whole collection to bring you as well, and it is a collection. The reality is, you know. Uh, I could count on probably my digits how many times I did Sleeping Beauty Turquoise on our sister channel when I was presenting yeah, there. Imagine, very yeah. seldom, <coughs> very, very seldom. And you've got a positive parcel within this piece. Good luck, well done, <laughs> crazy. 24 pounds and 99 pence only. Cochise, not, I mean, actually Cochise is deplete now, isn't it? Get your Kingman Turquoise, no problem. That's still operational. Yeah. And has been one of the most, uh, uh, one of the longest standing um, in terms of its uh, years of production. Get you Kingman, get you many of those other places that we saw on the map. Can't get you, can't physically go to the state of Arizona, drive up to the King, uh, to the Sleeping Beauty Turquoise Mine, and physically buy it anymore. It's padlocked. It's padlock clothes because it's all but completely deplete. But you can get it here from Jewelry Maker for an amazing $24.99. Kathleen, Lynn, Pamela, Jane, Cumbria, Angela, Hilda, Trishiel, uh, Janice, Mary, David, hello to you, Lynn, Gloucestershire, Heather, Janet, Angela, Tina, Lisa, Mary, Eileen, Pamela, Manchester, Renfusha, <laughs> Devon, Oxfordshire, Caroline. Loads of multi-buyers getting involved on this. I don't blame you. Amanda in Essex says, I'll have five. 
I don't blame you. No. Amanda, that's, the thing is, for that, those five is really the price tag that I would expect for just one. For, for, for this yeah. gem. Do you know, I couldn't make it for that much, let alone sell it for that yeah, much. Yeah, exactly. To be fair. And I don't see a problem with that. If you if you purchase, we've got lots of retailers that yeah. shop with us. There's no problem buying no, it and no. selling it at, at the correct price tag. Because you would be the correct price tag. It's us that's wrong at twenty four ninety nine. <laughs> yes, you know? Yes, yes. This is genuine <coughs> turquoise. And I would also, please be mindful, if you are choosing to purchase a, a turquoise elsewhere, then make sure it is the real Careful. deal yeah. make sure because it's uh, with the beauty of the gemstone it is often simulated um so cert certified sleeping beauty turquoise now that's the only it's quite big impact as well yeah ring, it's a big color it? now oh there's another ring as well with like infinity scrolls because i've got two connectors the biggest okay this one wow look at that blue in the center sorry just take a moment adam's recording look at the quality of the sleeping beauty turquoise in the center that's textbook isn't it i wonder sorry ross i can we show the picture of the harry winston if you put Mandarin garnet, Mandarin garnet and Sleeping Beauty turquoise ring. What a lovely combination that is as well, because it's just that contrast, oh. isn't it, between the two. Sure, the reason why I'm incredible. asking for this, bear in mind it's Harry Winston, so it will come at a pretty hefty price tag. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not comparing the piece, that's a ring, this is a, this is a connector. But what I am comparing is the quality of the Sleeping Beauty turquoise that you're about to see in that piece and what you're getting within each and every single one of these pieces of the collection. A lovely connector with the pearls that are coming up at midday. S superb design, isn't Stunning. it? Stunning. Yeah. Yeah. Good luck. How many do we have? There are 70 available. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Do you, do, you know, you could put that, particularly with the white ones, yeah, I think. Yeah, be lovely. Use that as a connector. In yeah, the amazing. Tremendous. Now, okay. First, or oh, imagine this with your, your giant clam. Oh. <gasps> imagine. How beautiful yes. would that be as a combination? What a contrast that would Stunning. be, wouldn't it? Stunning. Really pop. Now, okay. We're going to get everybody on the phone lines. I've got 70 available opportunities. Solid 925 sterling silver with the perfect robin egg blue. Certified Sleeping Beauty turquoise. And I'm starting here. We're start. Oh, really? There's 100. Beg your pardon. We're starting at £29.99. But, I mean, Yvonne, you'll, you, you'll agree with this statement. People won't just get one. Absolutely not. I mean, I can't believe that price. Can you? Genuinely, when I uh, when I went to a wholesale, the largest gem fair in the world, wholesale, I would not have found Sleeping Beauty no, turquoise at £30. absolutely pounds. not. No. There, there, on the doorstep. Yeah. I would not have found Sleeping Beauty turquoise at £30. It's pounds. not something you can find very easily at all, is it? Sleeping not Beauty. at an inexpensive, inexpensive no. price. No, no, no. It's like, honestly, it's like, it's like the oracle of turquoise, Sleeping Beauty. Yeah. And yet here we are bringing it to you at twenty nine ninety nine. It's something you aspire to, isn't Definitely. it? Definitely. Definitely. It's one of those gems. You know, often uh, um, Ross and I actually reference. It's that one that should be in the big five. Definitely. Do you see where we're coming yeah, from? Definitely. But its rarity probably keeps it outside, not its popularity or its beauty. Wow. £19.99 and pence only. You can remove the jump rings if you wish. It could turn it into a pennant or a charm. That would be amazing. Or maybe, how about the most beautiful, um, sure, hold it against my finger. Yeah, there you go. Hi, Caroline. Hello, lovely. Saying, Elle, can you put this connector against your finger as I'm tempted to make it into a ring? Yeah, that would be amazing. Be beautiful. There you go, lovely. Oh, be... You could make it into earrings. You could dangle yeah. a, a pearl from the bottom, take the jump ring out. Couldn't you? <sighs> Beautiful. Um, yeah, Adam say looks like a little star of David. Yeah, it does. Yes, it does. It does. Uh, Linda and Beverage are saying would make a stunning bracelet with the elephant charms from this morning. <gasps> yes. 
Oh, what they a would be beautiful. Idea. Or how about one of Yvonne's amazing Baroque pearls? Yeah. Just one. Oh. Just dangling from the bottom. This the, the, this component, like I said, as jewelry makers, you know, it's a component. However, it's what takes your jewelry to another level, yeah. isn't it? Oh, definitely. Yeah, and it, it's so. Um eye-catching turquoise isn't it yeah however you wear it you yeah. can always spot you can spot it from a distance yeah you, you really can mm. you really really can again the quality of that sleeping beauty turquoise is absolutely mind-blowing we had 100 of these available but again a component even if you don't know just yet what you're going to do with it you might be thinking okay well you know that long line necklace that that dave was referencing with the with the giant clam maybe i'd actually connect a couple of strands together with this now we've got a hundred and this is the, that's the only reason that we're going a single penny lower um ross producer ross has just said in my ear l i want these to be in an entire sellout across the board i agree we can't bring you the oracle of 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 turquoise in the world by the way there's no do, do you agree with this statement there's nowhere else in the world that has such high regard as sleeping beauty turquoise you know, no, look, I love Mexican turquoise. I love Tibetan turquoise. Yeah. I love Kingman turquoise. I love Cochise turquoise. But they're, they're different. They're all They're different. not the they're same. All they're all slightly not... different, aren't they? Let's be honest, they're ever so slightly in the shadows of Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> in terms are. of desirability, yeah. they're lovely, don't get me wrong, but Sleeping Beauty turquoise that is, more eye -catching. is that starring yeah. role. Now, I we would... had 100. The only reason we're going low is because of that quantity. I'd definitely buy two and make earrings. Oh, Perfect gorgeous. size. Absolutely gorgeous. Good luck to each and every single one of you. There's twos, threes, fours being purchased. I don't blame you. Big amount of sterling silver, but most importantly, look at the quality of the Sleeping Beauty. Wow. Wow. £14.99 pence only. Yeah. That's the silver alone, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, yeah. I mean, I know I said it about the ring, but you can't make it for that much. No. Genuinely, I meant it when I was over in Arizona, you wouldn't have found it at fourteen no. ninety nine. You wouldn't. Not, not Sleeping Beauty turquoise. I don't know where you could get it from at that price, to be fair. Nowhere other than here. No, I don't think Genuinely nowhere. <laughs> and, and going back, I mean, I was, um, I, I was presenting before the mine closed. Oh, were you? Yeah, and it wasn't these prices. Wow. I was presenting, I was See, here. So put it in those terms, it's not that long ago, No, is it's it? really not. Yeah. It's really not. Yeah, I, I, I was 100 on the Gemporia, on gem, Gems rather than here, yeah. but it wasn't 14 no, no, Not for good. a collection, a parcel, effectively. Valerie's got three, Carol's got two, Swansea's got three, Leslie's got two, Anna's got two, Sue's got two, London's got two, Linda's got, uh, I think, is that two? I can't quite see you, just to be off the system. Um, Claire in Warwickshire's just snapped up two, Valerie's got three. Amazing, these are absolutely flying out. Again, with one big beautiful pearl at the bottom. Or maybe you would go for the Harry Winston-like vibes and really yeah. contrast it with a big rich beautiful sort of mandarin or specitite garnet i mean how amazing would that be you know like the, the little briolette drops that we sometimes do imagine a cluster of those underneath yeah. oh a so cluster pretty. of very, specitite very pretty. garnets yeah. underneath yeah. oh beautiful a connector can do so many things but it has to be the headline has to be about the fact that these are um sleeping beauty with that robin egg blue amazing now well done keep dialing through Ooh. let's do the other connector I love this one because it's got an infinity oh. swirl it's absolutely beautiful one single sleeping beauty turquoise look how look how pretty this is oh very unique so those of you that messaged in talking about the ring you could do yeah. the same with this couldn't you Look at you look at the prong settings on that alone. Beautiful, it's pretty, isn't it? And that's a big. And that must beauty. be a big stone, yes. Yeah. For you to be able to see the prongs like, like that, it's got to be a decent sized stone. So lovely, isn't it? Again, a gemstone that features very heavily on the red carpet for obvious reasons. We're going to start where under twenty. This is actually a bigger gram weight. A bigger gram weight 
But we're going again. We've got a hundred available. I'd wear that as a pendant, you know. I would too. I'd actually remove one of the jump rings and wear it as a pendant, yeah. like so. Wear, you could do the suite, couldn't you? Earrings yeah. and pendants. Mm. Or well, certainly at that price, you could. <laughs> Christmas just gone. I gifted my mother-in-law a Sleeping Beauty turquoise Thank necklace. Thank you. Uh, from Jewelry Maker, of uh -huh. course. Well, Jemporia. Um, and she hasn't taken it off since. Oh, how Hasn't lovely. taken it off since. It was the first turquoise piece of jewellery, I think, that she owned. Oh, um, But look nice. at the quality. It's lovely, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And there's no way on earth, if it wasn't for Jewellery Maker, in fact, it was a Jewellery Maker piece, um, if it wasn't for Jewellery Maker, there's no way on earth I'd be able to afford no. to do that. Because something like this in Arizona would not have been 20 quid. It, it isn't tur turquoise, particularly Sleeping Beauty, isn't it something you see when you look in the run-of-the-mill jewellery no. uh, stores, is it? So expensive. Oh, my God. The stone if, if of you hope. can find it. Yeah. And it's definitely not that. Ross, that is actually silly. It's actually a silly deal, that. twelve ninety nine. It's a silly price, though, isn't it? In the best possible way, that is ridiculous. Again, if I hold it to the back of my hand, you get an idea of scale. It would be perfect in a ring. Mmm. Look at that. Unbelievable. Very substantial ring. Yeah, be lovely like as a ring. a ring. Yeah. For me, four ring, one in each ear, and one around the neck. Yeah. How beautiful. Somebody who can, a good wire worker, yeah. could make that into an, a lovely ring for Stunning. you. Stunning. Wow, they're absolutely flying out. There's loads of you there. Well done, everybody. There is just something so magical about Sleeping Beauty Turquoise, isn't there? Something so, so hypnotising about that amazing so blue. So summery as well, isn't yes. it, don't you think? Well, it's positive, isn't it? Yeah. It's a very positive colour saturation. Yes, it's very, cheer very cheery. Yeah, amazing. Well done, Chantal, uh, Northamptonshire, Alison, Elaine, Devon. Well done to Jacqueline, Pamela, Ruth, uh, Claire, Fife, Valerie, Essex, Helen, Angela, uh, Sarah, Hilma, Lorna, Oxfordshire, Carol, Cardiff, hello to you, Kathleen, Jeanette, Cornwall, Margaret, Nora, Michelle, Michael, uh, Susan, Gloria, and then there's tons of you getting involved. Thank goodness we had 100 of these. Um, however... That 100 quantity is not going to hang around. So again, make sure you are checking them out to guarantee your success. This is not a small piece of silver. Again, I'm just going to turn it sideways towards Bruce and you can see the um, investment there. Let me look at that. It's a big mm. gram weight, 1.4 grams in the precious, uh, precious metal alone. Yeah, it's got a good depth to it, doesn't it? <clears throat> but even that Sleeping Beauty turquoise, especially that Sleeping Beauty turquoise, should not be 12.99 especially the sleep that is mined out gone deplete closed over 10 years ago it's just surely, unbelievable the prices should go up shouldn't like they yes, and they have gone up <coughs> well done i've got to move on because we've got more to bring you it's a lovely collection you've got there isn't it one more ring the bales amazing too the earrings are amazing too this is also adjustable, so you don't have to worry about your size. Oh. Look at how beautiful that is. I love this for all its simplicity. Oh, look at that. And again, just literally squeeze it to actually make it a little bit smaller if you wish, or expand it. Look how gorgeous that is. Wow. Yeah, or that, depending on what size you want to make it, it would look nice, fully closed yeah. or, or or partly open. Yeah, you could separate it, couldn't you? You yeah. could have like sort of the... Yes, you could have it like twisted. Yeah. Yeah. Actually have more the crescent upwards yes, and could. then the yeah. turquoise Which is the like other the, side. like the leaf really, Yeah, isn't gorgeous. It? Have we got quantity of these? 80 available opportunities. Genuine Sleeping Beauty again. Look at how... Well, completely void of that matrix that you can see across the surface. No, there's no pure, is Yeah, it? heavy webbing, which I do like webbing on a turquoise. I prefer it to be without it, but yeah, as long as it doesn't hinder the vibrancy of that robin egg blue. Yeah, it's got to be delicate. I yes, think. yes. Where the Earth literally craves water, this amazing gemstone is formed. Literally tiny amounts of 
uh, of this wonderful intense mm -hmm. blue can be found in cracks and fissures which are almost carved into the landscape. It makes big sizes of turquoise very difficult to get hold of. And the matrix that you see is actually the host rock, um, host rock within the actual gemstone. This doesn't have that it's host rock, any, it's it? exclusive. Yeah, exclusive Sleeping Beauty. Loving this design. You've almost got the crescent moon and then the full moon. Um, so I love that, absolutely love it. Very simple. We're at 19.99, all set in. Uh, solid 925 sterling silver as well. Big gram weight once again. Just about half a carat in your Sleeping Beauty turquoise. But again, here is that robin egg blue. Straight away, immediately a reaction. For me, I'm thinking, just put these away. <laughs> Present draw, how perfect. Yeah. Who doesn't love turquoise? Yeah, there's always someone you could gift that to. <laughs> 12.99. I can hear our colleagues right now watching us on the monitor in our production office going, what's that? <laughs> it's Sleeping Beauty turquoise. How on earth are you at 12.99? A brand new collection. Yeah, look at that. We could literally walk this a couple of meters down the corridor to our sister channel. <laughs> where sell it. Yes. Twelve ninety nine. Nikki's got three. Christina's got two. Amanda's got two. Essex has got two. Jenny's got two. Well, because they're so giftable, you could stack them at that price. Yes, you could. You could stack them up. We had sorry a hundred. Did you say? Oh, 80. Sorry. Yeah, but they're flying out at that price tag. I'm not surprised at all. It's very simple, but very elegant. Isn't yeah, it works, it? doesn't it? Yeah, it's perfectly, beautiful. perfectly yeah. works. There's meaning behind it. I mean, you could wear it. that all day, every day, couldn't you? I'm not. Uh, I'm not. I'm not great with these, but you know, like uh, um, lots of people celebrate like lunar movements, don't they? Yes, I'm, the not, yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not great on things like that. I don't us, really know, no. but uh, you know, if you if you follow the movements yeah. of the moon and things like that, it might be it might have meaning to you in that way. Um, just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Twelve ninety nine. Jenny in Nottinghamshire. Jenny in Staffordshire. Uh, Alison in Highlands got two. Sharon, Debbie, uh, Cornwall. Jenny in Gloucestershire. Lots of Jennies. Uh, Gloucestershire, you've got four. Uh, Linda's multi bought. Merseyside's multi bought. Kathleen, well done, everybody. I only had eighty opportunities opportunities it's stunning it's stunning in its simplicity isn't it absolutely that sums it up perfectly yes beautiful if i just spin it round, you can see look at all that silver big gram weight of silver well, within this thick too band, isn't it yeah lovely solid shank um well done everyone okay oh, we've got two beautiful designs of earrings coming your way ones are like a huggy earring which i love and then yeah you don't see many of those do no you? and then you've got another floral pattern oh they're beautiful aren't they yeah absolutely beautiful so yes finished jewelry but as jewelry makers you can obviously re reconfigure this if you wish linen in the summer be beautiful oh that'd be amazing mm. now they are solid sterling silver these are coming your way but so as not to confuse focus on these amazing would you like to see them in the ear as well studio samples absolutely beautiful so you have your amazing uh cultured pearl coin which pearls and turquoise are just the uh, most, made for each other yeah aren't they? gorgeous yeah. combination oh look at those oh, look at that's those so pretty al amazing ah oh. gosh a lovely five petal flower and then your culture pearl at the bottom again lovely. i know as jewelry makers you have the ability to make some fantastic pieces of jewelry but this collection i tell you what has been commissioned from something that is literally mined out um teamed it with the finest most lustrous of <laughs> pearls um but then you know you can keep them exactly as they are you can reconfigure it you can add more to them if you wanted just unbelievable yeah, yes we can make them but why you can't improve on them can you sometimes it's not they not necessary no, it's yeah absolutely not i'm with you on that one sometimes you don't need to no okay we're not stopping at 49 pounds and 99 pence we are going to get these under an amazing okay just think of it this way for to make them you have that ability yeah you have to source the sleeping beauty turquoise cabochons yeah. you have to buy the sterling silver yeah. You have to shape it. You have to buy the findings and the pearls. We are under 20 pounds and we are not stopping there. 
Sometimes you, it's it not... can't be done. No. No. Because, you, you know, you've got to factor in your but time you, as well. I was just going to say that. Your time and your expertise. Look how beautiful they oh, are. I'm a great believer, though, if you can't improve on it. Uh, just leave it alone. Totally. That is pretty. Yeah. I feel like if, uh, certainly if I started messing with these, yeah. then it wouldn't be a well, good I thing. I, I could make them, but I don't feel like that I'd improve them. <laughs> no, I don't think I could. I think no. they're perfect exactly as they are. That is like the end goal. <laughs> We're at 19.99, but going even lower. How many do we have, Ross? 75 available, perfect for spring and summer. Oh, you might know someone that's called Daisy. Yeah, look at and that. It's, on, and is it, on, on the plasma. That'd be lovely, yeah. wouldn't it? You might know somebody that's a December baby, yeah. or just particularly loves, particularly loves uh, turquoise it's as a gem. It's so popular, though, so popular. turquoise, isn't it? I know if our Debs is watching right now, she'd be going She'll crazy be in for there. these. Yeah. Debs, if you're watching, you're probably shopping, in fact. <coughs> I can't believe we're doing this. That's Sleeping Beauty turquoise. That's madness. The connectors on their own, Ross, should be that. One, the connector on its own yeah. should be fourteen ninety nine. Well, yeah, you know, you know, We've brought connectors without Sleeping Beauty turquoise at fourteen ninety nine, haven't we? You're actually getting the two and the shepherd hook and the pearls. You, yeah, break it all down. What have you got about? You've got six elements. So yeah, the big elements in each. So you've got twelve elements. I mean, I couldn't just make over those. a pound each. Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't make them for that price. No, of course you can't. You know, these yeah. are certified Sleeping Beauty turquoise in sterling silver again yeah. at that price. I don't think it's possible to actually uh, commission them ourselves, and which is ultimately why so many of us actually start making jewellery so that we can buy yeah. gemstones uh, you're right. um, yes, at a more affordable price right. tag. Yes. Amazing, fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence. We had fifty. Did he say seventy five? Sorry, Ross. I, I ask him, and then it goes out the other <laughs> ear straight away. Sorry, Ross. Must retain information. We had seventy five available. Um, absolutely flying out the door. Two beautiful circular Sleeping Beauty turquoise cabochons in the centre, and those amazing lustrous coins. Um, in your little connectors, like I said, the connectors themselves would be more than what's on your screens right now. Um, amazing, amazing. I've got two more items to bring you um, before the masterclass. I love these. I want to buy these. The huggies. I love them. Yeah. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Our, our sister channel has, re has like relaunched those. the multi collection. The multi collection is like a rate, basically that. It's the huggy earring. Yeah. And then you can choose. Oh, what you what the you drop. dangle? Yeah. But in effect, these are all. It's the same concept. You could. Absolutely. There's nothing stopping you swapping it out. Not that no, I would. No. Look at how beautiful they are. The simplicity of that turquoise just bezel set or tube set, whichever it is, so pretty. Ross, tell me there's quantity of these. 80 available, and I am asking for my own personal benefit. I would very much like to join you on this. Not even bit. asking for a friend, are you? No, <laughs> I'm not. I'm not going to. I'm not going to. You know, try and hide the fact I would like to buy these. I think they're absolutely they beautiful. They're stunning, like you said, in their simplicity. Shall I show them in the ear? Separate each of those yeah. components. I mean, they are effectively two pendants um with your pearls and you've got the uh huggy earrings themselves so absolutely gorgeous and, and they just clip into place here we go thank you so i'll do my best to get these in nice and fast it's again super simple they kind of oh, without a mirror i should have a mirror next to me sorry that's my fault um i put myself under pressure now ross <laughs> <laughs> I put myself under pressure. You can do it, Al. You can do it. Sorry. <laughs> Don't dream, worry. Dream, dream Don't bit. worry. Oh my goodness me! These are flying, and they're absolutely beautiful. The kind of piece of jewelry that you can put on and never, ever, ever take off. If I can actually find where I'm putting it, there we go. Yeah. Think I've got it. I think. I should have a mirror. Anyway. Here we go, here we go. It's worth the wait. Oh, yes. It's worth the wait, Adam's like. 
Look at how beautiful they are in the ear. Oh, you don't need me to take these that. off now, do you? How amazing. <laughs> There's a minute wait on the phone line, so please do bear with they our are, call centre. They are outstanding. They're beautiful. They're so pretty. Absolutely beautiful. Now, the finale of this collection, also Sleeping Beauty Turquoise, is the, is the only bale that we have available. This also comes um, with the peg. So a peg bale. You'll love this one. Um, with a lovely addition. I mean, think about, again, Yvonne's pearls oh, that are coming your way. Yeah, just one. Just put one on the bottom. Can you see the little pearls? Yeah. And there's the peg pail at the bottom there. Absolutely beautiful. I don't think people are just going to be getting one of these. Because we bring you this part quite a lot, don't we? We bring you the peg. The, yeah. We bring you that quite a lot. And we bring you jump rings, obviously. But this bit in the, in the middle, encrusted with, with, with Sleeping Beauty Turquoise, the perfect colour as well. And then framed with your cultured pearls. And they are cultured pearls, so we're not talking synthetic. It's so beautifully decorated. Stunning, isn't it? Now we're going to do this in one price crash. And then we're going to do a minute to close because we've got a very, very, very exciting masterclass coming your way. And, of course, your wall of fame. What? No. This is where you tell me there's 200 of them. There's 100. Okay. Oh, thank goodness that there's a triple figure quantity at the least, but they are flying. If there's a little bit of a queue on the phone lines, do bear with our call centre. I'm not surprised. Check the web, see what you can get on whole, on we, those amazing two, collections. Two of those. You've got a pair of earrings for £20. Stunning, pounds, stunning earrings. Coming up after this break, we've got your masterclass. We've got um, your wall of fame, the most incredible pearls. They are literally to die for. Um, so do not go anywhere. This is absolutely flying out the door. We had 100. Um, keep an eye on the website as well, because if you've just tuned in, you've missed the most amazing Sleeping Beauty Turquoise Showcase. So have a little look back on those as well. Everybody body but don't go anywhere because the pearls are coming up the other side of the break the most incredible jewelry of course in your masterclass and wall of fame we'll see you in two hi i'm natalie Patton, and i'm a guest designer on jewelry maker tv i'm going to be back on the show on sunday the 18th of february with the return of the Gemstone Garden Collection, which I'm really, really excited about. So if you missed it first time round on the launch, please come and join me. Um, the collection features 12 unique, lovely little birth flowers that represent each month, and they are adorned with a matching birthstone. So we've got black diamond, we've got opal, sapphire, ruby emerald they're absolutely gorgeous and they are 925 sterling silver they've also been designed so they're really versatile for you to use with any jewelry making technique so whether you're a metal smith a bead stitcher a macrame maker a wire worker you can use these to create some lovely personal designs as well as this lovely little um plantable wildflower seed card this time round, it's also going to come with a PDF on how to create a lovely adjustable ring. So you can use this to create um, a piece of jewellery that can commemorate a loved one, celebrate a birthday or a special moment or occasion. If that's not enough, we've also got the launch of some really lovely um, carrier charm clasps with gorgeous coloured cord and in the masterclass I'm going to be showing you a variety of different macrame techniques that you can use to make some very lovely jewellery so please come and join me on Sunday the 18th of February on Jewellery Maker Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewellery Maker app Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? 
then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Monday the 19th of February with the most beautiful projects. In the 9am I have these incredible Malachite projects with matching connectors and there's also an amazing pearl one, absolutely stunning. I'm going to be showing you how to make this bubble style pearl necklace and in the masterclass I have the most amazing Larimar earring kit so all of the findings are sterling silver and there's lots of really interesting earring findings and the Larimar is just beautiful so I hope you can join me on Monday the 19th at JM have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com go to your order history Find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Has flown by once again yeah, in the jewelry maker. I swear, it's I fun. swear, it, it accelerates the moment we're in the studio. <laughs> I swear, does, it, does. it does go ever so quickly. <sighs> if you've got to be anywhere in the next hour or so, then can you draw a line in it? Because these pearls are literally It'll go very quick. <laughs> yeah, they are the best pearls I've seen in a very, 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 very long time. And lovely. I don't say that statement. Lightly. No, they're beautiful. Um, so you have two projects, one in natural. Look, seriously, that's what... Look at that luster. Those were my leftovers. If I'm allowed to say that. I don't think any of these pearls can be described no, as leftovers. No, I feel very guilty saying no, but that. I know what you mean. <laughs> You've made your main design yeah, and then you had... Yeah, and that's, those are my extras. But Yvonne, they that. are mirror-like. You can probably see Bruce in the reflection of that pearl. <laughs> Honestly, it looks like liquid. It's that it's gorgeous, isn't it? Unbelievable. Yeah. And what's amazing, jewelry makers, is we have it in. Well, this is the natural pink, or multicolored, because let's be honest, you don't just get pink. But we've also got them in the purest silver white. They're so white, they're almost silver or blue. Yeah, that, I've taken. Does that make sense? I've taken that one off to start the demo, and I think you know, I I would choose that to make one single pendant. Yeah. it's so pretty. I, I've got 40 of each of those, um, these, these projects, but not yet. I'm just going to make you hold, you know, just bide your time for just a little hold bit your longer. Horses. But uh, as soon as the graphics appear, appear for either of these, dive on them. I know, I know, we can't put them on pre order because there's only 40. But what I will tell you, from one pearl lover to another, these are going to an amazing price point for the quality and the caliber of the pearls. Again, I've been in the industry 25 years. 
these are up there with some of the best I've seen. Yeah, they are absolutely amazing. Do you want to start us off, sure though, I? in the Wall of Fame? Lovely yeah. Yvonne. Got this lovely one here. That's nice pretty. and colourful. You were admiring in the break, I weren't was. you? This is 755, and it's from Anne Wilson, who says, Hi to everyone. To herald the hopeful oncoming of spring. I, we'll all second nah, that, won't yeah. we? I made this pretty necklace using shell pearls with old school JM crackled quartz and base metal plated silver findings good luck to all and take care that's beautiful and so pretty it is very spring like that yes Anne. it Love is it. yes it is um i have again another lovely collection of seed beading here and this Ooh. is coming from sue austin uh sue you are number 756 my lovely so um keep that number stored please find attach my entry to the wall of fame they're all made from jewelry maker components hope you like them and good luck to all in the drawer sue they're beautiful they're absolutely Yes. beautiful you're seven five six lots of work in those and we've got wow. here wow this is seven five seven from jude ryan hello all here is my latest make a simple project using spare beads from my stash black white turquoise and clear beads in agate pearl and crystal i hope to have enough spares left to make matching earrings and a bracelet fingers crossed for a win yeah good luck jude absolutely hope you, hope you amazing well. jude loving Gorgeous. that um oh beautiful collection here hang on for some reason the paper's not separating here we go and this is from susan james hello to you susan um amazing pieces here your number 758 um and susan says hello lovely people after watching ellie's demo i gave the gallery wire a go uh with an adventure in cabochon and some rose gold plated findings all from jewelry maker it's not perfect but i really enjoyed giving it a try so many thanks to ellie for a tutorial would now like some silver and gold base metal gallery wire please and hoping to see some beer courts at some stage um wishing all the waffers the best of luck and have a lovely day um i've heard beer courts mentioned a couple of times yeah, actually not, recently not so fingers crossed i know we mentioned it to the team upstairs fingers it does usually take about three months lead yeah. time though after actually just sowing that seed um amazing 758 and i know we do get a uh, base metal gallery wire and silver as well so keep your eyes peeled for that one uh, oh, right, that's a real collection lovely. here. And this is 759 Alison Quince. Well, I've had a great deal of fun with my two recent scoops, she says. Not sure I know all the beads I received, but certainly faceted lap lapis, hematite, moonstone, lots of some form of jasper and lots of micro gems too and a few jadeites wow i added in the findings and the large lapis nuggets but everything else you see is from the scoops and there's still loads more to play with wow oh well enjoy and good luck love a scoop don't yes. see scoops very often no. do we um okay let's take a moment take a moment now 40 of breathe. these are, yeah exactly there are 40 of these available you know, we casually mention places like Place Vendôme in Paris. We we mention places like Bond Street and Hatton Garden. And do you know, I've actually had a conversation. I, I don't think I've ever shared this information with you, but I had a car. I used to deal, one of my roles when I was in the jewelers previously was I used to travel back and forth, kind of like a runner, I guess. Yeah. From the jewelers that I worked at down to other a, a handful of jewelers on Hatton Garden. Yeah. Um, I hated doing it. I've got to be honest because I always felt really nervous <laughs> and anxious about carrying the jewelry, driving around central London. Precious cargo. In my, in my little Citroen Saxo mm. at the time. Oh. Um, anyway, and I used to find it really daunting. I remember I was only in my early twenties, but so some of those jewelry or, or establishments were Boucheron. You've heard of Boucheron. Mm -hmm. And I still have a contact at Boucheron who I spoke to not that long ago. Um, and in particular, I was talking about pearls because much like we've seen the impact yes. of the pearl market, they have as well, these high end jewelers. And I was, uh, the conversation lay about the price tag that we bring them to air. And they were like, that's, she was saying that's absolutely incredible yeah. you know because a strand of you know we had those purple pearls the ones that i bought the purple pearls I that were do, do about 500 those. pounds yes, i yeah. think they were there thereabouts um so quite an investment however she was saying something like that um there would be thousands mm -hmm. of pounds and probably mm -hmm. even more so of the, uh, more so recently but the reason why i'm mentioning this is because the quality of the pearls that we bring you here at jewelry maker and across the partnership as well 
are comparable to the finest jewelry houses in, in, in the country, in the world. And, and it's a really simple, straightforward way of actually solidifying and backing up that statement. You know, if you go, if, you, if you're buying a diamond, you've got the four C's, fairly straightforward. You've got the cut, you've got the carat weight, you've got the clarity, and you've got the color. So you've got those guidelines, yeah? So straightforward. Pearls is actually another one of those gems that actually has quite straightforward guidelines. It's not quite as hazy as that of jadeite, for example. No. Pearls, and we've touched <clears throat> on this already, instead of carat weight, we talk about size because they're organic gemstones, although now, because of the price of pearls, they are sometimes being measured in carat weights now. Are they? Sometimes, yeah. But we that. talk about size, so by the millimeter. Then we talk about the shape, Round is still the rarest and hardest to culture, however, not necessarily the most popular. Oh, so it's not the most sought after. Not necessarily, mm -hmm. because Baroque pearls and Fireball pearls are yeah. huge They've got at the moment. Aren't yeah, they? huge. And I think Lady Gaga had a bit of yeah, a, a, bit a bit to, to do, do with, with that. It. <laughs> um, so then we have the shape. Then we start talking about the colour. And that's really in the eye of the beholder what your preference is. But what does make a difference is if they're dyed or if they're natural. Mm -hmm. We're talking about, you know, sometimes you see the blue pearls, the hot pink pearls, you know, they'll be dyed that color. These, Yvonne's Masterclass, are natural, totally natural. Then we start talking about the nacre, and now the nacre is the rare precious material that the oyster would have secreted to produce your pearl. And they do that layer after layer after layer over a long period of time to form a cultured pearl of this size yeah. the more nacre that you have that precious material the more luster which is your fifth virtue but again stealing charlie Barron's sentence he said luster is the most important in the same way really that cut is the most important in a diamond because for example you can take the finest quality, decolourless, flawless diamond, yeah. and it's big, say, but if it's not cut well, it's not going to look beautiful. No, it's not at all. So cut's the most important when yeah. you're talking about those, uh, your stones with a, uh, with a uh, crystal structure. Um, however, when it comes to your pearls, it's all about the luster. The more luster you have, the more reflective your pearl is, the finer the quality. Because let's flip that on its head. You can have a massive pearl with a beautiful shape and you can have natural color and a lovely thick nacre but if it doesn't have that luster it's just sorry to use this expression meh do you know what i mean it's not good you're not going to notice no, it it's true these are so lustrous i'm sorry i'm sort of waxing lyrical about this these are so lustrous they are borderline mirror like do you agree from where, so, where we're sitting, they just look incredible. The colours are bouncing off them, aren't they? Just so you know, Yvonne, I've been here almost 13 years, and that is probably the best strand. These are probably yeah. the best strand of pearls I've seen. Oh, I mean, I feel so, so privileged to be given them to, to work with. Um, all of us here in the studio have worked with jewels and gemstones for many years. Bruce, do you agree with what I'm saying? Yeah. Ross? Definitely. Adam, 100%. I think all your Christmases have come at once with these projects. <laughs> I know. So many people, because I put them on Facebook when the reaction. Uh, a couple of day, days before we came on the show. And um, the, yeah, the reactions. Like, and somebody said, well, what have you done to get those trees? Oh, well, you're an all round good <laughs> egg, to be fair. That's why. Well, I did feel very lucky, well, I do have to say. You're an all round good egg, that's why. Um, <laughs> but Again, there are 40 of each of these, so that's it. I'd love to say I'll be joining you on this. There's not enough. No, you won't Now, we're enough. actually going to start with the lavender, but I'm going to show you how they arrive. You've got, yeah, they'll arrive like so, beautifully packaged. I mean, that speaks volumes, Gorgeous doesn't it? box, isn't it? Speaks volumes. And I'll open it I up. I knew they would be special when I just took the box out of the packet. You have the silk. Yep. Perfect complementary colour. But just for a second, bear with me. You have the most amazing, I am teasing you with these pearls, the most beautiful clasp as well. Look at, look at the size of that clasp. 
it's like it's like a broad bean size. It definitely is. Probably not the most romantic of descriptions, but you get where I'm coming from. So again, you just gently squeeze. Can you see how it pivots? Yeah. In the finished piece of jewellery. There it is. And if I show you in that direction, sorry, Bruce. Can you see where it goes in? So lovely, secure clasp. And where you squeeze, that's got that's where the nine two five is. Just there. No, no, oh, at on the, the top. side here, where uh, there. Oh yeah, 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 there. Amazing. Can we just just for a second appreciate this clasp? Because I, mean, I think it's, it's something so that we've really... It is. <laughs> it's no, I'm going to put the tweezers there. So obviously this will be stranded to your um, to your jewellery. But look, obviously I've got my fingerprint on there now. But look at how much silver's invested in this. But again, squeeze. Look at how much silver... This has got to be one of the strongest class we've had. Uh, it's incredible. I... Uh, <laughs> that alone without the rest without the pearls yeah i mean it must i don't know how much it would be individually but quite a lot i would have yeah thought. i should imagine because there's quite the investment of yeah. precious metal so i'm going to put these down and then hang on i'm going to show you these one by one <laughs> that's what they deserve no, honestly they need they need that yeah they need that standing ovation because they're absolutely incredible look the colours are, in, are just so special. Look at that. Yeah. Again, look at that silky luster. This is the joy of fireball pearls or baroque pearls, is that you have these lovely, beautiful folds. It's hard to pick a favourite, to be honest with yeah, you. Yeah, they're amazing. Look at this one here. Yeah. Oh my goodness Everyone me. Every one different. Every single one. just they're exceptional it's like it is like silk a fabric but mm -hmm. instead of it being the fabric itself it's 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 lacra that rare beautiful precious material the the colors are the colors in real life are uh, much more spectacular than you can see on yeah, the screen. Yeah, it's hard to, to show on screen. Because yeah. you've got to remember we've got floodlights mm. above us. Pearls, if you were looking in Place Vendôme, in Hatton Garden, any of those places, they'd add little spotlights. Yes, they would. Strategically placed towards yeah. your amazing pearls so you can really see the beauty of the gemstone. To bring out the best in them, yeah. Yeah, you're looking at them. Oh, my goodness me. Again, mirror-like luster. They come beautifully presented as well within uh, your velvet box. You get the complimentary pill, uh, pink at silk you get that amazing i'm describing it like a broad bean class it is it's exactly um, like a broad yeah bean. but it's one of the biggest class that we actually have yeah. you get the full strand but don't forget also i'm holding some but to be fair they wouldn't look right with a tiny little clasp on them no they? exactly because they're so big yeah. um think about your five virtues it's ticking every single one of those boxes look at that quality absolutely exceptional but there's only 40 available so again now this is a light simulator right mm -hmm. um so this is what more realistically what you're going to see in person yes, absolutely it's the same strand as i have physically here yeah. in the studio same strand but the difference is just the light source yeah. they're natural colors we can see the golds and the purples absolutely the, the pistachios yeah, the we pinks can see that absolutely beautiful they are brand new today there are 40 available opportunities. They're not dyed. They're not treated. They're totally natural. The auction is open. I actually foresee this being one of the fastest selling masterclasses ever. Just because by the sheer nature, the quality of those pearls. Mm -hmm. The sheer quality of them. I don't even know where I'd go to source pearls like that, to be fair. Well, other than here. I, I, I was trying to... Uh, try and, you know, we know what's going on in the pearl market, don't mm -hmm. we? We know that, the, that pearls are 
astonishingly expensive to buy now yeah. because they call it pearl mania which i always think oh i can come up better than that <laughs> but the world has gone crazier <clears throat> yeah. crazy for yeah. pearls um you know dave showed a photograph of him actually in tucson a couple of weeks ago and he's holding um what was eight hundred thousand dollar uh, South Sea Pearl necklace and that's oh, wholesale wow. and that was wholesale so what would that be retail exactly it, it doesn't bear thinking about you know it? those kind of prices previously yeah. were only really um, reserved for the jadeites the nephrites yeah. the diamonds you know the cashmere sapphires now we're talking about pearls the world has gone crazy for them and we know obviously it's the only well one of the few gemstones that actually has had a massive impact post-covid yeah a quarter of the stock is gone. Confirmed. Mirror-like nacre. Even here. Even here. I don't know many places where you get a pearl of that grade. No, you, and you see that one there. I didn't select that specially. It kept, I used them all in order and I took as many as I needed f from the strand in the necklace and that's what I was left with. And Yvonne, you know, that one just be, when they're singled out like this, uh -huh. it looks so, you so fully different. appreciate. You could, yeah, yeah. You, you wouldn't go far wrong, you know, if you, if you made five single pendants, mm. uh, well, however many, no, I don't know why I said five, uh, individual pendants out of them. Well, it's, it's, it's got to be a pro. It's got to be a huge profit if you do individual. Well, pendants. yeah, the recording's got eleven. So eleven. Yeah. Um, well, well, again, we saw strands um, um, in, in Tucson, but we didn't see many. Most no. of your fireball or brock pills were sold in. You know those little uh, those white little containers. Cases, yeah. Yes. They were sold like that yeah. individually. Yeah. And they weren't. They were a huge price tag. I suppose even so. You then. couldn't touch them. You could just view yeah, them. Yeah. Exactly. Perfectly protected. Mm -hmm. We have 40 available opportunities, or rather we had. Let's go through those five virtues once more. Mm -hmm. Size, these are huge. Incredible. I'm gonna say at least, anything double, I mean, anything double figure over 10 mil is very, very rare. And it'll probably most likely be one pearl per mollusk. Mm -hmm. Most freshwater pearls, there'll be multiple pearls in a mollusk, whereas of this, scale, of this size and this scale, it'll probably be one pearl. So you have what? In excess of 13 mil, 13 by 18 millimeters. There might be what, sorry? Some of the biggest that we've mm. had with this color, yeah. So size, tick shape well these are brock pearls stroke fireball pearls are some of the most sought after yeah. in the industry at the moment then we start talking about color well you can't go wrong these are totally natural they're not dyed they're not bleached they're not um, um treated in any way shape that's natural so that's rare in itself it's unbelievable isn't it to look at them and think that's, yeah. that's how they arrive in the world not many uh, mollusks will produce this color not many mollusks no. at all are they normally white? Normally. Normally, yeah. Normally. Um, if you remember when we first started introducing coloured pearls here at, uh, here at Jewellery Maker, um, and we were discussing the fact that many of these sort of sashes of purple, it'll be where the, the, the depth of colour in most, most mollusks is on the circumference. So if you think about something near of this opening, size, yeah, near it? the opening okay. where, it's, where it narrows down, something of this size uh -huh. forming there. Very, yeah. very, very rare. We're not stopping here. We've got the whites to bring you to. Let's do. Look at that. Then we spoke about Nacre. Then we spoke about that luster. We are no way near done. £499. And we're still not done. Over allocated, but I'm not, not done anyway. You're over allocated, are you? No, not at all. There's only 40 available opportunities. It's so difficult to source pills like this. So difficult. That's why, predominantly, if you're lucky enough to see them, like last night, I tuned into Gemporia last night. There's what there was one pearl like this on a pendant. Really? One pearl. You didn't get full strands. No. You don't. You know. And by the way. 
Um, that was in the yeah. That was quite a considered piece of jewellery. It wasn't. It wasn't inexpensive. At four hundred and ninety nine pounds for the caliber of the pearls. The cat. Look at the look at that strength of colour. Look how mirror like they are as well. You can't stop looking at them. No, actually. you can't. They're hypnotisingly beautiful. I mean, I, I, that came. It came home, and I opened the box, and I just could not believe my eyes. Truly. Avon, that's that, that, It's just perfection. Oh, it's so beautiful. And I love this piece as well, where you've got that amazing precious metal, the, the, the sort of asymmetry of it, of your design. £299 only, jewellery makers. Plus, you also have your split payments on this one. Again, I, I, can't, I, I, I can't bring you, I can't bring you really much better than what's on your screens right no. now. Not without spent, offering maybe the hundreds of thousands of pounds that we were just <laughs> describing. Now, the best thing though, jewellery makers, and all of those of you that have already made your confirmations, those of you that are waiting, all around the world, by the way, is that is still not your masterclass price. This next price crash though, half the stock's gone. Please don't wait. And I make no apology about the fact that come the end of this uh, uh, this show, half hour, if there's any of these left, both the, the natural colors, mm. the pinks, or the pure white, so I'll be all over So them. hard to choose between them. It'd be amazing together if your budget allows. Yeah. Amazing together. Yeah. Good luck to each and every single one of you. Look at that, those wonderful ripples, those beautiful folds. Again, totally natural. It's incredible here, isn't it? Amazing here. 50% of the stock gone, but everybody will pay that final low. Well done, Lynn. Well done, London. Well done, Devon. Swansea multi-buying. Um, there's so many of you there. Wendy, Cumbria, Jeanette, Alison, Wiltshire. Make sure you're ready to check out your baskets because these are going to fly. It's not, it would have been amazing here at 299. We could have had it, it was amazing at 499. Let's be honest, Ross, it was amazing at 2,900 something. This is madness though. See that one? It's an amazing price for that one pendant. <laughs> I, I, I was amazed at how pretty that looked when I finished because compared to the other one, it was so simple and, and quick to make, but it just looks outstanding, doesn't Beautiful. it? Beautiful. So look at that. Look at the mirror light luster all the way from, even from meters yeah. away, you can see that beautiful luster. They are amazing. you can see them amazing. better on the skin than yeah, on you the can. board, can't you? You can. Um, get these home. You'll, you'll fall in love with them head over heels. Honestly, yeah. it's one of those, uh, yeah, those won't regret it pearl opportunities that I will remember um, moving forward. Now, we have got the white to bring you. There are lots of you on the phone lines. So much so, I think our... Um, um, Oh, there, I can see you all there. Um, there, make sure you check out your baskets, everybody. Um, there's 40, or rather there were. Massive congratulations. We're gonna allow the call center to catch up because there is loads. Um, and I will be bringing you the white one shortly. Um, remember as well, with your masterclass project, you also get the amazing instructions oh, and yes, demonstrations um, from lovely Yvonne. So we're gonna be talking about that and this, this piece that you're gonna get the uh -huh. tutorial for. Yeah. So um, Yvonne, take it away okay. look at these oh my goodness <laughs> can you believe it I they're mean, amazing that one is just I'd, I'd put that on its own i think if yeah I was, if i was doing it amazing um right there's a bit of a story of, about why i'm i'm showing this demonstration i was talking to a friend um just a few days ago and we were talking about pearl knotting mm -hmm. and she said um but i don't I am not able to go through pearls twice. Um, I, I don't want to ream them. I haven't got a reamer. Mm. And I, I hadn't thought about mm. it before because normally I use uh, French wire and, um, and I ream the pearl, the, or the first or second, per, first and second maybe, and take the cord through twice. So I thought, well, um, I'll start off by um, using the clots or yes. clamshells, which you don't need to go through, because no. uh, there must be lots of people out there like that, they don't want to go through the pearls twice. So uh, I'm going to make a start by by doing that. So and you get this silk as well, don't you? You get, the, you get the silk, and actually the silk comes with the pearls we've just uh, been showing um, and this is what was left over but f first of all um, just start by 
giving your silk a little stretch like that. I've done this because I've used it before. Um, so what I'm going to start with is the clot. Now at the beginning you take your needle through from the inside through the hole in the center and bring your silk through. Now I've tied a knot on the end of this. Um, you can try one knot, two knots. In fact, I um, I didn't realise Susie was doing it yesterday. I noticed Susie was doing it and she put a crimp bead inside. Yes. Which is also a really, really good idea. So any of those suggestions you, you can use. Now, um, I've got a pair of um, tweezers here. You can go to the thicker part of your tweezers and, and squeeze it together if you, if you want to. Or, oh, actually, going taking a step back, if you want to put a dab of glue in there, then uh, this is the time you do it before you close up the clamshell. So I'm going to use a, just a pair of um, flat nose pliers just for speed, and, and it's as simple as that. They go together so, so easily. And you wait for the glue to dry, and then you would cut off that extra little bit of thread that's showing. Now, um, another, <laughs> another uh, explanation about the way I, I've um, um, done, done this pearl necklace. You, ca you can stop at the pearl stage and you can um, use it as a bracelet. Just don't connect it, don't connect it to a connector. Okay. You can just stop at, uh, when you've done all the pearls, uh, enough to fit around your wrist, add the clasp and you've, and you've don't need to go any further if you don't want to uh, but I wanted to separate these out because they're so beautiful in their own right I wanted to separate them out more than with a knot with a knot yeah um, but I wanted the drape <gasps> of not just putting in a space bead yeah so I wanted the drape of a knot but I wanted more than a knot separating yeah, them. Yeah, that makes sense. So basically what I did was I used space beads and knots. So I started off by putting a space bead on first. When you little tinker, get through. It's been a tinker. Well, I've used this needle before, so it's a bit, a bit crooked at the end. There we go. So then I have put on my first, and this is all in the, the description, uh, all in the PDF there. So move everything out of the way. So you need, just to do the pearl knotting piece, you need very, very little material. Now for my first knot, so what I did was, I did uh, a knot, a spacer bead, another knot, and a pearl. Would and you like just me to slide that round? Repeat kept repeating that there you go so here yeah so it, it's a it's a knot a pearl a knot a space a bead a knot a pearl and so on yeah. all the way around mm -hmm. so I think it just separates them out so nicely uh, now um, just the normal overhand knot that I normally do I use um, I use tweezers to do my knots but you, you don't have to, you can do it in your preferred way. If you prefer to use an awl, then you can do. Uh, but to use a pair of tweezers, you take the um, as close up to the spacer bead as you can. Um, you take the thread that's coming out of the spacer bead through the loop that you've made and you just pull it tight, like that. Then what I like to do is that's just sprung open on me obviously uh, what I like to do is then just drag the knot very very closely up to your pearl or your space bead whichever it is you're using then next we come to the beautiful pearls where's my other end here we go I've got too much thread here really so then well, the next thing you do is go through Where's the hole? Go through the beautiful pearl. Look at that pearl. That's incredible, isn't it? They're stunning. Come on, needle, don't let me down. 
They work very hard, don't they, these needles? They when do. you use them for more than one project. <laughs> get a bit wibbly wobbly but you can always cut the end off if it gets too bad yeah so shorten them yeah so there we've got our first spacer bead a knot a pearl we're going to do another overhand knot exactly the same mark was talking about that as long as the the actual needle on your silk is uh, is longer than the gemstone that you're knotting it doesn't matter if you cut them down no it doesn't not at all yeah. no not at all so then we do exactly the same we except we hold it up tight next to the uh, next to the pearl give it a little ratchet take the tweezers out ah oh. pull it up tight and uh, and so on Look so at that. perfect shall i shall i do some more have we got yeah, time go on, yeah. okay so then it, we literally just follow the same pattern now we just put on a spacer bead. And I'm not, I think I've not used this method before where, we, where I've used a spacer bead and a knot. And I think it, it's a really, really nice effect. Yeah, um, it's given the, the I, pearls yeah, even more I use, space, yeah, aren't they? I usually use either a knot or a spacer bead, but I shall certainly use this again because I think it's lovely the mm. way it's spaced. So we've got to do another overhand knot. There we go. And once you get into the rhythm of this, it goes really quickly. So we hold in the tweezers the silk that's coming out of the space bead. Pull it tight. You will do it slower and more carefully than this than I'm doing, uh, but I've obviously haven't got all the time in the world and then slide slide that up to your spacer bead and then you're ready to put on your next pearl now at the end what you do is you get your other clamshell collot this time you don't go in through the the top you go in through the back and i'll show you how I knot this as well using the tweezers. So have we got any of those clamshells? Because we've had ever such a oh, lot on lately, haven't we? Um, because I love those. Yeah. And they make such a difference. They are so good. Mm. Um, Adam was just trying to be Ross then, pretending to be Ross. You sounded more like Liam. You sound. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds more like Liam than he does Ross, doesn't he? <laughs> yeah. Right. So uh, obviously I've only done one here, but just to show you how it works. So you go in from the other side on this, then you do your overhand knot. But th at this point, you take your tweezers and you actually take your tweezers. Let me see if I can go which way I can go so that you can see what I'm doing take your tweezers right inside that clamshell like that so, no 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 don't go around the back right so because you're using your tweezers you can actually pull that knot tight which you can't with just using your hands no so you pull that tight in there do exactly the same thing. Do your second knot if you if you choose to, or put your crimp bead on, another dab of glue, close it up, and then you can take it from there. So you can either leave it as a bracelet, as mm. I said. Um, I have I have described in the PDF how to how I made the connector. And I've also described how I just do the two. Oh, it's a three page. I know, well, there's quite a lot of instructions. <laughs> but I you. have pointed out where you can stop for the bracelet. Um, if you want to make the, you see, you don't ha even have to make your own connector. We sell beautiful connectors. We sell lovely decorative big jump rings. So you don't have to make your own. And that does look quite substantial, that connector. But actually, once you've 
punched a big hole out of the middle yeah it yeah. actually saves you a lot of silver yeah, to be yeah. fair and then the rest is um, I've used six millimeter outer diameter jump ring so there's Just actually two in two. multiple techniques in this yeah. one, in, in this one I had to put a technique so I put pearl knotting because that's basically what I started with yeah and if you stop at the bracelet that's the method you use but you, but you can elbows. continue if you want to so I've tried to take you through each stage amazing Yvonne you are wonderful you really are absolutely amazing you can see again the list of what you will need um, now you get these instructions alongside uh, um, alongside the purchase of your project and um, that's available upon dispatch of your order um, when you go to your order history and then it'll say download content you can either save it or you can print it off whichever you wish but actually there's lots of techniques do you know what I would do when I was getting this back because I always talk about making a catalog of yeah. these instructions I put pearl knotting and this and that and yeah. this because you've actually yeah. got lots of techniques I wasn't sure there. whether whether I just had to use one technique Criticism, my darling. <laughs> so no, I went. went I'm if, just saying, Yvonne's yeah. got so much knowledge. It's a, it's in three pages <laughs> there. Um, now, stock update on these pearls. I'm right. How many nine? Oh. So if your name is Zoe, Helen, Maker, Eunice, Anne, Nicolette, Sorry, Fun Me, Peter and Sharon. Uh, Lynn, Cumbria, Fife, James, Susan, or Oxfordshire. Oxfordshire. I've got nine left. That's it. Once they're gone, they're gone. Go, go, there was go. only 40. And, and genuinely, I don't mind saying this, uh, my personal opinion is these are some of the best pills you've seen here at Jewelry Maker. You won't, you won't regret it. You'll be, you'll be delighted when the you open the box. The luster is unbelievable. Absolutely Beautiful. unbelievable. Um, well done, everybody. And these are that natural pink. So here they are. Look at the split payment. 38 what's that 39 pounds 80 and the clasp as well is absolutely beautiful yeah. do you know i think we've taken inspiration here from charlie because charlie used to do those clasps did he but smaller what do you reckon that clasp would be it's got to be nearer 50 pounds hasn't i it? reckon so i would have thought the quality so. of the clasp is if, making up yeah, at least if i was making a special price. piece for someone and i wanted to buy a special clasp I wouldn't expect to pay less than that, would you? No, because look how well craft, crafted this I is. Obviously, it'll be easier to use I mean, when you've it got it knotted. Yeah, it is actually, yes. But look, you basically feed it. Can you imagine that's a whale? Oh. Um. <laughs> oh. It is. The... It's eating the fishy. Look! <laughs> how beautiful that clasp is and it's not small so if you've struggled no. with clasps it's in the substantial. past yeah. much easier to actually get hold of yeah because you haven't got a, a tiny little bit to pinch with no if, if you've got long nails you've got something to get hold of when yeah. you squeeze it haven't you absolutely so comes with the velvet box comes with the silk comes with the beautiful clasp comes with these amazing pearls uh, Manchester's just snapped up to Susan June Barbara London Davinia Pamela Wendy Cumbria Jeanette Alison uh, Swansea, Janice, Devon, Maker in London, Jane. Um, oh, there's loads of you there for the final four. I'll leave those with you. But I want. I, I'm. I'm so excited about these pearls. I don't. Normally, I have to say, I'd normally gravitate towards the pinks. So I love them both. If your budget allows, do it. Do it without hesitation. Um, they're just the brightest that I've ever seen. Incredible. Ever Absolutely seen. Absolutely incredible. So you get your silk. This is as rare as hen's teeth yeah. as well, the white silk. Yeah, I was just going to say it comes with a different colour just to match. That's as rare as hen's teeth. Hang on. I you... love natural silk. Me too. You get the same clasp. Huge. You get... Wait a minute. Get the box. So if you do only want to take it to the bracelet stage, you've got That's your presentation box as well. But I'm just going to get my a piece of paper. And if this not, is you've got it for a, in another future project. use. Yeah, yeah, another project. Yeah. Right, check this out. Again, let's go through each pearl because they are incredible. Ready? When we talk about lustre, can you see that mirror-like luster that I was referencing? Gosh, you can, that's certainly showing up on the screen, isn't it? They are absolutely incredible. Now, let's get down. Really, Ross? 
get down to Borg in town. <laughs> <laughs> it is Borg in town. <laughs> Look at the quality of the pearls. Every single one. Just incredible. Look at this. Sorry, I've gone all squeaky. It's because you've got that full, I don't know if you can see it on the screen, but there's a full spectrum of color because of the luster, the thickness so of rainbow, the nacre. It's a rainbow, isn't it? Yes. Oh, look at that. What are those really beautiful fish with the, with the, with the fluffy tails? It looks like one of those. Look at this. In one minute, jewelry makers, we're gonna take this even lower. Just absolutely amazing. There's 40 available. If there's any of these pearl projects left, I shall be joining you on it because they are true. That one's amazing. Truly, truly incredible. Ticking every single one of your five virtues. If you want to make a single pendant and earrings, you are spoiled for choice if you want to hand pick them, aren't you? Yeah. I'm just singling that because I like the shape. It reminds me of yeah. this. Is it one of those Japanese fighting fish? They're very beautiful, oh, yes, aren't they? Yes, yeah. It looks a little bit like that. Look how amazing. But again, the folds of beautiful Nacre. 22 seconds, jewellery makers. We are taking it lower. Look at the quality of them. Do you know, I don't even mind if earrings don't match, if they're not no. identical. It doesn't matter, does no, it? No, I agree. I agree. That's the joy. It That's really the... is. That's what I feel too. Good luck, everybody. The white, I, I mean, just, I've never seen that colour. That brightness, that thickness that mirror light luster. We're going even lower. Good luck to you all. We've got 40 or rather we had, without even looking at the core screens, I'm gonna guess these, that's amazing. Absolutely amazing. I'd pay that for one of those pills. £149. I would pay uh, that for one. Actually, I don't think that was the price you told me this morning when we came in. No, it is, <laughs> no, you're right, it isn't, it isn't. Um, it's unbelievable. <laughs> it is lower. You're right, it is Erebon. Lower. It is lower. You are right. It's Ross. He's a tinker. Uh, he's a tinker. Yeah. A rascal, some he's, might say. He's going to get himself into trouble. Oh, my goodness me. Look at the quality of these look pearls. Look at those. We had 40 available opportunities. You get the instructions as well, everybody. Plus, you can get hold of this on your 0% interest. Do you know if you sell that box is perfect for that for the presentation and the photograph there isn't it yeah perfect there's 10 of them left everybody there you all are amazing i'm not surprised they've gone nuts lynn's got hers london's got hers jeanette uh janice london pamela devon's got two manchester um getting two also marion allison well done to you karen you've got yours cumbria getting two mary uh susie uh margaret agnes helen alice oh. alan and new customers patricia i'm not surprised that's our susie it is <laughs> i'm not surprised though I'm not surprised in the slightest. They Look at the quality incredible. of the pearls. They are incredible. Where's that one? I'm just. I, You've I, got I, your favourite. I have got a favourite. I'd turn this one 100% into a single pendant. I think it's that one. I don't know. There's loads on here, to be fair. It wasn't that one, was it? That's the thing. There's that many beautiful pearls. So many pearls. favourites. Yeah, that one looks like that one of those fish, doesn't it? The Japanese does, fighting yeah. fish. Amazing. You were showing those to me, I think, what, either the last time I was in or very, very recently. <laughs> <laughs> clearly, clearly, it, was, it was on clearly air. Clearly, I have an obsession with fish that I didn't know about. I can't remember why we was were I talking. Was showing you those yeah, fish? We, we must they were have been fish. selling. We were, oh, we were selling a fish. <laughs> We were selling a jadeite fish, weren't we? <laughs> they are beautiful fish, though. <laughs> fish are beautiful. Look what you've started me on no, now. it was a fluorite fish. It was a fluorite fish. That's the lie. I don't it just... A, no, it wasn't <laughs> randomly showing me No, fish. there was a story <laughs> behind it, Adam. Amazing, <laughs> amazing, amazing. <laughs> Truly beautiful. Well done. Oh. Um, we only had a couple of those left. <clears throat> Now, I tell you what we're gonna sneak in, and, and, and again, this is a bit sneaky, um, because we're not meant to repeat anything from the eight o'clock hour. However, we did yesterday, didn't we, Ross? 
We did. We did. And the day before that. Mm. Um, but that's because there are certain opportunities. If we've got quantity and they're so beautiful, I'm going to assume on the weekend you have a little bit of a lie-in. Some of you, anyway. And if you did have a lie-in, then you might have missed out on this opportunity. And we're going to repeat it because it was also, also look insanely beautiful with the Vons projects. Now, these will... I've got 40 left. Oh, totally whoa. natural. Four millimetre black spinel. Uh, just amazing. It is that ultimate red carpet glamour, isn't it? When I get the chance to see them close up this time. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> They're gorgeous. Uh, and I guess we shouldn't really have favourites. However, of all the black gemstones, black spinel is always up there as my favourite. Do you know, uh, on, that, on the necklace that I've made, I did an, a knot, a space, a bead, a knot. You could do a knot. A, spinel. a black spinel nice. and another knot and that was really highlighted. Now you're talking, loving yeah. that, absolutely loving that. Again, they look amazing with those pearls. Um, I've got 40 of these left, everyone, but they're too beautiful to not recap effectively. Um, and I don't think many of you will just be getting the one of them because I also remember quite vividly, Ross, what you took these two this morning. Um, we'll do it in one price crash. Let's just say he's a tinker. <laughs> there it is. Nine pounds and ninety nine pence for good a, size as well. Yes, you could literally just do that, couldn't you? Yes. Turn them into simple bracelets. Absolutely. So beautiful. Maybe one of your uh, elephant charm uh, spaces oh, that we had I earlier love on, those that or we some had of on your earlier. some of your Sleeping Beauty. Oh. That would be nice oh, as well, wouldn't yeah, it? Yeah, with one of those little connectors. Look at that. There was forty available. Um, yeah. A frenzy on the phone lines already. Well done, uh, Sarah, Kathy, Margaret, getting three. Angela, well done to you, Barbara, Marion, Alison, Maureen, Karen, County Antrim, Christine. Hello to you all. Uh, Fun me in Essex. Make sure you are checking out your baskets. Perfect for tassels. Perfect for spacers. Mm. Perfect as an alternative to your knots. Perfect as a standalone gemstone. Absolutely. Oh, yes. Yeah. Sparkle, sparkle. Yeah. Mm. Well, we show that piece of jewellery with Jennifer Allison, don't we? Well, it's a really simple... And I only reference that piece in particular because it's just like one rosary-linked strand. Really, really simple. Um, but it's the black spinel that's a, the, the, the that's star, star of the show. Yeah, one hundred percent. It's on the verge of selling out now. As um, closing the show, we're going to do a replay on your three millimeters. So we shouldn't really be doing this. The eight o'clock hour. The reason why they're as um, on a time restraint is because we take them extra, extra low. However, me, we'll do it anyway. Um, beautiful three mils. Oh, stunning. I'd need them both. I me wouldn't too. be able to choose. No, not me. Mind you, a bit like the pearls. I don't know how people have managed to make a choice. Mm, I'm going to leave it um, down to our jewellery maker audience to decide which, which one you're get. having. <laughs> yeah, it's, it'll all be down to terms of availability, I think. Yeah. Um, look at those. Nice. Again, faceted to perfection. Here's, I've just noticed the location of these. So you can get Thai Sapphire, for example, Thai Ruby. Um, did you know that Thailand is one of like the faceting global hubs of the world? We used to deal a lot directly really? in Thailand. Yeah, it's estimated that like, a, I think it's like 90% of the world's Ruby and Sapphire will go through Thailand at some point. Even if it's not mined there, well, it'll be faceted there. For processing. There. Yeah, it'll be faceted there. Um, so I'm not surprised that these are cut to perfection because they have got quite similar uh, similar um, gemological traits, haven't they? Mm -hmm. They're very durable. Absolutely, yeah. Six pounds and 99 pence only. Christine, Kathy, Anne, Sue, Devon, Eunice, County Antrim, Cynthia. We're running out of time this morning. This all, um, all the oh. people who are out doing their food shopping this morning. That's it, they're back now. <laughs> they're all well stocked, feet up. Yeah, lovely. Got a nice cup of tea. And you're going to watch the jewellery maker show back on repeat. Yeah. And it was worth, it was worth watching yeah. back because it's been wonderful today. Um, lovely Yvonne, when are you back with us, darling? Fourth of March. 4th of March. Mm. I don't know if that's No, I don't not. know what day not it sure. is, to be honest. Well, fingers crossed, and we can't wait for anyway um, for that date. Now, I'm back with you tomorrow bright and early. Um, we've got the lovely Natalie joining us as well, so that'll yeah. be wonderful. And an absolute super Sunday, as always. Enjoy the rest of your afternoon. Congratulations on the pearls and yeah, everything we brought you them. today. The giant clam. And I'll see you in the morning. Bye. <laughs>